just got you feeling too much It's feeling too much for you Then all my love is gonna dance with someone Someone that shows love not to If all my love has got you feeling too much It's feeling too much for you Good morning, chat. Welcome to the stream. 
Long time no see. Um, mostly long sleep no see, but uh, w welcome back. It's good to have you all. It's good to be back with some lovely Battle Brothers, of course. Nice. And uh, yeah, back to the experimental build. Very happy to see these bros get a little bit stronger and to see these builds either flourish or die. You never know. Uh, most of these builds seem to be doing okay for the moment, but it's all right. How's the hospital? Oh, hospitals are the worst, man. Hospitals are so freaking boring. And they're just so exhausting. Like, I wasn't even the patient, and I hated it. So, yeah. Yeah. I mean, hospitals are very important. But, yeah. Is the patient okay? Yeah, she's doing fine. She's surviving quite well. And um, she gets to sleep a lot more than I do now, which is good. <laughs> good evening, Knight. Welcome to the stream. And good dragon. Good to see you as well. Uh, emergency snack and entertainment bag packed. Uh, I should learn to do that. Uh, my wife always has a bag whenever she has to go to the hospital, but I don't. But I might have to do that for the next time. <laughs> I was only surviving on a very low battery phone and not much. Not much at all. <laughs> Uh, but the cats, okay, yeah, the cats are fine. They survive. They definitely know what they're doing. Ah, oh, speaking of cats, I need to double check. Do I have a misbehaving cat? Yeah, I thought so. He has his food downstairs, but he doesn't learn that his food is meant to be eaten by him, and Asha's food is meant to be eaten by Asha. It's being very mischievous today. It's such a nuisance. Okay. Anyways, after some scolding is complete, let's get back into it. Uh, so remembering the party, because it's been a little while. Uh, we've got Tina as our lovely tanky damage person. Because uh, we don't actually, I don't think we have a dedicated tank, but I'll have to double check. Uh, Chives is the dedicated tank. Okay, well, we checked on that, but he's level five, so he's newer in this grand scheme of things. Gold hands the evasion assassin with the sprint and the evasion. Uh, Sing is the rebound, uh, Adrenaline. Not too bad. Lutix is the disappointment, but he's actually not a disappointment anymore. He's doing really well. He's a tank. So he's the appointment tank. There we are. Because he's not a disappointment anymore. He's a tank. Is this not the EU run? Wait, I did the wrong one there. There, there. Yeah, the yes mads. This should be the right run. I'm not losing my mind, chat. Don't don't confuse me like that. Snowman Hunters is EU, Experimental Bros is NA. There we go. Good. I, I'm not going insane. I thought I was going insane. But it's all good. No no no, this is the right run. This is the nomads run, which is the yes mads. The experimental run. Yeah. Where's your banner, bro? Um, Right there. He looks great. He's not using a banner because we switched to fight. Uh, why did I give you a blunt weapon? Uh, we were fighting something. And the banner was weak. And the uh, Palamra was better. Yeah. There we go. You got your one year sub badge. Hey, nicely done, Cake. Looks good. Oh, here we are. Rebound Adrenal, uh, Appointment Tank, the Deserter, who is working hard as Cake, but he's new, so hopefully he doesn't die. Actually, he needs a shield, doesn't he? You lost your shield in the last fight. There you go. You'll be fine. Uh, oh, yeah, we we're fighting Skeletons. That's why I gave you the weapon. Yeah, that was hell. Yeah, screw Skeletons. Have a good sleep, Starface. Check the obituary if there's a dead. Yeah, there's, it's a dead run with um, Dormammu. So Dormammu died in this run, unfortunately. He was our lovely woodcutter axe, but uh, he never sadly never got the build. We do have Gobbo, though, which is our sickle build. Uh, Starface is the banner who is going to sprint. Uh, Mandy is the runaround gunner who's doing really well. Wrong run. How is this the wrong run? This is the right run. Because Snow Hunters is versus the Snowman in day 135. This is day 63. And this is the Yes Mads. 
Well, Digrin, if you're in the party, I could kill you if you want. Don't think you're in the party. Oh yeah, there you are. I could kill you off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you want me to get you killed, that's fine. I, in the next fight, I'll just t take off all your armor and put you out in the front line. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. It's just, 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 there you go. You don't need a shield in battle. Uh, you don't need your armor. <laughs> Uh, Sword Coast reading Pallius of the Lambo. This is cursed. Damn, it's huge versus small. Very cursed. Hey, Rambits, welcome to the stream, man. The right run because of the mod I worked on. Of course, it's the streams I can't watch. Hey, welcome, welcome. Oh, yeah, that's right, with the Snowman mod. Yeah, that was, that's the other streams. Don't worry, it's, it's, we've done a lot of those, and there'll be more Snowmen in the future, hopefully. It'll just probably be a staple added to our mod list. Hmm. Uh, so Wolfang is our unarmed somewhat build. We're still figuring it out, but I want to get Tackle in there. Uh, Diagrin's the dodge tank with... I don't remember his gimmick. Oh yeah, he's going dodge medium. That's right. Uh, Wingate's brand new, going for sling, throwing, and helping. GB's got the dehabilitation, which I've not used very much, but the piercing arrow we've used a bit. And then Dormammu is back in the team because he died but got a new name. And he's the one-handed or hammer duelist, because I never use those. Never use them. Okay, so with that all out of the way, glad we reminded ourselves of what's going on. It's been a while. And uh, there's the nameless spinner. You guys can join in. And let's get the bingo up. Good old bingo. Anything good? Uh, there's a few options there. What's up? Okay, thank you very much for the tea, dear. We got hockey back this week, so we may as well have the hockey tea. Yeah. Best hockey mug in the world, eh? It's perfect. Now I just gotta wait for the tea to cool down. <laughs> I should bring her tea instead. Yeah, I probably should. She should be resting, though. But I appreciate it. I already got who's in the team. Damn, you need to sleep. Trace this, trace this goodness of me, man. Go to bed. <laughs> Go to bed, my good man. Pour a spin out for the homies. Chat, this one's for you. I Quick it was on the fingers. Dang, nicely done, Infernal Red Panda. Let's get a spin going, and let's see what we get to start the stream. Hopefully something good. Something fantastic. It's a yellow. Oh my goodness. What a start. Good thing the script's working today. It's working great. Beautiful. Beautiful. So, what would you like? What would you like, my man? Hello, Kaisener. Welcome to the stream. Mr. Snow, indeed. Lots of yellow options. Uh, I think I have a bit of salvage to do. Because the team does need to repair. So let's put these on salvage, shall we? Mm-hmm. Don't worry, it's Levin. thanks for the reset with Prime for 11 months, almost on that subversary. Thank you so much for the support. Glad you're enjoying. Glad to hear it. Uh, but uh, where is Mr. Infernal Red, Red Panda? You gotta tell me what you want, my man. You need a weapon, armor, helmet, or a shield, or a perk point for somebody. So, yeah. Disable the spin, or the Drazus will stay up till he gets to spin. I mean, it won't take him too long, but I'm pretty sure he'll try. I can't control him, but that is a sneaky way to try and handle the Drays this. <laughs> if he wants sleep badly enough, he'll get his sleep. If. If. See, not a fan, I just had my room to test run 500 inventory half full with only shinies. Yep, and that does worry me slightly because of uh, how generous our lovely uh, Abyss Crane loves to be. Because whenever Abyss Crane's generous, you know he's scheming something. He's like, oh, have all this loot. Don't mind the loot. It's great. Just ignore the fact that I'm sending, like, infinite bosses against you. Just ignore that. Yeah? Okay. We have a deal. 
Yeah, yeah, I know you, Abyss. His generosity is a little bit underlying there. Just a little bit. <laughs> we need to slaughter 100 champions? Yeah, exactly, exactly. We know him too well. We know him way too well. Okay, so... Uh, Infernal Red Panda's not speaking up, so I may as well have to do it for him. So, I guess I'll choose. Fair enough. Yellows are lovely to choose. So, um, hmm. I need to get this inventory em emptied out a little bit, so let me just take a second to clean out the inventory. Mm -hmm. There we go, there we go. Everybody works on that. One person works on the here. Yeah, there's no healing. Okay. Clean up the salvage, clean up the inventory, and then I will probably... Probably go for a weapon, that's what I usually go for. It's not a bad choice. Okay, there's probably still a bit more to do, but at least the inventory is going to be empty. Yes, yeah, somewhat empty. Okay, we save. And let's have a look. Oh, uh, we needed a one-handed weapon, we probably need a two-handed weapon. We probably need a reach weapon. Um, yeah, I think weapon's a good choice. Interesting. Minus three fatigue on a cleaver. I like it. I don't like the whip, though. So I think we've got to stick with a cleaver and somehow work with this. It's got good durability. No bonus damage, though, which makes me sad. But fatigue could be a solution there. So let's keep this bad boy. The Clovis Ubermensch War Cleaver. That's the way to do it. That reminds me of Uber. Yeah, definitely. Probably his his one for sure. Uh, Tina. Should I give it to Tina? 86 attack. With 10 fatigue times 2. Wait, Tina's got rebound. Tina doesn't need it. No, Tina's fine. Uh, Chives is a tank without rebound. How much does this cost? 9. Mm hmm. Gold hand is going sword. Sing is fine. Lunatics. Hmm. Cake can't go. Diagrin can't go. Cleavers. Wolfang is going unarmed. Oh, we could go unarmed cleaver. Hmm. Tackling with a cleaver could work. Probably wants to go dodge as well because he needs his defenses up. One handed hammer duelist. Okay. Um. Could also be Chives. Chives doesn't have good accuracy, though. See, Lunatics already has rebound, so he doesn't need it. So I think I think this could be Wolfang's weapon. Yeah, it could be. Snow turn it on. I turn it off. So oh, Jerry's this turned off the spins, you sneaky. I was like, I didn't turn off spins. What are you talking about? <laughs> yeah, Drazus is being sneaky with the spins. Trying to hoard him for himself. It's mod abuse, I say. But uh, welcome, Cookies. How was the hospital visit? Ah, oh, it's horrible. Eh, it takes too long in Australia for the public system sometimes. But sometimes, on random occasions, the hospital visits are quick. But it's just the long visits that are the worst. But I'm still technically alive. <laughs> no, 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 don't worry. It's lemon. <laughs> and Drazus deletes Tigrid's message of mod abuse. Kick him. <laughs> He's trying so hard. Just did what Tigrid wanted. Saying thanks for the resub at tier 3 for 28 months. Holy crap, thank you so much for the crazy good support. Over and above. Much appreciated. Snow, I have something of great importance. And, uh... I, Snowbot must now let you know. Very glad to see the 28 months coming in. Um, okay, <laughs> deleting his redeem. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Smo, you disappoint me with your fallout knowledge. <laughs> and I didn't warm up Snowball yet, so it used the last one. Oh, goodness me. And you gotta keep it English, because I can't understand what you're trying to say, <laughs> Trace this, uh, Digrin. With the, um... I mean, it's gonna probably work. 
Let me have a check. It's probably gonna work. Because there is the um, multilingual. Oh, wait, maybe it's not gonna work. It can't read it. See, that's the problem. You gotta put English in there. It makes it easier. Yeah, Snowbot can't read what you put in there. It's been chilling for sure. But. <laughs> It just doesn't work. I'll give it back to you, though. Uh, let's change this. Oh, man, I gotta clean up all these requests. It's been a while since I've cleaned them up. Okay, so then, there you go, Diagram. That's for you. Complete the rest. Yeah, and that's sorted. Okay. Yeah, does it do Dutch? Um, let me double check. It does a lot of language. Like it, the thing is, hear me out. It does do Chinese, and it does do probably Japanese. But you got to remember that it's got to read the characters, and it has some issues here and there reading the characters. So let me go and double check the actual. Where is it? And uh, da, 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 da. no, not that. No, not that. There we go. That's what I'm looking for. And I checked to Voltilingual 2. It does do Japanese, Chinese, German, Hindi, French, Korean, Dutch. It does do Dutch. Yeah, there's a lot of the ones that it does, including Dutch. We've played around with a bunch of the languages previously, and it's just tricky. Because it doesn't always read the characters right. Like punctuation marks. Uh, I think it's quotation marks or something it didn't like at one time. I don't know. It's weird. Does it do Polish? I don't... I don't know. Let me check again. Uh, yes, it does do Polish. It does. Okay, let's stop getting too distracted. And remind myself what I was doing. Uh, which was the cleaver. There we go. Okay, so Wolfang's not a bad choice for this. Because uh, he actually has 67 attack. I'll probably... give him a shield. It's probably not a bad idea. 29 defense is sitting him roughly on terms of side people. Cake's gonna be a frontliner. Diagrin's a tank, so we can probably do it like this. That kind of works. Dormammu needs some armor, which we don't have too much of. But wait a minute, we kind of do now. Okay. Uh, Wolfang can go here with the 9 fatigue attack. Seems fine. Was the check if something bad happened with the hospital? Uh, my wife is unwell every now and again. And uh, they had to just look after her. But she was discharged this morning, and she's recovering. She's fine. She don't think she has to go back anytime soon, which is a good thing. Definitely a good thing. Trash Bros would die first round of How fights I did today. Of course they would. On? I've had it up to here with the gambling. Dre's this misses out on the spin. You gotta go to gotta go to sleep, man. You gotta go. <laughs> You need your rest, my guy. Okay, let's put all these lovely tier threes onto the bros. Golden Wingate, there we go. And then we got a golden star phase. And who else is missing out? Is that everybody? It's Chimes has the really cool. Is that the tier one? Yeah, that's the tier one. So then he goes tier three as well. Yeah, rude words. <laughs> Trace this time down tiger. <laughs> Oh, the fight. The fight continues. Okay, um, Crested Gladiator Helmet's really good. I heard a spin. Digrin got a spin in. So, nicely done, man, but I'll get that in just a second. Uh, 150, 135. Who's got a weak helmet on the front lines? That would be Goldhand. There we go. That's going to make him a bit better as he tries to be evasive and nimble. Nice, nice, that's worth it. 
Uh, let's get a tier two onto Dormammu. Tier one, tier two is not super amazing, but that's okay. Uh, we can get to 135. Let's get a tier one onto Mandy to get to 140. Uh, that's about it. Not much more I can do in terms of armor. The one thing I can check, though, is what we wanted to check out before was, uh, can we make the really cool undead item? Oh. Fur padding. We can make it for padding. Snow, I have something of great importance. And I don't think we can. I, Snowbot must now let you know. I don't, it might not work. It might not work. I don't think you can read it. <laughs> Wait. Can't decode the character. It, you keep giving it characters that can't decode. You gotta go with English, man. And you're giving it... I told you this. Oh, you gave it a quotation mark. Nah, it can't do it. It's not gonna work, man. I'll, I'll refund that one for you, but if you don't do English in the next time, I'm not gonna refund it. Because it's just not liking anything but English. Yeah, it's just... It goes to a text document, and if the text document doesn't allow it to be read properly, it doesn't like it. Yeah. English is boring. Yeah, well, that's the language we speak here, unfortunately. <laughs> Snow only speaks American. <laughs> well, not technically true, but thank you. It's close, close. Uh, let's go with always. What am I missing? What am I missing? No, I'm not written you. Um... See, here's the reason as to why I don't really make the undead helmets. Because it always asks for a stupid one you don't get. Here we are. What do you mean, Ancient Legionary? How do I not have that helmet? I swear I have that helmet. Ancient Sidehawk. Oh, I don't have the Legionnaire one. I got the faceplate, the sidehawk, sidehawk, dome, and then I've also got the beaded mask, ancient mask, kettle, and normal dome and conic helm. Okay, so it's a little complicated, but I do have most of them. Hey, ABS, welcome to the stream. Yeah, this, I'd love to be able to make all the cool undead helmets, like the Legionnaire helmet. But getting this ancient Legionnaire helmet seems to evade me almost every time. Maybe I'm just unlucky or it's just super hard to find. Yeah. Okay. Well, what we'll do is we'll quickly craft anyways, because we have a chance to make a lovely white wolf pelt. Uh, white unhold armor attachment. There we go. And we can add that to one of our frontliners, like Tina already has one. Uh, Tribes being tanky could be a good choice. Sing's got some good defenses. Lunatic's nimble, nimble. Is Tribes going medium? Yeah, he's going medium. Wolfang's there, Digrin. It'd be really strong to put it on Digrin. Ah, fine. We'll give it to him. We'll give it to him. What do you think of my idea of controlling the bros of the enemy against you? Oh, that's fun. Yeah, we don't have a mod for that just yet, but if Dre, if, uh, if Abyss Crane's looking into something like that, then yeah. Definitely would be keen. Uh, Amelo, welcome to the stream. Been watching the videos well, found out about Twitch. Glad to hear it, man. And thank you so much for the follow. Glad you're enjoying. Okay, uh, I need to do a little bit more salvage. I need to do a spin. Fudge, I forgot about the spin. Been distracted too much. Digrin, we got a spin for you. 
Abyss is too busy with Rotu? Yeah, of course he's too busy. I didn't expect Abyss to make anything more than what he's doing at the moment. He's a very busy guy. Uh, free heal. Do we need the heal? I don't think we do. I think this team has been surviving. Yep, the team's been fine. So let's respin that. Have a good sleep, Dre. Is this... Uh, random events. Random events do work now. So happy days. Wait. I didn't add the new version to this mod list, did I? Hmm. He said before I paint Decker. <laughs> I love how Drazus always says, oh, good night, goodbye, lurk, all that kind of good no, stuff. I have something of great importance that I, Snowbot, must now let you know. Okay. I don't trust that one, but maybe it'll work. It might be okay with French. Small, you disappoint me. No, that's the wrong one. It takes a moment. Can't handle the mod abuse, I know. Um... Model not found. Snowman voice not found. Okay, that's not that's not a translation fault. That is the AI being incorrect. Okay, so it does that. Whilst I add the mod in, where is it? Dev console 1.91. What are we up to? 1.7. Switch to 1.91. Okay, and then that's going to work so I can get events working. There we go. And now that means Snowbot AI is going to work because you only put in French, which is pretty simple in terms of characters. And it should work. Les anneaux ne sont pas des cercles Sour TM, ils ont quatre coins. Car alors les rectangles sont, mais pas non, ce nécessairement des carreaux cis. Voici aussi également des gros mots à propos de Drazetis, car ils gorent les abus de Moda. It's probably really bad. <laughs> I mean, I totally can speak French, chat. Totally. It's great. It's perfect. Ah, uh, you've never heard better speaker in your life. <laughs> you guys hate it? Hey. Well, you, you'll, you'll learn to love it. You'll learn to love it. Uh, oh, yay. Free axe, free pelt. Nice event. Very nice. Good. Exploring. Let's save. Uh, fingers. Hmm, that is a gamble moment. Do we get the fingers chat? I, this is a risk. Do we get the fingers? A spin? What? Since when were you guys allowed to spin? French speaker who considers them so fluent. That was great. Oh, thanks, Aiden. Thank you. You're too kind. The accent's good, but pronunciation sucks on some of the words. Yeah, it's 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 the AI um, voice generation thingy. It's it's not great. Translate it. Yeah, I did translate it. It's um. So for those who don't speak French like me, uh, where was it? What Snowbot said was rings are not circles if they have four corners, because then rectangles are, but not necessarily squares. Also, here are some bad words about Trazus as it handles model abuse. <laughs> I, that's supposedly what the translation says. Something like that. Here's French and your British animosity starts kicking in. <laughs> it's the Reds versus the Blues. We got to do it again. It's a little off. Yes, yeah, it's, it's slightly off. The translate on Google is a little weird sometimes. But. Les anneaux ne sont pas des cercles si l'on quatre coins. Car alors les rectangles sont, mais pas nécessairement des carrés. 
Voici également des gros mots à propos de Dras 10 car il gère les abus de mode. See, uh, Google probably did it better than my Snowbot. Probably. Yeah. Um, but anyways, Chad did their predictions. Let's go find the fingers. And we lost them. Of course we did. Of course. I hate it. I hate it. Never freaking do the fingers. Congratulations on getting the no on that shot. You guys are right. Stupid stinking fingers. That's why you gotta always have a thief in your party. They just do such a good job. Uh, and we haven't seen anyone around here, and welcome the s -Mads. Thank you very much. Is he good? He is... Uh, he's alright. He could be good. We can go pickaxe build, because we've not done a pickaxe build. So... That could make him good. And he's gifted. Yeah, for experimental builds, we'll do it. Hmm. Or Cannibal gives him his own fingers. Ah, uh, Butcher. Butcher gives him his own fingers. Or any Butcher-like background can give him his own finger. Yeah. That one works. I don't think Cannibals work with it, but maybe. Hmm. Why is it so formal the way it speaks? I've got no idea. No idea. <laughs> Uh, oh yeah, let's get some helmets on these boys. Okay, so there he goes, and he's got crappy armor, because we only have crappy armor, which is just a base armor and nothing else. Uh, give him a shield. And I have a spare pickaxe, don't I? Oh no, I think I melted it down for parts. Yeah, I melted it for parts. That's fine. Okay, we got a new boy here. We got a new name. Let's see what he is. Mm-hmm. Drasus, you already said good night. <laughs> I'm hearing nothing from you anymore, okay? You said good night, you're asleep. In all intents and purposes, you are not here. <laughs> Welcome home, such as it is. This squalid hamlet, these corrupted lands. Snow, I have something they are yours now. That I snow and you are bound to them. You know. Bound to them indeed. Okay. Great quote. Digrin's using up some more some more languages he's using dutch this time let's hope let's hope it works mm -hmm. there we go that should work Ringen zijn geen cirkels als ze vier hoeken hebben, want dan zijn de rechthoeken wel, maar niet noodzakelijkerwijs vierkante. Hier zijn ook vervelende woorden over Dracetis, omdat hij motmisbruik uitvoert. Pretty much the same thing he said in French. Just in now in Dutch. I'm not sure if it's better or worse. <laughs> but he said it great. He said it great. Okay, we spin. And it's Stefan, who is not in the party. No, he's not. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. Dev tools are turned off. That's good. Um, and this is pickaxe. Actually, we'll do it just stuff from the belted. There we go. Big hole name, and it barely just fits. There you go, man. Snow's a better Dutch speaker than French. Ooh, well, that's nice to hear. I didn't even know it. Glad to hear it. Okay, let's save and get into a fight. We gotta get some fights done today, chat. We can't just constantly be <laughs> teaching new languages all the time. There's the Barbarian King. Oh, that's right, I forgot. That's where we left off. Um, Fudge, how much are they offering? 10 grand, oh my lord. 10 grand. Almost got the crash sound effects there. And now we almost have hello, complaining. Are you good at complaining, Meow Meow? What's up? Yeah, you wanted some attention, didn't you? And you missed us yesterday, didn't you? It was the end of the world. 
end of the world. Only language I speak is stupid, says GB, and he spelt it wrong. <laughs> we love you, GB. Oh, hi. Hello. Are you feeling attention deprived? Is that the word? It looks like she's feeling attention deprived. Papa GB's in the house. Time to regulate the mod abuse. Exactly. Exactly. Except he'll probably just abuse himself with that one. Meow. Yeah. There we go. Okay, so, um, 10 grand chat. Do we think we can do it? I am worried about our DPS. We do have guns. We've got GB himself. Uh, Starface could probably switch back to the banner now. I think that would be okay. It does have a 10% chance to hit, which makes a nice big difference. Uh, Gabo sitting with the hooked blade. Can I upgrade anyone else's weapon? Probably upgrade Sing to the Great Axe. Uh, I'm loving the hammer, but the Great Axe or... Ooh, split Man. Is that better? I mean, it is better than a Great Axe. Can I fatigue-wise do better? I don't know. I don't know, maybe. Help, Jesus is doing mod of use to disable his spins. <laughs> We're abusing the mods, or the mods are abusing. It's both. It's both. Um, Lunatics is doing okay with his weapon. I'm going to try out the man splitter. It might work. If it doesn't, I'm going to be disappointed. But it might just work. 38 to 43. I think Cake will be better with the sword. 30 to 34. 24 to 34. It's a bit more reliable. And it's 10 fatigue versus 12 fatigue. It doesn't have the bleed, but I don't care about the bleed as much. Yeah, that's that's a bit better. The cleaver will give me the bleed if I need to. Um. Yeah, okay, fine, fine. We'll go for the king. I'll save beforehand just in case it's a stupid idea, because it probably is a stupid idea, but we do stupid ideas here. Let's go for the king. Uh, because 10 grand is going to be a very nice payout. Uh, bear scrub in the northeast tundra. Which means here. He spawned here. Most likely. It always spawns him in the closest barbarian encampment to you, and we are not super close to barbarian encampments right now. Also, do I have enough food to do this? Shivers. Get me there before nightfall, please. Good. Uh, you guys are selling food at not the best prices, but not the worst prices. So let's stock up six more days of food. That might give us what we need. That's brigands. Um, wait. Wait, then where's the barbarians? That? That is, yes, yeah, I was right. I was right the first time. It's all good. I'm being oppressed. Yeah, I know, I know. <laughs> Dagger is being currently oppressed. You but are you upset about being I oppressed? Said not to, chat. I swear I'll turn this stream around. Because you said you're being oppressed, but how does that make you feel? We're on his trail. Also, why are there Hickson following us? A little scary, but that's okay. GB, thanks for the spin. Did I miss a spin, though? Wait, maybe I did. I missed Seb's spin. Oh my goodness, I have two spins to do. Sorry, Sev. I did miss it. It's too much chaos going on. I blame I blame Drazus. Completely blame Drazus on that one. Unsubscribe. <laughs> well, it was nice knowing you. Okay, mine's a bad trait. That's kind of nice. Uh, we're sitting on... Who's got a bad trait right now? Uh, the minus vision's not bad. I swear I saw a bad one somewhere. Uh, vision on star phase is not the worst thing in the world. Pugilist is fine. 
Vision on Wingate is a slinger. Oh, wait. Wait a minute. We need to fix the vision on Wingate. Yeah, okay. We need to fix that. Thank you very much. Demand to see the cat. Oh, well, I just need to turn the camera down. There you go. <laughs> yes, yes. You are all the talk, Mal, and you are the main attraction. How could I dare put the camera too high? There you go. There you go. Yes, she is a very cute one. She is very demanding and annoying, but she's also very cute. Yes. Yes, and you would not survive without me. Yesterday was the worst day of your life, because I wasn't in the house. Mm-hmm. You thought we were dead. Yeah, whenever you leave, the cats don't have the object permanent problem, so they're like, oh no, it's the end of the world. It's horrible. You miss cat allergies? Yeah, people who are allergic to cats, I feel very sorry for. Because they're missing out on the cute fluffiness. But then again, they're not missing out on uh, the hay fever and the, you know, the allergies and everything like that. Yeah, so, yeah. All the fluff in their face, they could miss out on. And now she's leaning over and she's being cute. Yeah, hello. Yeah, but I've got to, I've got to do the spin now. I've got to do the spin. Okay, so minus bad trait has been sorted. Just wonderful news. You're allergic as well. Dang, that's unfortunate. My wife gets affected by the fur a little bit, but I don't think she's completely allergic. I uh, don't need the heal. Random events! Hey! Who's happy random events are fixed? I'm happy. Ooh, we get to beat up some kids! Is it on the bingo today? What's on the bingo today? No, there's disguised bandits. There's not even gambling event? Dang it. Alright, let's beat up some kids. Oh my, that's a lot of injuries before a barbarian fight. Ooh, I need to get those fixed. Okay, well we maimed the kids. They kind of maimed us. Those are pretty bad injuries. Um, but we got money out of it. Excavations beneath the manor were well underway. When a particularly ragged indigent arrived in the hamlet. This filthy, toothless miscreant boasted an uncanny knowledge of my ambitions and prognosticated publicly that, left unchecked, I would soon unleash doom upon the world. Doom upon these mimes and uh, our bros getting beaten up. So other than that, some good events. And screw the Hexen, please go away and quickly heal up the team. Oh my goodness, I should not have... We're out of meds? I should not have beaten up the kids. I have made a mistake. Oh boy. Oh boy, indeed. I made a very big mistake. Please tell me they're not chasing us, the stupid Hexen. You're kidding me. We outnumber you, you dumb crazies. Go away! No, we're chasing a barbarian king, a silly hexen. Bring him to the barbs? Yeah, that would be hilarious. My main issue, though, is I don't have... Okay, there we go. Meds. Meds! Yes, 169! Those are the cheapest meds I've ever seen. Thank goodness for that. Okay, let's buy some meat and bread and everything. Buy some tools, even if they're not the cheapest thing in the world. Okay, now I can fix the injuries.
Okay, were those Hexans still chasing me? Okay, don't make me panic, you darn peasants. Okay, injuries are fixed. Um, where am I going? West of me near... Oh, they're over here. Hmm, I wonder where those Hexans went. Boots and pants, meat and bread, meat and bread, exactly. Okay, so I see no footprints. That's not good. Oh! We can teach him! Gobbo wants to be trained by Wolfang. Okay. Um, show him how to brawl. Yeah, there we go. Plus two, plus one. Free permanent stats, Chad. That's the way to go. Perfect. Okay, so the uh, barbarians around about here. Uh, yeah, I could take some assistance for ten grand, Chad. Of course, I'm going to cheese this. Of course, there's no way I'm going to fight lots of reavers. Yes! Got the mercenaries on my side. Gotta cheese it for sure. Okay, um, I think I need to make the prediction. Yep, there we go. Oh, I spelled it wrong. There you go. Okay, chat, prediction's up. Let's do this. Let's do it. It's going to be a cinch with friends like these. But at the same time, it is 22 enemies. So maybe I shouldn't be too cocky. But with the ranged characters, we should be fine. Hopefully. Uh, Diagrin, do we rush them? Hmm. I kind of want those javelins. How do predictions work? Uh, you can only choose one option. And if that option wins, you will get some points depending on how much people spent on other options. If you are incorrect, you lose all your points that you put in. Uh, Lunatics needs to go here. 53. <laughs> Rotate your own dog in. Interesting. Little dog versus big dog. GB. That was nice. Double headshots. Hi, King. What are you doing over there? Having a good time. Uh, Gold hand cannot sprint. Wait, what? Are you telling me there's no literal place my character can sprint to? I can't sprint through allies? That's not a thing? Well, that sucks. Okay, so then I guess I'm going here. How many spins do you guys have to gamble on? I've had it up to here with the gambling. Oh, I forgot about the spins coming off cooldown. Oh, that's right. That might make this interesting. Or it makes it a free kill. We'll take that. Thank you very much, Nighthammer. You're too kind. Um, there's dogs, thralls, a dude under a net. Uh, you can't kill the king because he's a boss. There's thralls, uh, reavers, and is there a chosen? I don't think there's a chosen in this fight. I think it's just reavers. Yeah, it's just reavers. Dealer's choice? Aw, oh, you're too kind. I'm gonna be honest and say that we are doing well, and we have lovely mercenaries at our back. So, I think I kill the southern dog near the king. There we go. Um, the Northern Dogs, they can be dealing with dogs. Southern Dog didn't proc any sadness, so these guys don't care about their dogs. Horrible. Eventually I'm going to spin the Ajirok. Yeah, that's the thing. Eventually. And it's going to be painful. Always is. 
58 sing completely slaps love to see it and adrenaline is going to be good mm -hmm. Dormammu misses which is unfortunate Wingate do we move forward and do we get a seven 17 oh yeah he's level one I forgot about that Bingo, a good doggo dies. Oh no, good doggo means our, our doggo. As in, like, not their doggos. Their doggos are bad doggos. Hmm. So now says he did it to be nice to chat, but really, he doesn't want is the dog stop him on five cents. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, dogs are the worst, and you know it. Oh, and so does Asha. Yeah, dogs are the worst, male. 100%. Okay. He was a good doggo, was he? Was he really? Or are you just trying to say that? I don't know if I fully believe it. Okay, good job, Chives. Uh, Stefan, you stay out of this fight. Cake, you are... Just gonna have to wait for a second, because Tina's gonna go here. Mandy needs to go for the big snipe. Very nice. There we go. That's our good doggo. He was misunderstood by society. <laughs> he chose the wrong team. He chose the losing team. Mr. 95. Great. Great, Starface. You had one job. And that was to get a free kill. On that lovely barbarian thug who has minus 30 defense. Couldn't handle it. I, am I playing the, with the 4 gigabyte patch for memory? Um, You mean for the GOG? No, nah, I'm playing on the Steam version. I should play for memory with the GOG, but I haven't done it yet. I eventually will have to upgrade if I play with more mods, like Abyss Crane, because he keeps making his mods super fat. Hmm. I actually didn't like my hot take about dogs. What do you mean? Cats are not meant to like dogs. That's how it is. Did I just get save rotated? No. That's that's Digrin getting wrecked. He just looks like he's a mercenary. Um, Digrin, would you like to shield wall this? Thank you. Mandy, my good man. Let's, uh... Beautiful gunshot. Thank you very much. Someone donate to Snow for his GOG. Coughs as abyss. Mm-hmm. Because if I have to get the GOG version, I have to pay it all brand new again, don't I? I have to buy all the DLC from start. That's just that's just annoying. <laughs> it's so annoying. I have to buy the game again. Oh, but it's on sale. Oh my goodness, it's 50% off till the next five days on GOG. But it says lowest price in the last 30 days before the discount was $14. It's now on sale for $21. Interesting. So some of it's on sale. Some of it's not. Is there like a... Is there like a, a pack? It says it's a New Year's sale. Huge discount, supposedly. It's not the biggest discount, but fair enough. Totally worth especially for streaming. Yeah, I could hear it. I can hear you for that. Okay, good kill. Give me a couple days on it, says GB. No, 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 it's okay, GB. It's okay. <laughs> Just blame, blame Abyss Crane about it. Just blame him. I wouldn't have to do it if it wasn't for Abyss Crane. Double 95, there you go, gold hand. Good kill, good kill. Uh, then GB, I need to get this kill, please. Thank you very much. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so the only thing that's really threatening us is the king. Everyone else has been... Ooh, 28% for Wingate. Nice to him. GB says totally blame GB instead. <laughs> you just can't, you can't let anyone else be blamed, GB. You just don't let it happen. 
Uh, Wolfang, let's go... Should I go here? It's better than going down there. Let's go for the 61. Ooh, cut arm. Very nice, very nice. Mercenary is doing good. The other dog is dead. Our good dog is still alive. The allied good doggo survives. Stefan, do you want to 1v1 the puppy? Yeah, you go do that, man. You could totally beat a puppy with an axe. I'm sure, that puppy's no match for your axe. Uh, and then Cake could sit here. Unless it gets rotated. We have to worry about that. Nice. Nice. Jeebus says he should have already bought it. No. That's very nice thinking, but no, it's all good. There's an option to link games you own on Steam to GOG. Um, I don't know if linking is the thing that's correct. But maybe, maybe. If it's possible, then that just saves me so much effort. Can you link Steam to GOG? GOG officially ends its Steam Import Connect service after years of inactivity. For a long time, nothing really happened there. GOG's Connect service, which you let users grab a free copy of the game that they already own on Steam, is officially no more. When did they do that? January 12th, 2023. Well, that sucks. Yeah, thanks, GOG. We appreciate it. If you find a solution to avoid buying it, let me know. Yeah, I'll, I'll hopefully find a way, but it seems like they disabled it. Also, Dormammu just got wrecked by javelins. That's not good. That is not ideal. Good gunshot by Mandy again. Eh, here comes the flank. Okay, fair enough. Yeah, linking your games a few years ago. Yeah, you got in while the gettings were good. Oh, Stefan's losing to the dog. I'm sorry. Is that a 15? Yeah, that looks like a 15 to me. Ouch. Luckily, Digrin's a freaking tank. Thank you, Lunatics. Um, so let's go get that king. Hmm. Huh. You're on 11 health. Uh, Goldhand would like to say hello. Thank you very much. Ooh, nice axe. Mr. GB, could you go for a snipe? Okay, the piercing shot didn't work the way I wanted it to. I, I don't like its interactions, but that's fine. Hmm. Digrin's used to being oppressed. A little bit. A little bit. He has, he has definitely gotten used to it. Oh no! My mercenary gave up protecting me. Wingate. 12%. He did it! No freaking way he did it! How many times have I told you, chat? These spins are getting too scary. I won't survive. You don't say you're playing BB. Hey, I know. BB still does occur. It does. Welcome. Welcome, Barry. And Brentley, thanks for the spin, man. Let's hope this is a good one. It's another free kill. Oof. Too easy. Too easy. Okay, what you going for, man? We'll take a free kill of something. We have a Reaver. Uh, we have a couple of Reavers up here. One that's very close to dying. There is a Reaver. That's not a... That is just a Reaver. It's two lovely drummers. And then there's the good evil dog over here. Free kill on friendlies? No, we can't free kill friendlies. Um, even if we did, there wouldn't be any loot. Reavers, if not. Okay, thanks, man. Uh, I think this Reaver is the most annoying one because he's going to go after my back line. So let's, let's get rid of him. Thank you kindly. Much appreciated. Uh, Wolfang, let's go over here and try and keep beat up this king who is dangerous, but 
Now that we're surrounding it, we might have a chance. Stefan, beat up the dog. Yeah, there you go. You could totally beat that dog in a 1v1. Cake. 83 misses? Good old days where you could have friendly for loot. That would be a good old day for sure. If only we had the good old days. Um, Mandy needs to use throwing weapons. And we can go debilitate. And then we can make sure this king doesn't hurt us too much. Puppy, don't die on us. Oh, the br drummers are probably going to run away. No, get back here, you stupid drummers. Have a good sleep, Cake. We'll catch you in the next one. Oh, of course he goes for another 23. You hit a 15 last turn. You hit a 19 this turn. You stupid freaking king. Thank God Diagrin is a dodge medium tank. Dumbass king needs to stop. <coughs> Wait, why is sprint not working? Wait, is sprint broken? Okay, sprint's broken for some reason. What happened? That's a straight line. That's a straight line. Great. It's not a good thing. Okay, Diagrin, please don't die. Thank you very much. Sing. Big hit. Throw some sand. Thank you very much. Wolfang, good hit. Chase down the stupid drummers. Sprinting too much sprained his ankle. Yeah, probably. He's got nothing wrong with him, so it's like it doesn't make sense. 83s. Thank you, Cake. Stefan is winning against the dog. Surprisingly. Didn't think he could do it. Oh no, he adrenaline. No freaking way, you stupid king. Okay, we dodged the... He rolled a seven again! Dude! Thank God we shield-walled. Or else Diagrin would have died. Sheesh! Relentless, stupid freaking king. Okay, we can sprint with Mandy. For some reason, we can sprint with Mandy, but not... But not Gold Hand. I don't know why. What did I do wrong with him? I don't know what I did wrong with him. For some reason, his sprint is bugged in difference. Oh, you stole my dog kill. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. Yeah, Gobble gets a good kill. Sprint! It's not working. I'm so confused. I, I don't get it. You should be able to sprint. The Northern Drum Band, they won Best Band four years ago running. Don't kill the talented ones. <laughs> well, maybe they need to find a safer place to put their concert. Really don't think this is the safest place to have a concert out here in uh, Northern Coachella. It's definitely a little bit dangerous for them. Okay, he's on one health. And now he's dead. Very nice. I'll let them, I'll let them flee. I can't chase them. Too freaking far away. Um, good damage across the board, though. GB with 500, Mandy with 7, and, uh, yeah, okay damage. The king is now dead, and we get his helmet and his weapon, yep. Decent money. And, you know, 10 grand. 
Who can complain about 10 grand? King wanted the doubters to win. He did. He did want the doubters to win. But all the believers won because nobody died. Which is wonderful. And we cheesed another fight for some free money. Which is no issues. 10 grand right up our alley. You know, as we spend 560 bucks a day. So that's only going to last us like 20 days. Not even. So beautiful quest, beautiful XP. And can I make some money from this location? Selling at 18 is decent. So let's do that. Sell the barbarian weapons, the helmets. Uh, I don't need those throwing weapons. Probably don't need that one, but I could sell the others. Because I already have one hammer. Probably don't need both of those. Don't like that one. Don't need those. Don't need those. Don't need the ancient conics. Don't need the ancient kettle. It's pretty good. Nothing super fancy. Oh, cloth is on sale. Nice. What would save you money losing GB? Actually, how much does GB cost? 68 bucks. Yeah, but then I start to lose fights because GB does good damage. But technically, I would save money. Uh, buy a couple of tools. Ammunition's fine. Let's buy another band aid. And that's it for good. Oh, Gobble levels up. Congratulations. Let's get you, student. Get that XP gain as quickly as possible. 3 3, and dear God, stop rolling twos. Yikes. Uh, Wingate levels up, and he gets student as well. Very nice. 3 5. Oh, wait. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. He's not melee. Um, he's definitely ranged. So, 5. Oh, he's minus 10. And he wants to be Wind Reader. Fudge. Minus 10 as a base. Do I even go Wind Reader? He's going to be a bullet freaking sponge. He rolled a four, which is good, though. Um, on average, he'll get to, what is it, plus 20. Divided by three, that's at least seven range. Okay, it's it's worth it. It's worth it, but painful. Painfully worth it. It's just not great. And he also has gifted that could possibly help. Mm, but he's not got, maybe, I don't know. He doesn't have a chance to get gifted. Yeah. He needs some better buffs. Not be doing a yeah, spin probably. I specifically said not to chat. I swear I'll turn this car around. Probably needs some buffs going in there. Uh, Lunatics could probably get his rebound right now. That would be nice. There you go. Four defense, a very nice roll. Let's get him some initiative and some... Why does he have such high resolve? I guess I've just been giving him excess resolve. Let's give him health this time, though. Nice. If your negative range defense attack Wind Reader, does it negatively affect your range attack? Uh, no. Because this has a minimum bonus of three. So it saves you. It saves you in case you're negative. It's a good question to ask, though, because, you know, it doesn't specify that until it says with a minimum bonus of three. So this will always give you three range attack. But if you're higher than nine range defense, it'll give you more. It would be hilarious if it gave you negative. I agree. I would I would find that very funny. 
But I think the modders realized that and went, wait a minute, if people struggle with range defense, maybe they just make it a minimum of three at least. <laughs> Save some problems down the line. Okay, let's quickly figure out this armor situation and do a spin. We have a couple of armor pieces we got which are pretty crappy, but they're something. So let's give that to Stefan. Because that's literally all we have. He'll be fine. He doesn't have to worry about a thing. Uh, that's good salvage, good salvage. Good salvage. Tier 2, Tier 2. Heavy Tier 2. Oh, not so heavy Tier 2. I do like the Barbarian one. Ooh, ranged Helmet. Uh, one... GB has a bassinet. Yeah, I mean bassinets are nice, but let's give GB his extra vision. So he can snipe at 8 tiles if he needs to. And Wingate will eventually go slings, so eventually he needs his helmet better. 185, 150, 185, 185, 215, 320, 160, 135. Let's give that to Dormammu. He looks insanely scary. Oh my goodness, that's a vibe. Look at that. Barbarian mixed with undead. The color scheme works great. I like it. Are the builds on my YouTube still up to date with Legends nowadays? Uh, they're a little bit not up to date. They're a little bit out of date, but the general gist of the builds still work. Uh, they're not going to be 100% perfect, but if you follow the builds, uh, they'll work most of the time. Like the fact that you can still use Rebound for good builds, the stats are pretty much the same. Like Battleforge never changes. Most things don't change. There's only some slight changes that have been happening over the, the days. And only some perks ever slightly change. Like how Steel Brow is like more of a meta nowadays. Um, because it makes you immune to stuns. And how Resilient is just great normally on everybody. Because it gives you eight hit points and just solves so many problems for a single perk. And I think the medium armor system changed a bit. His perfect fit now gets you 30% initiative, when back in the day it didn't. And balance is less of an issue. To try and balance, I think. Yeah. Yeah. New YouTube series when? Yeah, I know. My lovely um, sponsor is bothering me about that too. <laughs> He's like, when are you going to make the video? And I'm like, I'm working on it, man. I'm working on it. It takes too long, and I've had way too many things in my life that keep interrupting my life and making things delayed. So, it, it'll get there. It'll get there. Okay, let's quickly save. And GB did a spin, so don't forget the spin. There we go. There we go. Nicely spinned. Is this still just handsome, hands down required if you have it? Yeah, pretty much. They're quite, quite strong for what they give. I have Palsword going down randomly. That was weird. I think let's do an update. I think Palsword put up an update. And the last time it updated, the server restarted on its own fine. But this time, I don't know why Palsword's server just went down and didn't go back up. I don't know how long it was down, like a few hours at least. Because I was sleeping. You guys said at what time? 3 a.m. So by the time I woke up and restarted at 7 a.m., it was only down for 4 hours and 40 minutes. Which is rough for you guys. But it's back up, so it's all good. When you make a new series, it'll fall 100 days, concept or something else. Um, I've got to make like... Oh man, there's so much I have to do. So much I have to do. Um, I've got guide videos that I need to make, and I've got other videos I want to make. I've got also um, YouTube series, that uh, Twitch series that I want to condense into YouTube form. Because of that, my category is not set terminal. Oh my goodness, it's not set. Thank you so much. Don't know why it didn't do that. Silly OBS. Is that on the bingo today? Yeah, OBS issue. I'll blame OBS for that. 
Thank you, Terminal. Welcome to the stream, man. Sword Ghost is on the server right now, creating monsters. Monsters from Goblins, Vanguard, Twin. Yeah, yeah, I already have two permanent god, god gobfins. I have two four-star gobfins, man. I'll give them to you. Because I think... Um, actually, maybe I'll try and use them as well. I kind of, I want to make, no, no, I won't use them. I'll give them to you. Because I want to use the uh, build that I'm using right now, which is the, the kitty cats. Yeah. Bonuses from stars only towards the active water gun. No way. You're telling me I got them to four star for no reason? Are you telling me I got them to four star with no reason? Are you saying that you did say that last night? I might have missed that. Okay, I'm going to start up power just for a second. I was being lazy last night. Had some time to myself relaxing, trying to get some rest. There's no way I did this for no reason. Let me just jump on the server for a second. I need to science something. Don't question the breeding that you're doing. Yeah, yeah, of course I won't. Of course I won't question the breeding that you're doing. You're breeding a Tifant and a Jet Dragon. Why? Oh, you're doing circular breeding, probably. Fair enough. Um, okay, one little thing to test. What's my attack currently? It is 100%. If I put a normal Gobfin in my party, my attack goes to 110. If I put a Gobfin with Vanguard in my party, which I'm pretty sure I have a random one, no, that's lucky. There we are, Vanguard. My attack goes to 120. If I put one of my amazing Gobfins in the party, which I put effort into, does it go past 120? It's better, it better freaking go past 120. There we are, three stars. It goes to 126. I was right. The stars make a difference. I was right. I knew it. It's an extra 6% for three stars, an extra 4% for four stars. So I knew I wasn't insane. Thank God I thought I was insane. Because uh, I've got a three star goblin here. Where's my four star? There's my four star. And that should go to 128, right? It goes to 130. Okay, so it's an extra 10% damage. Yeah. So I'm glad I didn't waste all that time. Thank God. I was definitely worried about that. Okay, let's jump off the server and let's go back. Because <laughs> I thought the stars were always useful for regardless what you were doing. I thought they were always good. And I'm glad that's the case. Speaking of breeding, look at the Discord. Feel, fellas, how do you breed in Pal World? Like, do you have to pick the pals to eat them at the breeding ranch to sign them? Yep. Yep, you gotta eat them at the ranch. They will not breed on their own. You gotta force them. You gotta forcefully breed. That's how it is. Snow panic, good panic. Yeah, you may need hey, panic Snow, for what? sure. There's a spin here. For real, for real, my guy. I don't know <sighs> what will happen. Sheesh, on God. Okay, GB, we got random events and then something else for you. Something else. So we save, and GB's got two sets of spins. Ooh. Ooh. Vala. Yes, please. Thank you, GB. Get your attack above 200 with Golf and Vanguards. Yep. Yep. Oh, Tina, race the horse. One fatigue. 500 bucks for the one fatigue. Don't know if it's worth it, but... You know, we had an extra coin on our hands, so... Pretty good, pretty good. And beat up some... Yeah, beat up the prostitutes. And we get injured again. Okay, we're beating up kids getting injured, beating up prostitutes getting injured. Chat, we need to get better at beating up civilians. I think these bros need some work. 
They, um... They're not the best. But thank you, Tina. Enjoying the extra permanent stat there. Um, also, let's quickly spin for GB's second spin. And to level up, GB, where would you like that, my man? Yourself? Of course. Of course it would be yourself. Try a staff bunk ball or something. Never seen those unique perks in action. Uh, I've used them before, but haven't made a good build out of it, so it's probably a decent idea to make it from our experimental builds. Uh, the Threads of Fate's a really nice one to do, so we'll do that. Do I name him first? Yeah, we do have to name him. Don't make monkeys, GB. <laughs> I know you would love to, GB. I know you'd love to. Alright, let's add the names in. Drays just go to sleep already? Yeah, he's he's not gonna listen to you. There's no way he listens to go to sleep already. He said he's going to sleep five times already. He never does. He never does. But Korax, welcome to the team, man. Happy to have you. And we're going as a staff build. Give the level to the Vala helper along. No worries, man. No worries. And now that's a free level two. Which means we can get student early on. Which helps level up in the back line. So what we need to do right now, chat. Oh, wait. Is Threads of Fate based off of... Just attacks. Um... Mmm, fast adaptation's nice. Need recover. Could probably do perfect focus recover. Backstab's important. It's no muscularity, which makes sad. Oh, Apollo Souls, welcome to the stream. Thank you so much, Raiders. Welcome, Raiders. How was your stream, man? Playing some Battle Brothers. How'd it go? Uh, we just got ourselves a Vala, so we are just double checking on the build. We don't make very many aggressive Valas because their stats usually suck, including this one, but we want to try and do some like experimental builds with this run. So I'm going to try and force it to work. If, if possible. Uh, but let's see. Inscription Master only does the Rune Sigils. I'll still need it though. Lost Yo Takers on Crisis 3? Dang. What Crisis, though? Those Takers are pretty good. But, uh... I'm assuming it's gonna be Undead Crisis. Because that's the most annoying. That's where I'd put my money. Yep, called it. Called it. Undead Crisis can go to hell, man. The worst Crisis out of them all. Sucks, man. Unfortunate to hear. Yeah. Spiritual Bond's worth the damage share with the Warden. Um, yeah, Spiritual Bond's good. I mean, when you're playing as a staff build, you're standing in the back of the line. You're not actually going up front. But uh, Warden's always nice to have regardless. Yeah. Even though it's not needed because of backline, yeah. It's going great, then it was not. Mm-hmm. Let me guess. Probably Necrosavant's paired with a Priest. Um, being a pain in the ass and stunning your bros. And then maybe just too many skeletons. Oh, wait, maybe you had a skeleton with a necros necromancer. Because that's always annoying in the Undead Crisis. Because necromancers can resurrect skeletons. And I think that's worse than necromancers dealing with zombies, because, yeah. Necro Stun Chain? Yeah, yeah, there you go, I called it. It's just, it's just a horrible combination, man. It's a horrible combination. So, sad times to hear it, man. But, you know, that's what happens when you go into those uh, lovely undead crises. Always a pain. Uh, okay, do we want to go chanting? Let's maybe not do chanting. Maybe just get one, just in case. In case the Vol is not doing anything at that time. So, one chant, one rune sigil, which would be... Weapons? One chant, one sigil, everything else is attack. 
That looks good enough to me. Got perfect focus, got recover, got everything else, which means we'll need attack, fatigue. Now we don't learn overwhelm? That sucks. They should give Vala's overwhelm. Because it's a debuffing style of attack, so overwhelm's a good debuff. They should have it. Ah, uh, you go again? Of course, of course. Still in vanilla, though, eventually get mods. Oh, that's fine. Yeah, don't, don't jump into mods if you're not ready for it. Vanilla is the way to start this game. I tell people not to jump into mods immediately. But most people ignore me, so they jump into mods. <laughs> but I'm glad you're having fun. Talk me into the DLC the other day when you raided. Oh, yeah, that's right. I did talk about that. Yeah, the DLC's worth it. Completely worth it, man. Which one did you get? You got all of them? Oh, congratulations. Hopefully you got them all on sale. Yeah, the DLC is 100% worth it. Uh, oh wait, the Vala dress is insane! I love it! I hate it that it got nerfed, but it's fine. Um, so where's the helmet that I need? Probably... a 40 is okay with the bassinet. And then I'll give her that. Okay, okay, now we give this to Diagon as the tank. We give him the dress, he doesn't complain. And that's pretty decent. Now he's crazy nimble and his lithe sucks. Fudge! I have to fix that. I have to fix that somehow. I'll deal with it later. Let's go shopping then. Shopping will fix it. But yeah, the DLC is going to be fun for you, man. Unlocking all the DLC at once definitely does be a little bit overwhelming. Because it's like, oh my goodness, look at all these new enemies. Um... But the only thing you have to remember is don't fight Barbarians early game. Even though they're technically early game enemies, they are scarier than th uh, thugs. Um, and then since you unlock the South, Nomads... Um, they're kind of okay early. Kind of. Unholds squish the guy. Oh yeah, don't fight Unholds. <laughs> Unholds are a pain in the ass, man. Like most monsters, monsters are just annoying. And they're more pain than they're worth. That's usually that. Hey, Brentley, welcome to the stream, man. Any recommendations for control? Currently, company is eating 70 per day. Sheesh. Are you playing Legends? I thought you were playing Legends in your last run, Brentley. My company is eating 35 a day, which is a lot, but 70 is a lot. 70 is very much. Snow's torn between fashion and practicality. Yeah, I'm always torn between fashion and practicality. As I try and keep the fashion up, but then I'm like, oh, wait, what about the balance? <laughs> what about the balance? Can't get eaten if Indom? Yeah, that's true. Indom usually helps that. Yeah, Indom's great for that. Pull maces on the southerns? Yeah. Hi. Oh. Hello. Hello, are you feeling neglected? Yes, you are feeling very neglected. Even though you're the one that left me, it's my fault that I haven't been patting you this whole time. Yes, I see the problem. I don't know how to fix the problem, but hopefully I can reprimand by giving you pats. Hopefully that's a good enough compromise, chat. Hopefully. Legends Kabul. Cabal. Wait, how are your guys eating food if it's Cabal? Gotta go be a parent, have a good stream. Oh, no worries, Apollos. Have a good one, man. Thanks for hanging, and thank you so much again for the raid. Uh, let me just quickly save. Doesn't Cabal not need food? Welcome to the Himalayas! I swear, Undead eat more food. It's lemon. They changed Cabal since I last played it, so I can't remember exactly. Tesseract, thanks to Tier 1 Reset for 27, man. Welcome to the stream. Much appreciated. Marel is eating three on normal green tiles. And Marel is the zombie. Okay. Minus three action points, recover set rates, that's the usual, that's the usual. Experience is gained at 75% normal rate, that's fine. Yes, yes, you're very cute. 
Um, okay, they just eat more than these days. That's a neat BG icon. It is. I almost didn't notice that was hands. Or puppetry master. It kind of looks like there's a spider on his head, not a puppet. That's definitely a spider. Hmm. Wonder who made it, Rambits. I wonder who made it. <laughs> um, but that's interesting. Yeah, no, I never noticed that. I've got to play Cabal again. It's been a while. But the way to deal with food in Battle Brothers is to get a Quartermaster. Yeah, that's the best way of dealing with food. You need a retinue slot cook, which is this one. Makes all provision last four extra days. Means all your crappy position provisions that you spend a lot less money on can last longer. And then you get Quartermaster, which is on a lot of the cooking backgrounds. And that makes your bros eat less and helps you cook up some food. I currently don't have a Quartermaster, which is me um, saying do as I say, not as I do. Because um, I haven't been able to find one, which sucks. Wait for next Legends build for Cabal. Yeah, I, I was pretty sure, Abyss, that they were working on it. Um, Cabal is in this weird state. And I wasn't really going to go play it. But I do need to play it eventually. I've got a different plan for the next playthrough. But, uh, yeah, they're, they're, they're doing some updates in Legends. I haven't been reading the, um, reading behind-the-scenes patches yet. But I see they're doing a lot for the next big build. Yeah, they'll, they'll sort it out. Definitely changing some stuff, which is nice. Hmm. Any time on Shrats, they just destroy you? Um, Shrats are painful. And you have to kind of be very good with positioning. You need good tanks and good positioning. There's, there's multiple ways to beat Shrats. But each strategy requires um, precision... Either with your bro or and or your positioning. So pole arms are really good against strats because they can only attack like a like a bishop in chess. And if you attack them like a knight, they can't deal with you. Um, or you can just fully do the gang surround them. And then that's a really effective way of beating them. But it, it's painful. The shields go down. Yeah, yeah, they can lose their shields. Yeah. Trats have um, annoying shields that are impossible to... Well, not impossible to kill them through their shields. I do that all the time. Um, the shields make them very hard to kill because it reduces the damage that goes through the shields to their hearts. But you can break the shields by doing shield smash. Shield break. With normal axe attacks. Like, um, there, split shield. Yeah. The thing is they can regenerate those shields, though. So it might be very disheartening to spend, like, two turns killing their shield. And then, just by chance, it decides to regenerate its shield immediately. So, you, you kind of need axes to beat Shrats. If you don't have axes, you're going to struggle. I'm just lazy and I beat them without axes. Because I don't I don't remember to have axes. Shield match takes a big hit on fatigue. Oh yeah! Oh yeah, it does. It's horrible. What's this one? 25 fatigue. Yeah, that's bad. But, you, it's very hard to beat Shrats without it. <laughs> Lumberjack versus trees? Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Um, but I I am lazy and I beat Shrats without doing this. It just it, it does work. You can beat Shrats without using axes. It is possible. But it's painful. That's all I gotta say. Okay, we make some money off the cloth, that's kinda nice. And what else can I make money off of? Uh, I don't think I need the Scramus axe anymore. I don't need my axes, you not as you can tell. When I specifically said not to chat, I swear I'll turn this stream around. I wonder where my axes go, chat. If I keep selling them, um, that totally, totally is fine. Nothing to worry about. Uh, tier tired amnesiac. Thank you so much for the spin. We'll do that in just a second. And now nah, my inventory's fine. My inventory's fine. There's nothing to worry about. We'll do the spin, and then I'll try and go for some shopping, because I need a couple of things, and I don't know if they'll have them. Ooh, random events! Lunatics fixes his crushed finger. Yes! That is a nice, clean fix. 
Thank you very much. Next up is loss of bread. I swear that was still good. Isn't there like a, a level of mold you can have on your bread before it's bad? There's good mold, isn't there, chat? Yeah. Yeah, they made penicillin and all that kind of stuff. There's good mold. And then armor for 9,000. I don't think I want that. Ever played War Tales? Yep. Yeah. Oh, sorry, Brenly. Did I miss your... Oh, sorry. I might have missed your message. Uh, what about tips to catch demon alps? Seems like they spawn far away and never engage. Uh, demon alps are buggy. They kind of suck. Um, they're... I don't know. They never really engage. You just gotta go chase them. Sometimes you get lucky with them coming close to try and scream at you. Sometimes you don't. Um... I, I don't know, man. I usually just try and chase them down. Because they're not that scary. Demon Alps are stupid. They used to be scarier. And they are very buggy at the moment. And hopefully, like Sorko says, they're going to get reworked. And uh, back in the day, they used to be able to breathe fire. Which was scary, except it never worked. And it always crashed your game. Well, almost always crashed your game. But nowadays, Demon Alps are just a free legendary enemy that drops um, the Unbreaking Rune. So whenever you find a Demon Alp, you just are just going to thank your lucky stars you got a free fight. That's usually the situation. Yeah. Um, but yeah, we've played War Tales before. War Tales is pretty good. 9,000 crowns. Do I waste the money? Fine, fine. I don't think this is always a good choice. But we had the spare coins. Yeah. Alps are reworked to max. Next Legends build complements of Necro. Okay, Abyss Crane, if I wanted to have nightmares tonight, I would have asked you to tell me that. I don't want to have nightmares tonight. So why would you say that to me? It's, it's not it's not the fact, okay, it's not the fact that Alps are getting reworked. It's the fact that you said Necro helped them do it. Necro makes very scary things in his mods. And this Alps last time I had to play with. God, man, what did he do? I'm going to have to check the patch notes behind the scenes. I have access to that part of the Discord. I will check and see what happened. Fudge. That's not a good sign. They better still be a freaking weak to nets. If not, I'm going to be pissed. I'm going to be so pissed. Okay, time to save and finish the shopping trip. Oh. Also, we got the new armor, which is nice. Oh no, it's not layered! Fudge! Dang it, Legends! Okay, who's Battleforged? Tina is 27 for 250, 34 for 300. No, I have to keep above 20. Fudge! No, I wasted 9,000 bucks because I can't even use it. Tina's helmet's a 26 for 320, and that's an 18 for 300. Okay, never mind. Tina's helmet can be upgraded. Okay, I didn't waste all my money. I just wasted some of it. I have to worry about nets. Oh, don't tell me that. Isn't it because of Necro we had Tim the Alp, the demigod? That is true. Because of Necro, we had an amazing Alp on our own team. But it's also the reason as to why we had enemy Alps that ruined our days and nights. So I blame Necro for a lot of things. That included. Okay, so the Unhold Spike, as adorable as it is, it's very inefficient. Uh, this 6 for 130 is good, and we can give it to Digrin. There we go, 175. He's sitting on 42, 15, and 20. Good, good stuff. Uh, do I want to give away this Deep Salad to somebody? Yes. Uh, where's GB? No, no, not GB. Uh, Mandy? Yes, that's an upgrade for Mandy. Good.
And I think that's the best I can do, except giving this to Korax. Yeah, that's kind of weird. The flat top's better than the bassinet. I swear bassinets would be better, but that's okay. Uh, and then the bever cannot be given to anybody just yet. Okay, that's good enough. Uh, Armor-wise, anything on sale? Oh god, this place is upset. Stupid recruiting of troops. I think I buy the padded leather. Give that to Korax. Yeah, that'll work. Alps on your own team? Uh, that's from the Hex mod. NGH's Magic Concept mod, yeah. So, Necro built a mod that allowed you to play as a Hex in converting enemies. Simping them permanently to your team. Yeah, we played that mod multiple times. It is a great mod. It is lots of fun. And we highly recommend. Very chaotic. And he made it pretty difficult at times. And sometimes we really abused it. <laughs> As we always do. It's gone a bit, didn't you have a character? That's all good, Korax. We got a brand new one for you. Brand new one indeed. Okay, let's get out of here. Uh, whilst repairing quickly and healing. Uh, we just always have to pick fights with kids and prostitutes, don't we? Always have to find a way. There we go. <laughs> okay. And southward we go. We'll take a little break from the north. We had fun with the barbs for a bit. Okay, there's a visual bug that it wasn't showing the speed changes. But it was actually changing speed, which confused me. Hmm. Hmm. Kids can be little crafts, though. Yeah. Oh, we beat them up on purpose. Yeah, we, we don't we don't accidentally find kids and beat them up. We hunt them down. But um, unfortunately, they know how to uh, fight back. Throwing sticks and stones, they do hurt. They've always lied to you, chat. They stick, say sticks and stones don't hurt you. They do. They always do. Oh, are you heading off, Mount? Oh, I have my belly back. Thank you, Mount. I appreciate it. She'll be back, though. Okay. Uh, hunting beasts, courier. Let's do some beast fights. Yeah, let's go for it. Thousand bucks, that should be pretty simple. Kind of hope it's going to be disguised bandits. That would be really fun. No, it's just normal direwolves. Okay, if you say so. Weird goblins, okay. Uh, is the party ready for direwolves? Yeah, probably. Probably hide you two in the back. Everything else seems fine. Do I want to use the crystal skull? Not right now. I think eventually we'll get a bro that I want to use it on. But I think we'll be fine for now. Okay. Have I played Crusader Kings? Uh, only number three. And we did that on stream with chat involved and helping me along the way. I was not good at it. Because I trialed the demo of Crusader Kings, I think, before I did that stream. To be like, man, I need to try this out so I don't look like a complete idiot on stream. That didn't change the fact that I didn't look like a complete idiot on stream. Um, but yeah, it's a hard game. I, I'm not good at it. 4K games like that? Not good. I don't know if you had it, but you made me think of the Child Crusade event. Child Crusade event. Oh, uh, that slightly rings a bell. How many times have I told you, chat? These spins are getting too scary. I won't survive. There it is. Maybe the guy would kill the crusade if he had the option. <laughs> oh, that looks like a CK2 thing, though. Oh my goodness. The Children's Crusade. Against all odds, the Children of Christ have succeeded in their unlikely quest to reconquer Jerusalem. Host of Archangels. Everyone's happy. A divine intervention that the kids win. What? I don't know if they added to three. That looks like a CK2 uh, menu. 
Yeah, that doesn't look like two. This looks like three. Wait, no, is that three? You can help the crusade. That's hilarious. I would totally beat up the kids. I would do it. This is CK2. Okay, I thought it was two, but I... Yeah. Okay, thank you, chat. It's definitely a CK2 event. That's sad they didn't bring it to three. You can even join it. That's hilarious. That's hilarious. Also, Terminal, thanks for the spin. The prediction's up, chat, for the next couple of seconds. Uh, let's get the spin going as well. Didn't have a lot of fun stuff like going to crazy fall in love and marrying your horse. I think they really just dumbed it down in three. Um, mainly just for the user friendly and portability, you know, sad. But, you know, maybe it's a good thing. Also, also, thank you, Terminal, for a lovely monster spawn. I hate monster spawns. And of course, it's a skin ghoul. Of course it is, because it joins the stupid dudes. Okay, it's only one frenzy, right? Okay, so this fight's a cinch. Except that they've got the high ground, which I can probably manage. And now a tier 2 skin ghoul. Gunshot. Okay, gunshot. Uh, Diagrin, we need you on the high ground. Lunatics, you probably should stay down here. GB, I would like you to assist. With a piercing shot. Are you kidding me? Piercing shot doesn't work up hills? God, I, there's a reason I don't use this ability. It's so bad. Nah, I mean, we're doing experimental builds for a reason to see if things are actually worth it and to see if builds actually work. I can't recommend piercing shot. Every time I use it, it just doesn't do what I want it to do. Ugh. It's just not a good ability. Okay, we go over here. Uh, we probably want to move forward. Uh, Sing's fine. There's been some promising builds in this playthrough. Uh, yes, there have been. Ooh, 10 extra damage from knocking him off a cliff. Yeah, I love to see that. Lucky 22. Yeah, there's some promising builds we've been doing in this uh, place. I think the adrenaline rebound is not bad. I don't think it's overpowered, but I think it's pretty good. Uh, what other build have I been liking? I've been liking the bonus range on the gun. So piercing shot on gun is nice because it gives you an extra reach with the tile of handguns. That build's been nice. Piercing shot's been working great for me, but only seeing on expos. Uh, fair enough. Fair enough. Uh, that's not the concern that I'm having with piercing shot. The concern I'm having is not the fact that it doesn't do damage. It's the fact that it doesn't work up hills. Um, if you're doing it as a shot behind enemies, it will uh, miss the first person, hit, hit, miss, okay, miss the middle person, hit the first person, and the back person, because it's going off of that shot. So, it's like, if you normally miss an arrow, it hits the person in front. That makes sense. If you miss a piercing arrow, it hits the person in front, but it doesn't carry on from the person in front to the person that you're aiming at. It carries from the person in front but then goes to the person two tiles behind. It's weird. It's so weird with the interaction of it, and I don't like it for, like, gauging shots. Because I'm trying to aim a certain way, and then the game's like, no! Nope. And I'm like, okay, well, that sucks. <laughs> it always damages the person behind first. Yeah, it does do that as well. Yeah, it hits the person behind before it hits the person in front, so it'll hit the person in front behind, then it'll miss the person in front, hit the person in the app. It's weird. It's weird. So I'm not loving per piercing shot at the moment. It's not doing what I want it to do. But for guns, it's great. Absolutely great to get that extra reach. It gives guns so much more mobility, so much less need. Like, look at this. Look at this. It's insane. I'm a gunner with one extra height, and I have one, two, three, four tiles of attack, which can reach five tiles away. Or even six if it's over here, because of one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, piercing shot goated for guns, but for bows and crossbows, nah, I don't really care for it. 
I don't need it in those other weapons as much. Because in all honesty, it's not adding much damage, and it's not even adding damage to the target that you want. So, that is pretty much it. Um, okay, so where do I want this gunshot? Uh, probably here. Because it hits two. Hmm. Wingate's alive, yep, he's doing alive, he's doing all the alive things. Except I have flanking issues. Yes, I do see my problems. Can I solve my problems? Probably not. Good job, Sing. Let's go for the adrenaline. Mm, why didn't I have enough action points? Yeah, that's probably why. Okay, GB, save us. Thank you, GB. Oh yeah, we've been using Debilitate a little bit. Um, I think it's only good against bosses or like super difficult enemies. I have not been able to get Debilitate to be super useful at the moment though. It's somewhat useful. Very situational. Ooh, yeah, there you go. That dude's upset. Love to see it. Okay, 29% Wingate does not succeed. Our backline is still struggling, but that's okay. We can handle it. Wolfang, do I put you at a risk? What's your defense? 31. Ah, uh, maybe not. <laughs> maybe let's just not say we did. Stefan, you stay here for emergencies. And then Cake, I put you over here, and that slows down the back problems. Nice. How do you manage to shoot three times with a bow, bro? Uh, that was um, Berserk. You need debilitate on whip rows? Uh, it's not a bad idea. Uh, we've been doing debilitate with guns. Uh, with Mandy's build, but we've not been doing it very often. Because remember, it says prepare your next attack to debilitate a target for three turns. And uh, with a gun being giant AoE, it kind of works. Except the problem is it costs extra fatigue and action points to use. So I can't use it very often. And that's one of the other experimental builds we're doing this time. It's interesting. Interesting. I think debilitate's not a very good ability. It's not. But it's interesting. And that's what we like to take from it. There we go. Good job, Mandy. Unfortunate miss on the kill opportunity as he's on five health, but that's okay. Uh, Digrin, we want to go and hit this guy. No luck on the 69. Skin Gold decides to go around the back. I guess, yeah, Tina could totally hold him off, so I guess it's maybe a smart decision on his Bahar. Uh, okay, we go for the Bash. Gold Hand, I don't know, but I'll go here. Very lucky 43, I'll take it. Uh, GB, we need you. And that is the fight over. I don't think there's any threats other than the goblin. Not really a goblin, but he feels like a goblin at times. Uh, the skin ghoul himself is the only threat I have to worry about. Okay, weird misses. Weird misses. Hello. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. He gets away. Of course he does. Snow's jinxing himself just a little bit. Just a little bit. Let's get a debilitate ready. Waiting for that skin ghoul to pop around. There he is. And he murders his friend. Yep. Skin ghouls, the nicest neighbors, until they're sitting next to you and they kill you. Mr. 95 rolled a 100. Is that on the bingo today? No 95s on the bingo today. Unfortunate. Okay, let's get rid of this dude, because he is going to screw us to heck. Oh, not good. Not good. GB, let's get a debilitate ready. Hmm. Hit our tank. I mean, Cake is kind of a tank. He's not really a tank. He's only got 37 defense. So Cake's going to get shredded if nobody else helps him. Um, so we got to get there. Tina and Chives are better tanks than Cake at the moment. 
So we'll hopefully get them. Uh, Cake, just shield wall this dude. Please survive. Tina, you're on the low ground over here, but you need to get rid of him. Can I get a gunshot off? Debilitate with the gunshot. Debilitate overwhelmed. Okay, that hopefully makes the difference. For three turns. Ugh, I don't like this positioning. Maybe. Oh, and Cake just get wrecked. Oh my goodness! Really? He gets hit on a 39. And a 30%. The only hits hit him. And Tina survives. He's got four stacks of bleed. He's dead. There's a very good chance he's dead. I hate Skingles, man. And Gobbo's probably going to get wrecked by that. GB, you have Debilitate on. in wild places. You better not be she doing is a stalwart survivor. That was with debilitate. Doctor. Horrible. Nighthammer, thanks for the spin. Don't you dare bring another stupid skin ghoul in here. It's a free kill. Wait, is there an enemy? <gasps> There's one enemy left. I can't. I don't have to respin. Thank you for the direwolf kill. I appreciate it. Because if you didn't have a direwolf on the battlefield, I'd have to respin that. Okay, GB does the debilitate, which doesn't help because we're already dying anyways. But yeah, that's that's my other slight great for debilitate. It doesn't do a lot. It does a little bit. It's kind of nice. But it definitely doesn't do enough. Uh, I can't do anything there unless I do that in adrenaline. Not enough action points for adrenaline. Uh, that fatigue for adrenaline. Fudge. Chives, get over here. Maybe we can bait them into attacking the back line. Cake, you have 10, 20, 30, 40 damage. He struck down, though, so he's not dead. It's kind of nice. You know, in a somewhat way. Even though a stupid shield wall and a stinking overwhelm didn't do anything. Yep. Yeah. Let's rally Sing. Let's go after him. Lunatics, what's your defenses? 70. Okay, you're fine to sit up here. Okay, he goes for Gobbo, and Gobbo's bleeding out. Gobbo, how much bleeding you got? Is it too much? Two turns. Yeah, you die. So, we have a Band-Aid to give you from Gold Hand. So you don't die. Sounds like a plan. Sounds like a good plan. And Singh has no fatigue. Fudge. If you didn't get attacked, Singh, you would have been fine. Okay, well, that sucks. Uh, GB is out of ammunition. Also sucks. Dormammu. Band-Aid up Gobbo. So he doesn't die. Good. Uh, crossbow off the ledge. No luck there. That doesn't count for predictions, right? Yeah, no, no, no. If a dude gets struck down, it doesn't account for the predictions. It's only actual kills. Sing doesn't mind getting shot. And the skin ghoul dodges a 92? Bodge, that was my last bullet, too. Okay, let's jump in with Star Phase, jump out with Star Phase. Lunatics. Can't get around just yet. Horax, jump in, jump out. Gold Hand has no problem. He does have problems, but I can't get him in there. You can't sprint through your allies. That's so annoying. Okay. GB. He's on 26 health. Somebody kill him. Dude, this is the luckiest skin ghoul. So many 30s and 40s, man. He's on 15. Somebody kill him. Someone! Tina! 
He's on one! Ah! Why? And we missed the 87! Dude, somebody has to kill this dude. Somebody! Mandy, you can't hit him because you don't have action points. Somebody hit him. Starface. Thank you. Always the one health curse. Always. Always. Far out. Okay, so Cake survives by being traumatized. We can probably fix that later. Traumatized is not good, though. Uh, and lots of wolf pelts. Thank you. Sheesh. Pain in the ass. Get this man a gun, yeah. That's what we need. Stinking skin ghouls, man. Stinking skin ghouls. Thank you, GB, for the uh, lovely uh, prediction sorted there. Yeah, meow, indeed. Meow, I know. Almost lost a boy today. Would have been scary. Nora's gonna roll me exactly. It's gonna roll me a stinking one. There we go. Okay, level ups. We have Stefan. Do we have student? Yes, we do. Very good. Let's jump on that. Three, three, and three health is pretty good. Nice rolls. And let's go get paid and heal up. Goes down on day 69. Hey, it would be the best time to go down on 69. He'll be back up, though, hopefully. If he survives the 69. Escort caravan, armed courier, and raise location. Uh, we need to do caravans. So I might take the caravan unless it goes south, because then that would be really bad. Where are you headed, buddy? Go north. Dude, why do I jinx it for myself? New Mass is a southern nation, isn't it? Dude, they hate our freaking guts. Why do you want to take it? <sighs> I gotta go somewhere else. Uh, let's quickly heal up. We seem to always need to heal up people. Uh, we're just doing some hit points at the moment, not not for injuries. When a rogue gets struck down, he's always left on like one health or something. So healing's important. Sheesh. Okay, that should be good enough. Oh, let's see what we get. Caravan from somewhere. Raise location again. Courier caravan. Caravan, please go north. Wurzelberg will take it. Caravan. Let's do a training montage. We need it. Uh, do we need any salvage, though? Yeah, we probably do. Fine, I'll do the salvage first. Then we do some training. Gotta clean up this inventory. May blow up the front gate and our base doing a flying raid. Oh, that's fine. Our base gets blown up all the time. Is Snow Wife doing better? Yes, yeah, she's doing better. She's resting. She's feeling a bit better today, which is good to see. Also, Goldhand, welcome to the stream, man. Good to see you. Oh, wait, I didn't realize we were done our scrapping. Uh, training. There we go, that's what we need to do. More training. Did kill eight flowers with a missile? Nice. Nice. Also, um... I've got so many Vanguard... Uh, whatchamacallits? Gobfins that you don't need to breed for them, Sword Coast. You don't need to breed for Gobfins. I've already finished the breeding if you want. I just need to get more gobfins to, like, get the stars up. That's it. That's all we need. It's just more. And then you're sorted. You've been stacking the eggs? Thanks, man. I appreciate it. Most of those have Vanguard on them, so, like, those eggs are just easy to do. Uh, easy caravan. No one got attacked. That is wonderful. Let's quickly get some stats on Gobbo. 3-3 three, three, and... Yeah, HP is very important for him right now. 3-3 three, three, and HP. Very good, very good. He might need some fatigue. Because he does not have rebound, he doesn't have recover. But I just hope he gets a minus 3 uh, weapon and that makes his problems fixed. 
Digren rebound? No. Yes. Maybe. I kind of want to go balance first. But maybe I give him a weapon that he can use. Maybe this one. 9 times 2 is 18. An arming sword is pretty good. 11, no. Uh, spear should be 9, yep. Yeah. Let's go arming sword and rebound, just so we can keep the DPS up. I do want to go balance eventually, but I think the rebound is more important right now. Uh, we keep the resolve high, and we keep the... With rebound, we don't need more fatigue. Oh, bye, Mao. Uh, hit points are pretty good, but I think I want speed. Yeah, let's keep the speed high. Gobble best sickle? Yes, exactly. Exactly. Hopefully he gets a good one. Uh, star phase with the sprint banner. Let's get sprint right now. Three, three, and... He's already got 69 health, which is nice. Let's get him some more... Fatigue. Wingate with the slinging. Let's start getting him on those slings. A spin? What? Since when were you guys allowed to spin? Yeah, when were you guys allowed? I never said you could do it. Sneaky chat. Thanks, Arzo, for the spin. I'll do it in just a second. Dormammu with the hammer build. Let's go for Steel Brow. 4, 1. Damn, that's a nice 4, though. And 4. Stefan with the pickaxe build. Obviously, needs gifted first. Although, I probably should have gone pickaxe first. I just wanted to get some defense. Uh, and probably the resolve here. Nice. Now his resolve sword. He just goes health for the rest of the way. Thorax with. Ooh, do we go ghost or fast adaptation? I don't have anybody with rotate, so the ghost could probably be really annoying. Um, I'll still do it anyways. It'll be funny. Three, three, and three. Very nice. And then we save. And then we spin. Are the fame slings in this mod? No. Sadly. The fame slings are from Cell Swords. Oh, the heal we needed. Yes. That is the traumatized we need to sort it. Thank you so much. Funny, it's important for company morale. Yeah, it's a little bit of a problem if the ghost dies. People get pissed off at that. It's a little funny, though. Um, but thank you so much, Arzo. We do need this. Uh, v is the heal. Yes, there it is. Good stuff. Traumatize the walls. Can't repair the mental scars. <laughs> mental scars are never repaired. What are you talking about? Never. Escort the envoy. Ooh, if it's good money... 1,000 for Numis. Good luck, buddy. Do somebody else for that. 261 for Copper is nice. Some of my food is disintegrating, which is not nice. Uh, get rid of the Adrenaline Gland. Yeah, we'll figure that out some other time. Not many good things to sell. Uh, tools are super cheap. I will be very happy to purchase those. And ammunition's cheap. You know what? Let's get some of those. Let's get all of those, actually. Uh, money is starting to get a little bit low. It's not good. So we need to get some good occurrence uh, quests. Would be really nice. Really nice right about now. So you and Mark, please. Please solve our issues. I would appreciate it. There's a lot of brigand fights I could take, but I'm not getting paid for them. So they would not be as beneficial as just taking quests. Money is usually doing the best Ill John impression. Yeah, just, just, oh, that's a little John impression. That's a big John impression. I did say I wanted money. And uh, Eulen Mark has offered to pay me a lot of money for a lot of things. Dear God, how much are you offering? Ten grand again. Fudge. 
That's gonna hurt. Ah, uh, someone's gonna die in that fight. I also kind of really want to use this heavy halberd. We bought it for like freaking 9k. I need to give it to somebody. I might have to give it to Dormammu. Because no one else... Oh, maybe Wolfang? Ah, oh, but he's got bad fatigue. And who was I trying to fix the balance of... Sing's balance is fine. Did I screw someone's balance? I think I did. I swear I screwed somebody's balance. Maybe it was Digrin. No, Sing's fine. Maybe I'm just tripping out. I swear I ruined someone. But that's okay. No, it was Digrin. He's got no lithe. I knew I wasn't insane. I knew it. Where is his lithe? He's perfectly fit. He's got dodge. He's got nimble. Where did his lithe go? He had it. Maybe they've decided. Maybe Legends has figured it out. Maybe they figured out I'm cheating. It used to work. It's not working anymore. That annoys me, but fair enough. I guess there's not much we can do about it. For the moment. Um, okay, so then who do I give the Hobbit first to? Probably Cake. 15, what does this go up to? 30, 34, sheesh. Okay, Tina's the best person to give it to. Tina's always been the best person to give this to. Okay, let's quickly save and see if this works. Because it should work. Good. Tina, sitting with the fur padding on top of the entire Oath Taker set, is good. See on the yellow got for Tina Sag. I know, I know, but hey, it's still good. It'll all work out. She's stacked, but this this lovely famed item can give, be given to somebody else. Probably Digrin. And it fixes his lithe. Yes! Keeps him at 20 dodge. Keeps him at perfect fit. I told you, this is one of the best medium armor attachments we have in our entire party, and I've seen in a while. And it fixes it. That on top of the Vala armor makes it perfect. Only thing I would do better is fixing this tier 1. This tier 1 kind of sucks. If I had the nimble one from the south, it'd be better, but I can't go trade with the south yet. Because they still hate my freaking guts. Um, so other than that, yeah, 20 dodge with 53 nimble with 72 lithe with perfect fit at maximum. We fixed it. We fixed the medium nimble build, and I hope balance when we level it up. It's just going to be perfect. Uh, Diary no longer needs this net. Let's give that to Gobbo. Uh, who else has a spare net that we could use? That are only net. Rip. Rip our Roonies. Uh, let's put this back on Dormammu. We have a Leather Shoulder Guards 2 for 30. Uh, give that to Chives because he needs it. Upgrade Chives a little bit. Slightly. Uh, Gold Hand, what you got? 40 for 45. <sighs> Ooh, that's a nice armor piece. Does that work on Digrin? It does! Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. We will give you, Gold Hand, the... the chain mail, which is alright, but... Yeah, you'll live with it. You're fine. Uh, your tier 2 is the 50 for 6... Uh, Sing's fine. Lutix has the Nomad tier 2. Yep, that's fine. Nomad tier 2. Gobbo does not have a tier 2, so let's give him that one. And we'll 
we'll give Starface that one, the tier one. That's nice. Mm hmm. I think that's most of the things I need to rearrange. The only thing I would possibly give is. Oh, but Tina can't wear the tier three jester hat. Because you can't wear tier threes with the stinking. You only wear tier fours, and tier fours don't work, and runes do. That sucks. Give Tina a random weapon now? Yeah, you might need to reroll for that. Might need to. I mean, the fighting spear is really nice at the moment, so I'm not going to complain about her having that. Uh, who's my next tank? Chives with 32 defense. Is it 32? Only 32. Eh, he's working on it. He'll get there. Goldhand has 60. Lunatics has 67. 68 on Diagran as a dodge tank. I gotta figure out who to give this Jester hat to. Uh, against green skins, I might need it to save someone's life. I'm totally not sarcastic. I'm thinking Diagran. You guys did a really good spin, for sure. I think Diagran's really good at the moment. So giving him the Jester hat's probably worth it. Yeah. He has rebound, he can Jester hat every single turn. Yeah. Okay, uh, what else am I doing? That is all of the mediums I needed to fix. And then every other armor piece is sorted. Just would like to see some nets. And if I'm versing... Okay, okay, wait a minute. Stefan, go with the hooked blade. Yeah, let's, let's be real. Hooked blade's the way to go. And then Korax, probably go with the ancient blade. Because we want to do staff build, but right now that's not viable. That is not viable. Yeah, okay. Good stuff. Arzoni, you're fighting over the spins. Nice. The more spins, the merrier. Trying to buff the same person, exactly. It's for the glory as well as the buffs. Uh, random events. Nice. Thank you very much, Arzo, for the spin. We get happy people with happy food. That's what we like to see. We are feeding you guys fairly well this time. Oh, free blacksmith. Uh, the apprentice. Very nice. And... Oh, fudge. Is this the second time this has happened in the run? He's not taking the fall. I want the money. Or, wait, wait. If he takes the fall, maybe we get paid. I mean, last time I screwed this up, so he's going to not take the fall. Whoo! Let's go! Okay, Diagrin. He fights as he pleases. Diagran bullies others. He does not get bullied this time. Four resolve, two initiative, three melee skill, two melee defense. Diagran is going to be the best tank in the world. He's amazing. Let's go. He's brawling for sure. Okay, so. With him being our amazing tank. And he actually has a little bit of accuracy now. We have a brand new, but has to be side benched, uh, Apprentice. Who is garbage. Okay, well, I wanted to get someone new in. But uh, this dude's useless. So we get rid of him. Sad days. Sad days. We'll get someone new eventually. Eventually. But not now. We have to fight some orcs and new guys will definitely flop on the floor. A little bit too easily. Oh, and speaking of... Oh, actually... We're fighting a little bit of armor. It shouldn't be too bad. Piercing damage is good to kill all the young first. Only issue I see right now is Wingate not doing much. Well, that's kind of expected. He's brand new and doesn't have much going for him.
Yep, fair enough. Okay, um, let's just go. You should be recruit, probably a cripple. That's usually guys what you guys love to see. <laughs> uh, beggar. Yeah, I was close. I was close on the guessing, GB. Get Murph in here. Yeah, he would save us. Oh, it's in the. Oh, it's in the forest. Oh, this could be good. Maybe this fight won't be too bad, chat. Maybe not. Forests are doable. And we could definitely get some cheese here. Come on, what is it? What is it? Lots of young, as expected. A singer warlord. That is annoying. But there's no elites. There's a few berserkers, though. Hmm. At least there's no elites. This could be doable. Ignoring all the free loot. Yeah, yeah, I'm ignoring all that free loot. It's more painful loot, to be honest. Um, Because it probably give me injuries. Okay, no one's injured. Uh, Armor-wise, Tina needs to recover, so let's quickly spend a second. Two seconds repairing. One. Two. There we go. So Tina's fixed. Everyone else is fixed. No one has injuries. Armor seems to be maxed out for everybody. Um, maybe I could do some slightly better things with helmets, but at the same time, probably not. Yeah, there's not too many upgrades I could possibly switch around at this point in time, which is fine. Uh, Weapon-wise, everyone has what they need. Guess we just jump right in. Oh, I could drag those brigands in. Would you like to join a fight, Mr. Brigands? Just, you know, you're coming straight for it. No, 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 don't go south. Ah, oh, you bunch of lazy jerks. Okay, I gotta fight during the day. Dang it! Dang it! They went south! Jerks. Freaking teased me. Okay, let's fight these guys during the day. Alright, new prediction chat. Get on it. Go for it. You want the orcs to be confident? You see, that's the thing. I know the orcs might get a little confident, but at least they'll be distracted. So that's what I like about that. 23 enemies, I'm not liking that much about it. But we've got a good chance in this fight, I think. We just have to make sure we get our snipers. Mr. GB, they're sitting right there. Now... Can this piercing shot work? No, because it went that way instead of this way. I hate piercing shot. It's it's just not doing it for me, man. It's not. I really don't like it. I'll be distracted. That's true. I will be distracted. Yeah, screw piercing shot. <sighs> okay, so Wingate, 59, and he misses. Oh, there's two freaking... Oh, this is bad. There's two flail berserkers, chat. Rip. There's not enough forest. Doesn't mean you don't have targeting previews. Swear I had it way back when I played Legends. Uh, it kind of does. It just doesn't show you targeting like an empty square if that's where it was going to aim. It's the targeting preview sucks on it. Where he's like, we're getting blindsided by the greenies. Go after the snowman. Yeah, they should. They should have. They should have hunted us down. Would have been more fun that way. Then I could have had them being distracted. Uh, Diagrin, do I put you here? Yes. Mandy, you're going to need to move a little bit forward. Thank you very much. Nice. Good gunshot. Uh, star phase, we need you here. Here? Here. Here? Here works. Now I need to somehow move my line up so that Mandy doesn't get wrecked. So lunatics here is okay. Gold hand here. 
You are a bit desperate, my meow. Yes, you are. Meow. Yes, it is Pat's time. Hello. Hello. Unanimous prediction? Oh, no. Everybody thought it was going to be one to two deaths. That is a rare unanimous prediction. Oh, yeah. What was Goldhand's defenses again? 60. He's doing pretty good. Uh, I might put him here, then. And then Sink can sit here with the 1v1. That'll be fine. Uh, Korax, you're not going to do much in this fight, but I'll put you here. Because i got to work around those darn warriors. Make sure I don't do anything silly. Dormammu could probably sit here, and then therefore my front line is safe against warriors. Wolfang can sit here. And then Shives needs to sit here. And we'll see how that works. Not the best formation, but it should work mostly. Worth out for the homies. Chat, this one's for you. I hope it was worth it. Let me choose outcome if Snow forgets. Thank you, GB. Thank you. You had a bet for none. Uh, Knight, thanks for the spin. Uh, please be a nice distraction. Don't spin another orc. Because that would be mean. God, I have to stop jinxing it. Also, Mao, I, I love the massage. I need to... Okay, let me go underneath the Mao. Haha! -ha! She's distracted. And then... Okay, it's a skirmisher. Okay, that means it is a distraction. Thank you, chat. Thank you. It was almost an orc. That would have been really bad. Okay, we get our first lovely kill. Let's set up a debilitate for next turn. Thank you, Mandy. Good kill. And then Starface, we waited up. Gotta kill these berserkers. Gotta kill these berserkers. Hello, welcome to the show. The berserkers are here and we need to kill them very quickly. Ow. 24, you piece of crap. And he rolls a five for a hundred damage on my tank. Jerk. What's the hell, man? And GB misses a 95. Oh, this is going downhill fast. And then Digrin gets stunned. The ghost misses. Oh, and Chives gets attacked. Gold hand, I don't know, my man. But 95s are kind of nice. And then I need to Adrenaline for Sing so we can do that again. Yeah, Rebound Adrenaline seems to be doing okay. I'm not hating that build. Wingate with the 69! Let's go! And Korax misses his 69, so we can only halfway go on the 69 shot. So I love Steel Brow? Yeah, but I can't always get it. That's the sad part. Dormammu, you got a headshot. Why? Why would you do such a thing? Okay, we're in a little bit of a sticky situation, chat. We're in a very sticky situation. Fifty-seven's not bad. Lunatics almost gets the kill. So the question now is, what do I do? Do I move forward with Wolfang? What's his defenses? Thirty-one. That's not enough. I kind of want to move back with Wolfang, just to be safe. Uh, Stefan, let's move you one space forward. And then Cake, you need to sit where you are. Sing! Finish him off. Beautiful! 28 turns, good. So the only threat I have is Tina getting completely slapped by this Berserker. Please don't make that a reality. Mandy, get this guy. Thank you, Mandy. Go for another debilitate. Okay. With the Berserk debilitate combo, I am loving it. So debilitate on gun. Great option. Debilitate on anybody else that I do, I don't think it's a good option. So we're really just finding out better gun builds this time, chat. And I'm kind of okay with that, except I'm getting double 23s. 
Calm down, you darn young. Oh, the Berserker went north! Yes, he's an idiot! Oh, we love idiots, chat. They're great. Because they don't know what they're doing. GB, what would you like to do? Would you... Prepare for a shot at an orc young? Nice. New thrower builds win? I don't know, man. We've tried. We're doing one thrower build for Wingate. But it's not, like, super amazing yet. We'll figure it out. Do you love me? I'm an idiot, says Korax. Sure. Sure. Why not? Spread the idiot love around. Why not? The more the merrier. Uh, Chives is too exhausted to do anything. Digrin is dodging very nicely. Gobbo? That's a good 66. Uh, Wingate with the crossbow. Rolls of 58. What's the orc tip defensive and goblins are about? Um, I have not noticed that. Doesn't seem to be the case for me. But I guess, uh, I know what you're saying though, Brenly. I think I know what you're saying. Goblins usually bring ranged characters in. So whenever there's ranged, the in, in the green skin crisis, yes, 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 exactly. In the green skin crisis. So yes, orcs will get more defensive in the green skin crisis when goblins are about because they have ranged characters in the party. And just like any ranged party, there will be melee characters that stand in front of the ranged characters to protect them. And orcs will count as defenders in a multi-mixed party from a green skin crisis and therefore play slightly more defensively in those situations for a couple of characters that want to defend the range characters. Yes. Um, but normally, they don't really care. Normally, it's not that fancy. Ooh, nice hits by the ghost. But yeah, in, in the green skin crisis, weird stuff happens just because they're mixing with goblins. Weird stuff indeed. Uh, Wolfang, do I push you forward? You're on 31. Do I trust you versus a 282.55? 225. Not really. But then again, we need some damage, don't we? Maybe I put him here. Let's put him here and then move him there next turn. Because all Diagra needs to do is just shield wall here and he survives. Oh, I could have gone for a shield wall repost. Wait, isn't Digrin rebound? Where did I put him? I can't remember which character is which. There he is. Yeah, he's rebound. So I could have gone for a repost shield wall because he's going to eventually fatigue himself out. Could have worked. Uh, let's go for the slapper. Thank you, Starface, for a good kill. Mandy can go for another beautiful debilitate gunshot, which I can get... Four people, but one of them's dead. And another gunshot debilitate setup. Oh, this gunshot debilitate combo is great. I'm loving it. Okay, good hits by Lunatics. Sing gets stunned again. What a surprise. So I keep opening up that spot for the young to jump in. Uh, GB, that's going to be a kill. And that's going to be... Not a kill. That's okay. Those do those large fights since you impact the armies a bit? Yeah. But at the same time, um, it depends. Sometimes I think the goblin, I mean the green skin fights that are mixed, sometimes can be even worse. Depends if they have a shaman. And that's usually the way I look at it. If they got a shaman, you're screwed. Overseer sometimes can be really painful. But shamans provide a lot of pain. Yeah. Haven't actually done a gun build since GB. Hey, you're missing out. Gun builds are fun. They're not always overpowered. Sometimes they are. Ooh, Berserker's fleeing. And of course you get a 16 on my freaking tank. Oh, Lunatics, my good man. You are running out of armor and they've not hit you on the head yet. That is a pain. Tina, I need you to do this one thing for me. One. Two. She did it! Now that Berserker cannot rally. 
Thank you, Tina. We love you. You're the best. Yes, the Berserker's screwed. Happy, happy days. Good kill. Good hit. Nice rallies anyways. Hey, that used to be a thing. That was really annoying. Rallies anyways used to be a flippin' annoying thing, man. Uh, do I gunshot here? Do I gunshot here? Probably here. Yeah, Overwhelm's nice, especially since the Lunatics just got wrecked. Let's just shield wall them just to be safe. 70%, I'll take it. Nice. Nah, we missed a 60, that's fine. There's a Warlord, he could shout. Yeah, that's true, the Warlord could shout. 35% fudge. But don't say that, Rambits, now that's gonna jinx it. The Warlord could fail his shout, that's the other thing. GB's out of ammunition. Fudge, GB, you had a chance to kill him. A spin, what? 74, 74 fails. Fudge, we're having some bad numbers now. Give me a free kill, give me a free kill, give me a free kill, free kill, free kill, free kill, free kill, free kill. That's a yellow, that's not a free kill. Rambits, what are you doing? Rambits! Fudge! Oh, he's facing the wrong direction. Rambits! It's a freaking Shrat! Freaking champion Shrat, what are you doing? Dude, he's got 16 freaking 100 health! I hate those dudes. This fight has just got infinitely worse. Why did you do that? Creating content. Yeah, that's that's totally why he did it. I also hate that it gets hazy and foggy. 19% thanks game. I needed a 19% at this stage, didn't I? Um, Cake's defense is only 37, so we should wait it out. They're trying to break Tina's shield, the bunch of jerks. Tina needs to kill this dude. Thank you very much. Thank you, Tina. Almost shrat your pants, yeah. Did I put the shrats advice earlier into practice? Oh yeah, I was explaining to somebody how to kill shrats. Well, I do have a man splitter, so maybe I could beat the shrat. Maybe. Here's hoping it's possible. Don't have the highest hopes. Freaking hell, that boy has 400 flipping health. Stinking armor. Okay, hit this guy so he starts fleeing. He's fleeing, good. Solves that problem. Oh, hi, Shrat. Yeah, yeah, I totally need you on this flank. Fudge. It's not gonna be good. Uh, gunshot. Mandy for the freaking win! Oh my god, fearsome gunshotter. Oh, ha, ha, ha. I love this gun build. This gun build is stupid. I'm I'm actually falling in love with this gun build so freaking much. This gun build is stupidly awesome. It just it just works. I couldn't imagine a better way to do a gun build. It, like, like, dodge isn't needed, but it's nice. This is such a stupid gun build. It's amazing. The only thing I could imagine this gun build being better is having um, Wind Reader and Close Quarter Combat Archer. Close Combat Archer. But I don't have enough perks to make it that way. But, like, this gun build is so versatile. Oh, Quick Hands would be really good, too. Killing Frenzy and Quick Hands would be pretty good, too. But in general, like, the fact that I get Overwhelm, it's nice. The piercing shot to get the extra range, the fearsome to get these stupid procs, debilitate in case I ever get action, action points from like the berserk proc. Uh, the athlete to run around the battlefield to jump to other sides of the battlefield, which is insane. And you always need to recover. Like, fudge, this build's good. But I'm out of ammunition, so there's another problem. <laughs> out of ammunition. Okay, uh, can I get over here? No. Can I sprint? No. So I need to go over here. This dude's already fleeing. This dude will flee soon. GB, what are we doing? What are we doing, GB? There's nothing to do. Just shoot randomly, it's fine. 
Need to fight some snakes to get faster? Yeah, snakes make you fast. It's nice that way. Okay, Gobbo does not get a hit. Lunatics is fine. If he stops getting a hit. Fudge. This thing needs to go over here. Who's going to stop the tree? Wolfang, get away from him. 25%. Okay, tree, go kill the warrior, please. I'm begging you. Okay, Tina being surrounded is actually insanely good right here. Um, It may not look good, but it is good. Chives is struggling. Everyone's struggling. So I don't know who's going to deal with the stinking tree. But no freaking clue. Wingate with the huge 56! Holy crap! Okay, we are managing. I think our weapons are going to break before anything else does right now. Nice! You can make ammo at least a thing in the fire pots. Oh no, you can make the ammo as well as the rambits. You can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you can make the ammo better. That's definitely a thing. Oh, you stupid freaking tree! Fudge, I have to shield wall for the rest of my days. Uh, yeah, time to run away from a tree. Great. Okay, one, two, three, we move away. Oh, now the tree's confident. I hate this stupid tree. Okay, the tree's gonna kill this young if I don't. So I can go for this dude instead. Uh, 5% does not work. Great. Uh, GB with the debilitate 95. So this dude stops being a pain in the ass. Gobbo over here. You absolute jerk goes for the shield bash. Really? Ha! Ah, fair enough. Uh, Chives, get over here. Uh, Wolfang, uh, I don't know. I don't know. Get over here for the moment. I gotta somehow deal with that tree. Okay, Cake, you can help with these two. Okay, I am getting a little bit upset. 9% on the dude that's meant to be tanking against the stupid tree, you dumb warrior. This is not good. Oh, Wingate's exhausted. Uh, no! Why did I reload? Why did I reload? Oh, Wingate's in a bad position. That's not good. That's really not good. Let's hope Wingate doesn't get targeted. Fudge. Okay, how do we deal with this? I'm done. I'm done with this. I might have to spin claws this tree. This is literal death. What do you mean? My shield walling best Digrin tank, who is the is in literally insane. Sixty eight defense had a little bit more before he was staggered. Lithe and nimble. Just got shredded by two what forty six percent. I can't tank this tree. I can't tank it. I've got to get rid of him. It's too dangerous. Thanks, Rambits. Thanks. Now hell is going to break loose because I'm going to spin three times. Free kill. I will definitely go past that. Okay, it's just trying to give me free kills. Okay, undead. We'll put him up in the north. Legionary. Okay, that's not too bad. A 
it's rigged today. Undead, um, some sort of human. Militia's not bad. Okay, okay. It all hinges on number three. Undead again. Normal zombie. Okay, that's fine. Actually, it's a nomad zombie. Okay, that's a lot better than the tree. Sheesh. Use spin claws on the bingo. Oh, you guys got me to use the spin claws bingo. Of course you guys did. Now I still worry about Diagran's situation. He's bleeding from grazes. I just need to stop this guy from being a pain and then we can get out of here alive. Stupid freaking trees, man. Okay, Gobble, you go here. Uh, GB. Wait, is this dude resilient? Debilitate sucks against resilient? Oh, that's painful. That's painfully annoying. Okay, big guy's dead. Wonderful news. How many spins do you guys have to gamble on? I've had it up to here with the gambling. Is it Shrat a boss? No, 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 no. The Shrat's not a boss. The Shrat's just a champion. Champion and boss are different. Summoning the Ajirok is a boss. Why do I open my mouth? That's a boss. Well. Thanks, chat. Thanks. Chat summons a boss. At least this boss is, I don't know, is he, is he manageable? The dude's gonna slap. We haven't seen the Conqueror in ages, though, but maybe we can manage him. So, Korax, thanks for the spin. Thanks. Frickin' Emperor. Uh, okay, so at least, at least, Diagran will survive. Watch, I need to save Mandy's weapons for the Emperor. Uh, two for five, two for five. You will survive, and as far as I remember, Legends did fix it so you can fix grazes. So I just need to get someone with band-aids down here. That would be nice. Star phase misses an 83. That sucks. Mandy does not have anything but throwing weapons for the moment, so just hang out for a bit. Ah, you love me because you're an idiot. Yeah, yeah, we love you. That's, that's what I said previously. Gotta hold myself to it. Even if it's not, if, even if not having the warm feelings right now, the warm feelings I'm having is blood coursing through my empty veins. Double 75s. I gotta stop missing. It's not a good look. I keep forgetting there's an undead down there. Chives, this guy should be not a problem. Okay, gotta someone get through that stinking armor too. Just help me to get loot and make the fight worth it. I mean, I don't know what loot we're gonna get, but... Conquer armor might still be bugged, so I don't know if it's actual loot. Would be nice, though. Okay, good free damage on the way out. Free damage on the way out. Um, Mandy can sit up here. We can try and cycle. Okay, good kill by Diagrin. Don't have any band-aids for Diagrin at the moment, so that's fine. I gotta think. I think it's gotta be Tina. Tina is the only one who's gonna really stand against the Conqueror right now. We are slowly whittling away our tanks, which is not a good thing. Uh, I need GB to save some ammo for the Conqueror, too. A lot of things that need to be saved. Uh, uh, Sing getting over here is not a bad idea. That zombie, I don't know what he's doing, but he's taking forever to get through the forest, which sucks to be him. Militia's on two health. Gobble's got bandages. Ah, yeah, we could get Gobble over there with some bandages. Wouldn't be a bad idea. Cake's weapon is breaking. Yeah, 
Yeah, that's not good. Okay, Tina, I love you. Um, oh, of course he pushes through. That screws over my whole plan. Screw you, warrior. You just had to ruin everything, didn't you? Fudge, now I can't get up there. Fudge. Okay. Mandy with the double overwhelm, that could be really useful right now. Okay, big hit by star phase. Let's go towards Gobbo. You're not bleeding much more, but we'll take it. Lunatic's over here. I ran Gobbo away. Yeah, I did. I did, because in all honesty, the, the Grey's bleeds are not going to kill him. So I wasn't too worried about it. It wasn't on my top priority. My top priority is trying to move people to the north, because I need damage up here. Gobble with the bandages, Diagrin with the health. How's Diagrin going? He's got one more turn for 4 HP, so yeah, no, I don't need to give him bandages. He'll be fine. I'll save those bandages for an important emergency. Because that lovely Conqueror has a thing that can bleed. Also known as a cleaver. And he's a pain in the ass. So, um... Yeah. We'll sort it out. What'd you miss? Uh, the stupid warrior screwing over my defensive strategy. That's what you missed. Sure! Sure, hit the 35, buddy. Two stacks of overwhelm. This thing's gonna die. Fudge! Okay, I need to shield bash the Conqueror. Cake! Thank you, Cake! You gorgeous thing, you. Holy crap. And now Tina can sit up there. Yes! We saved it. We saved it. We freaking saved it. Holy crap, we saved it. Dude, this game loves to try and screw me over, doesn't it? Uh, let's go for a debilitate for next turn. Diagrin's fine. The ghost goes up for helping. Uh, Goldhand, you probably can go 1v1 this dude. Uh, Lunatics, he's already dying, but you may as well speed that up. Sing, get rid of this dude, please. Close. Tina could probably finish him off. As long as you don't get stabbed in the face, Sing, by a melee legionary. God, I shouldn't have said that. I should not have said it. Maybe I risk Korax's life. Korax, go take a hit. For, for science reasons. Yeah, sentimental and science reasons. Yeah, you'll be fine. He's got nothing to worry about. Doesn't even want to get stabbed in the face? Yeah, most people don't. Most people are definitely against those sorts of things. Stefan, maybe you put yourself at risk. Or you just save the situation altogether, Stefan. You amazing thing. Also, Cake, did your weapon break? Because the dude was fleeing and you automatically attack first. Just punch him already. I lost my weapon. Great. Okay, Tina, you go for it. What's he rolling on you? Conqueror rolls on Tina on a 30 and a 40. Wait, does he have fast? He's got fast adaptation. Lodge, that's not good. That is not good. Okay, we have debilitate. That's a very good chance he hits us this turn. So then we should probably save our ammunition. Yeah, let's just save the ammunition and go debilitate for next time. Does he have resilient? He does! Of course he does, he's a frickin' boss. Ah, uh, Lunatics can't do much over here. Sing, get the frickin' hell out of there. You're no longer bleeding, that's good. Korax, hit him. GB misses a 95. Thanks, GB. Don't get you killed. I'll try not to. Not many promises I can make on that front. But I'll try. And you take a 45-26 back-to-back, Tina. What?
<laughs> this is not good. Does double strike work for AoE attacks trying to make mine over body? Um, well, I don't recommend double strike. Mine over body sword does work. It is one of my favorite builds. And we do have a video on it. Um, but double strike's not that great anymore because if you miss, you lose the opportunity. But also it doesn't carry over between turns, which is really annoying. So I would say double strike on AoE is not recommended because you have a reduced hit chance. So I would say it's not a good choice. You could do it. It's not not impossible to do it. If you're rolling 95s and stuff, then yeah, sure, you can do almost anything in the game. But Double Strike on Mind Over Body Sword is probably not as amazing as you want it to be. GB with the aim shot does 7, so yeah, obviously we're not going to be doing much there. 54 is hey, so okay. Guess what? There's a spin here. For real, for real, my guy. I don't know what will happen. Sheesh, on God. Well, whatever happens, it better not be another boss, because I want to get out of this fight. Please. It's a red, so there's no way it's going to be a boss. But it's going to feel like a boss. Freaking fencers. Really, Nighthammer? Really? I don't want to have to deal with that. Watch. It's close enough to a boss, that's for sure. I've got no one who can handle this fencer. Fudge. Okay, well, GB, I'm going to need you over here. Uh, Cake, maybe you as well. Nicely done, Tina. Fence is going south because he wants to kill the zombie, maybe? Maybe. Mandy, I'm going to need you over here as well, right? Or do we debilitate? His fast adaptation is getting pretty good. Okay, we debilitate them throw. And then Manny's out for the rest of the fight. Because all I have is a melee weapon. And that's not a good idea to have. Oh, the ghost goes in. Oh no, the ghost is going to get killed. But at least that saves Tina from getting hit. It's kind of nice. Okay, gold hand. Maybe start walking away from the fencer. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Our friends are like swordmasters. They're weak to ranged. Yes. So that's why I'm going to put GB closer. GB, how much rangey ammo you got left? One. Shouldn't have shot last turn then. With a seven damage. Okay, we're getting some good polearm action. The ghost is dead. That's fine. That ruins his fast adaptation. Weird that the ghost went into melee, though. That's a weird action for him, but that's fine. We're surviving. Wingate, maybe you come over this way as well. No, oh, you're not going to die, GB. You're going to be totally fine. Oh, the zombie comes back. Of course he does. He's down to 44. The boss is almost dead. Fencer goes back north. Why? I don't know, but okay. Gold hand, go back to 1v1ing this dude then. GB, this is your only shot. He made it a headshot, so I guess that's alright. Good job, GB. Was not expecting you to hit that. Was really not expecting you to hit it. Gobbo misses. He's down to 18. Tina double dodges. Dormammu! Kills the Conqueror, let's go. Okay, now we need to try and do this stupid fencer. Okay, okay, maybe there's a chance. Tina, I need you. Again, I'm sorry. You've been in through a lot. You've survived, but we need you again because everyone is in bad shape. And the fencer goes back south. You stupid stinking fencer. What are you doing? Fight me! Okay, gold hand. Go this way. Wolfang, go this way. GB, you're out of ammunition. That's bad. Okay, okay. Uh, sure. Okay, Wingate's exhausted. Okay, that's fine. 
Fencer goes here. Oh, interesting. Let's put star phase here then. GB can't do anything there. Gold Hand, you have 64 defense. You can take on this fencer. Wolfang has 31. You cannot handle a fencer. So maybe we just put you over here. Mm, Wingate over here could work. I'd like to put Dormammu here, but he's going to get shredded to pieces. So let's not say we did. Stefan needs to go here. Tina needs to go here. Okay, we can set up for next turn. 46 on star phase and he fails. Oh, I could have used poison for star phase. That would have been maybe a good idea. Okay, okay, okay. Gold hand is getting chunked. Even though he has insane defense. Eight fencers. Gold hand, would you like to shield wall just to slow things down, my good man? Thank you. You're too kind. In other news. Let's get people who can actually hit in here. Uh, Tina, I'm going to have to wait till your turn happens because I don't trust. 8%. Dear God. Tina, get over here. Good. And then, Goldhand, do you have rebound? You do not. Great. He's a ticking time bomb. Fudge. Yeah, 60 is not enough. Yeah, let's try and get around. It's 40%. 34%. Some of these would be nice if we could hit them. Who has the net? It's Gobbo. <gasps> Gobbo, we need you. We could actually win this. If Gobbo survives us. Wait, he waited on his turn, you stupid fencer. He waited! What a jerk! That means Goblin needs to wait on his turn. Gildan, good job on the shield wall. Gobbo, switch. Wait. Good. Now we have a chance. Okay, Tina's getting bullied on double 46s, that's fine. Throw some sand. Good. We saved the sand for this moment. Throw the net. Now we win. Now we win. Beat him up. 70%. 60%. Oh, come on, Stefan. Tina with the 92. Good. Beat him up, boys. And we missed 75. What? Lunatics, you have... Oh, fudge. Stefan, why are you doing this, man? Why, why are you rooting for him? Wolfang with the 30 defense is not enough, but we need some damage. Nah, I don't want to risk his life. I'm going to have to risk his life, aren't I? we got to go for some damage. We have to. If we don't, we lose. Gold hand with the big cut arm. Gold hand saves us. Let's freaking go. Come on. Come on. Big hit by Stefan. Stefan misses. Don't break free. He broke free instantly. Instantly. No, I missed a 77. He's on poor health. One more hit. Somebody. Somebody hit him. I probably should have moved Lunatics up because then it would have given him extra accuracy. But he's on two turns. No, don't die. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. Oh, we dodge. Somebody. Somebody kill him. Wolfang. He gets him on the 29. Let's go. You don't feel so good. You feel great. You feel great. Oh, that was a little scary. That was just a little too close for comfort. And we get the beautiful Emperor's armor, his wonderful weapon. We get the fencing sword. We get a berserk chain. Let's go. Oh, glorious stuff. Whew.
Oh, scary fights. Thanks, chat. Thanks. Like we needed that to be scary. Rip chat on getting no winner on the prediction, though. No one thought we would survive that, and me kind of included. We went through a lot of resources. Everyone went down to very low health. Digrin literally was on death's door. Sheesh, there's a lot of people close to death on that. No bueno indeed. Okay, let's get Wolfang his Cleaver Mastery. As much as I want to give him dodge, I need him to get down to uh, infinite fatigue. That's good. Wingate. Oh, wait, I need to give him his stats. 3, 2, and a lovely 4. We'll take it. Uh, we need to save so I don't lose any progress. Yes, Mads. There we go. Good stuff. Good stuff. Wingate, how are we looking? Probably quick hands is not a bad idea here. He is getting stammed out in fights at the moment. I want to switch him to slings as quickly as possible. Hey, Snow, guess what? There's a spin here. For real, for real, my guy. I don't know what will happen. Sheesh, on God. On God, indeed. I think maybe recover is just the safer pick. I wouldn't mind quick hands. Uh, Gobble with the sickle build. Let's go for some health early just to be safe. We'll make a difference. And let's get some health again. Uh, Cake, I don't know what we're doing with you, man. But your weapon broke, which sucks. Gotta give you something new. Probably the f the glaive. Cake is not fast. He's probably more of a battle forged build. Uh, I guess we could go like a staff tank, but we've done that before. They're not super great in Legends. Snow panics bingo card during that fight? Yeah, I did panic. Yeah, we'll count that. We'll count that. It wasn't an easy fight turned into not easy fight. That's not what happened. Um, We got distracted by other games. That's true. We got distracted by Power World for a moment. We got a good DD quote today. And did we get sniped by Friendly Fire? No, we didn't get Cyber Friendly Fire just yet. Surprisingly. Surprisingly. But everything else is doing pretty good. Hmm. Chat convinces Snow to do something. What did you guys convince me to do? Not sure. Not sure. Goldhand, thanks for the spin. I'll do it in a second. Um... You convinced me to spim? I kind of was wanting to do that myself. You guys already got the spim clause on that one, so I'll, I'll just... I'll leave the convinced to something different. Because I was really feeling the spim. When when Digrin... When Digrin went down to 19 health, I was like, yeah, I can't handle this dude in any defensive way possible. I gotta get rid of him. So, yeah, I was on board with that from the beginning. Uh, Spearwaller build. Maybe we do Spearwaller build. He's gonna get 91 in accuracy, so we could do infinite Spearwall, and he would never miss. Would it go Spearwall Duelist? It's kind of weird. A Spear Duelist build? I never do those. Does he have the defense capabilities? Yeah, he goes 20 to 35. That's pretty good. Pretty decent. How do I make Spearwall cheaper? We go perfect fit uh, and rebound. And then I think there's enough to make Spearwaller cheap. Mm, I don't think I, I can't go fearsome with Spearwaller. Push the advantage could maybe work. Hmm. And base legend's kind of garbage still. Yeah, Spearwaller's not super amazing. But maybe we make it amazing. Recuperation could be good. That helps with fatigue even more. That helps with health regen. The PTR, it's pretty good. Yeah, it's it's Spearwall, Spear Duelist and PTR is a lot better. That is true. 
Oh, if we want to be Spear Wall, we need to be Steel Brow. 100%. Uh, Fortified Mind, because we need the more uh, Resolve. That is nine perks. That's too many. So we ditch Riku. And we ditch Battle Forged. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Sad to ditch Battle Forged, but it's kind of understandable. Seems like we have to go for it. Okay, so two, three, and three is good. And then we jump into Steel Brow. Nice. Yep, I like it. It's more serviceable in Legends. Yeah, it's, it's all right in Legends. It's 30 fatigue at the beginning, and then the 25% from Spear Mastery, and then the 25%, oh, 50% less from Spear Waller brings it down to a manageable uh, fatigue cost. So maybe I don't need Perfect Fit. But at the same time, maybe I could attack and Spear Wall at the same time. If I had Rebound. Maybe. I'll have to math it out when we get there. Uh, Stefan with the pickaxe build. Let's start getting the pickaxe. Or actually, we need we need muscularity for this build. Let's go health first. One, three, and... Wait a minute. We don't have rebound. We don't have recover. Why is it always the fatigue options? Um... I guess we're gonna have to go recoup with perfect fit. So miners don't have good fatigue options, so let's go with that four then. That's not good. Uh Korax with the staff build, let's get you probably backstabber. Early on, it's a good stat booster, and also uh fast adaptation's not a bad choice. Yeah, it looks pretty good. You got a bro since when, Stefan? Oh, a while ago. Yeah, we've had you for a bit. And by a bit, I mean... Three battles and two kills. Eight days. <laughs> Drop every fifth double strike if you spear duel is just for DPS. Um... No. Double strikes, no. I mean, yes... Actually... Maybe. Maybe you're right. Maybe Double Strike's better. Because Spears are meant to be super accurate. And I would recommend Double Strike on Spears. Maybe not Duelist. Maybe. He's not going to miss with a Spear. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. So 25% damage from Spear Waller. Uh, reduced Ignoration. Ignoring of... The Zone of Control, with 5% chance to hit on the Glaive. 15% damage from Thrustmaster. 20% damage from Double Strike every second attack. But then again, I'm kind of still on the Duelist side. What if I just go Muscularity? What if I, what if I just go Muscularity? That's better than Double Strike. And it's better than Duelist. Like, I know what you're saying, GB, but I guess... No, no, you know what? We're doing we're doing experimental builds. We're doing experimental builds. Maybe I try Double Strike. Maybe. I don't use Double Strike anymore because of how weak it is. 80 HP and Rising, it'll still work. Yeah, Muscularity would still work. But because of... Yeah, Double Strike just sucks. It just sucks. I don't know. I'll do it for the experimental side of it, but I don't want to like it because it's not good. Anyways, gold hand. I forgot you spin. Let's do that whilst I've finished all these level ups. You got yourself a minus bad trait, and we do have one of those. Pessimism. Uh, I think we also have hate of beasts for Dormammu. And for Korax. Damn, some people are upset. Let's, uh, let's fix the hate for beasts on Dormammu then. Because Goldhand yourself, uh, where did I put you? You're doing fine. You've got Prosthetic Eye, you've got a Survivor, you've got Strong, and you got Dexterous. You're doing great. But let's clean up Dormammu right now, and that sorts his problems. Nicely done. Why not both Double Strike and Duelist? I'm running out of perks. 
And that's my problem with that build. So with Cake's build, I'm trying to make it as best as possible for Spearwaller. I could maybe dodge perfect fit. Because he's going to be slow. He doesn't need perfect fit. Double Strike Duelist, dodge perfect fit, because with Spear Mastery and Spear Waller, he probably will be fine with rebound to never run out of fatigue. Thrustmaster gives 15%. Duelist and Double Strike are pretty decent, but then there's no way I can get muscularity on top of that. Unless... Wait, okay, let's do the math. I don't need rebound. I can go muscularity. 50% less fatigue on Spearwaller brings it below 12. Yeah. I'm not going BF Nimble Lithen now. I mean, the fact that all three are there are good. But I needed to go Fortified Mind because he's a deserter. If I didn't have to go Fortified Mind, I would go something more defensive. But for experimental reasons. Experimental reasons, I'm going this way. And maybe because the Spearwaller option and the Spear Mastery option, I don't need rebound. The experimental formations are just the bros. It's mainly just the bros. Uh, Formation-wise, there's not much to experiment with at the moment. Most of my formations are pretty decent. I mean, there's not much to play with because uh, we don't have Indomitable to try and like force formations to stay the same way when it comes to like shield bashes and orcs. And... Uh, we're jumping around with things like extra range for guns, so they don't need to be in a certain place. Uh, pole arms are protected normally. Yeah. I mean, it's a good question, though. But there's not many formations we need to do. If we had, like, a full melee party, maybe I could jump around with some other ones. You have bad defense to lure enemies to get spearwalled. Well, yeah, there's that, too. When you have, like, a spearwaller build, you kind of want to put them on the edge. Or in, like, the centerpiece, where you want people to come in get baited into a situation to try and constantly jump into the spear wall. So stuff like that. Yeah. Hey, Neil, welcome to the stream, man. Good to see you. Yeah, thinking this out. Uh, hopefully it works as well as I hope. Yeah, theory crafting is a fun thing to do in this game. And that's what we're doing in these builds. Theory crafting is always fun. I still don't think Double Strike has a lot of merit to it. Uh, Duelist and Muscular will do more. But... With the numbers as it is on paper, Spearwaller with Spearwall Mastery should make Spearwall uh, like 12 fatigue, if my math is correct. So I don't need rebound, which is weird. I fall to rebound every single time. I think rebound's one of the best freaking perks in the game, and it should be a must-have on almost every single bro. But this situation doesn't really call for it, which is good, because it means I don't have to rely on it. I can swap it out for a more offensive perk. Or a defensive if I had a chance. Anyways, 10 grand is ours. Solves our problems nicely. And uh, dear god, our food is dying. So let's quickly replace it. You guys eat a lot. Hey, uh, hey, tools. You thought you could get away with a sneaky spin, didn't you? You did think you could get away with it, but you didn't. We saw it. Uh, tools are important. Uh, medicine's important, even though it's expensive. Fudge. Uh, I need another band-aid. I need more nets, that's what I really need. Stupid fencer broke out of it, turn one. GB, the second subversary? Holy crap, man. Thank you so much. Just that it's not 24 months of tier three? That's all good, man. I appreciate the sub regardless. 24 months of snow. Damn. Thank you so much for the ongoing support, man. It means a lot. Um, also, Kratos, thanks for the spin. Let's get that in there. There's some non-Legends mods and going back to vanilla perk trees is rough. Oh. Yep, that would be very true, my man. I fully agree with you. Vanilla perk trees suck. They just don't have much flexibility. And they get so boring, too. There's nothing to do with vanilla perk trees. It's always the so, same meta builds. That and I, that's it. Snowbot must now let you know. Oh, very nice. Mine's a bad trait, we'll take it. Uh, Korax needs to be not afraid of beasts. Thank you, Kratos. Uh, 
Oh, whoops. I didn't do that one, Ralph. I needed... <laughs> I was distracted. I have to get Snowbot to do the right thing. Snowbot, work. There we go. Did I miss a spin? Oh god, it's a Necro. Why did he sound so, like, scared? Oh god, it's a Necro. He said it, like, so quietly. <laughs> nice one, Ralph. Nice. Okay, Korax is fixed. It sounds nothing like me. I mean, it's it's trained off of my voice, so it should sound something like me at least. But uh, <laughs> it's young snow. Yeah, it's it's snow when he didn't have his voice drop. Probably. Blame Twitch. Yeah, blame Twitch if you didn't spin four times already. GB. Uh, probably. Probably just blame Twitch on that one. There we go. First month is the Twitch streamer. Not current snow. Yeah, yeah, blame it on that. You should be glad it sounds exactly like you. Yeah. Doesn't need to sound exactly like me. I like when it sounds more robotic, when you can actually tell it's a fake voice. Then it sounds cool. Voices that sound like exactly like you, it's just like creepy and weird. I like it when it has a hint of like AI sound or like robotic sounds to it. That's what I enjoy. Because then there's some distinct reason as to why you should enjoy that voice. Carbon copies are just boring. That's just my opinion. It's like when you look at artwork. If somebody copied the Mona Lisa page for page exactly and did it all up and they'd be like, hey, here's the Mona Lisa number two. And it's like, but that's exactly the same as the other one. You'd like if somebody did something, you know, a little bit different. Maybe the Mona Lisa had a little bit of, like, edge to it. A little bit of a darker color or a bit more chrome or something. Like, then, then it would be like, okay, you can see exactly what it's like the first one, but there's at least a noticeable difference, and then that's nice. Yeah. Imitation is the, f the f purest form of flattery, but copying, like, word for word and... Exact sound and exact vision is just like, ugh, I don't like it. A bigger smile, yeah, yeah, yeah. A creepier, bigger smile. It'd be way, it'd be the best way to. Who got the conquer armor? Uh, it might be bugged, so I might need to save before I give it to someone. But we also didn't give out the beautiful cleaver, which is bonus damage but not minus fatigue, which makes me sad. Because I do like it when it has a minus fatigue on it. Uh, we also got a spare man splitter in case we need it, and the Berserk Chain, which I don't have any Flail Bros. That is rare. But in all honesty, I've done so many different types of Flail Builds and so many Flail Builds in my time that there's no need to experiment with more Flail Builds. I've done all the experimenting I need to do. Okay, Stefan, there you go. And uh, we'll save it up. And see who gets the Conqueror's ability. Uh, it's probably Tina, but then again, I don't know if this is better than Tina. 30 for 380, and that's 36 for 300. Yeah, Tina, it is. It's better. So, Golden Tina is a thing now. Very fabulous. And let's hope that doesn't crash the game, because it's not the famed layer piece. It's just the armor piece. We'll see. We'll see what happens. And then I don't have anybody to give this Hallberg to, except maybe Cake. Maybe. We'll see. Just finished classes. Did your character get in the run with the name? Uh, I don't think so. No, we don't have cookies yet. We did get Stefan and Korax, though. Yeah, you blind your enemies with bling. <laughs> They'll be very blind with all the shiny... Unless they don't have any eyes like they're skeletons, then you're kind of really shining on the wrong target. The immune target, as they say. Uh, but other than that, everything else is looking pretty decent. Don't know if I can give that unhold spike to anybody, but I'll probably hold on to it. Uh, Weapon-wise, cleaver, cleaver. They don't have anyone to give it to. I mean, I'm thinking a Wolfang could go cleaver build. But he needs an offhand... Wait a minute. Hmm. 
Wait a minute. Ah, uh, but I like the minus three fatigue. I was thinking, like, wait. Oh, he has recover. Wait. His defenses are what's the weakest part. Okay, that's maybe the concern I'm having. Everyone's waiting. I appreciate it. Um, I, I don't think he can go two-handed. Yeah, if he's going to be up in front and constantly tackling people, he's going to need a shield. Yeah. Nah, it's not going to work. I mean, it would be nice to give it to him. It does good damage. But fatigue-wise, it's 12. It's exhausting. And it loses his beautiful shield, which I need to give. Yeah. This for the shield could work. But you don't need a fist to have tackling. You can just tackle even if you have both hands full. As far as I remember, next long time when we level up, I'll show you. But I'm pretty sure it's fine. Tackling is great. Okay, we'll save. Um, save over this one. Just hope it doesn't glitch out. Uh, we need to go caravan. Please go north. Please go north. Please, it's southeast. <sighs> No, I'm not going to hunt Lindworms. Return an item. I don't want to. Delivery to Erzbrook for 600. That is a waste of time. Uh, I don't want I need a caravan to go north. Maybe Crumhorn has a caravan to go north. If they don't, I'm wasting my time. Okay, let's go. Ah, uh, let's quickly fix the injuries first, and then we'll go south to Crumhorn. Crumhorn, don't fail me! I need a caravan, please. Oh, Sing! Save Grandpa who fell down a well. Yay! Grandpa's alive! Not that it makes a big difference, but we'll take it. Okay, a little bit of healing, a little bit of repairs, and we go to Crumhorn. Yeah, please... Okay, footprints aren't super scary. There's a lot of caravans here. That's good news. Caravan. Coin delivery. Nightmares. Settlement. Beasts. None of those are caravans. Okay, I don't have any nets, so I'm not doing nightmares. I will do basic beasts for a thousand. That is fine. So, we should do meds. There's not a single force tile within, like, 20 tiles of this area. I guess there are such things as desert spiders, chat. Fair enough. Okay. Oh, and now there's a tree. I'm sure there's a tree. Sure thing. Anyways. Um, prediction will be up. There you go, chat. Um, but I don't think it's needed, because this should be a fairly easy fight. I say that as I miss almost every attack. GB, do you want to show me the piercing attack? Aha! The piercing does show when there's a dude there. I still hate piercing. But against spiders, it's not the worst thing in the world. Okay, we found one singular okay use for piercing other than like rabble and crap. Goldhand still can't sprint because the game hates him. It's so weird. Jeeves got hit off. Norris, thanks for hanging, man. Thanks for enjoying. You look after yourself. And have a good rest of your day. And the Mao will send you off with some cuddles. Yes, yes, some cuddles. Are you a happy Mao? Yes, I am getting massaged. Against my will, chat. 
I don't have a choice. A spin? What? Since when were you guys allowed to spin? Okay. Um, I need to keyboard mount. Thank you. Where's the consent? I don't know. I don't have it. There's no consent here. I don't have a choice. Chat, I'm being smothered. If I don't make it, tell my wife I love her. Oh, it's a free kill. We'll take it. Oh, she's finally set down. I'm still being slightly smothered, though. Uh, free kill. Where would you like it, Tina? There is a damaged spider, and then there's some other really healthy spiders. Or you could kill an egg. You wanted chaos. I know, I know. The more chaos, the better, but lucky, lucky heals and lucky insta kills are still good, so we'll take it. Get the closest egg. Ooh, you're too kind. Thank you very much. Kill one of the bros. You guys always want to do that. There's never been a time you guys don't want to kill a bro with the free kill. Sing misses a 33. Good job. How did you... I don't know. Don't know how even that was an option to go for 33s. The ghost goes and gets himself killed. Have fun with that, buddy. 21. Wingate can't hit anything. Dormammu. 63. Good kill. Wolfang, she stole your spot. So go over here. Uh, Stefan, you can't do anything. That's fine. Uh, Chives, 66. Good kill. Cake, 62. Nope. Tina is no... Tina has no armor. It didn't repair in time. Holy freaking crap, that's bad. That's alright, they're just spiders. Tina's fine. She'll be fine. She'll be fine. She'll be right. You don't need armor, Tina. You're that good. As long as I convince her that, she won't get upset at me. And we missed the gunshots. Really? 7782? We missed the gunshots, Mandy? These are some lucky-ass spiders. 77? I can't break free. I miss a 95. Uh, okay, we got the pierce. That That's kind of good. Uh, okay, GB, spreading out some damage. Korax gets a good kill. 45s, we can't hit him. Sing can't hit a 49. Dormammu saves Diagrin. Wingate gets a beautiful 16. We should probably save Tina. There we go. Stefan with the 62. Nope. 59. Nope. Cake. Breaks free. Tina with the 93s. Nice. Mandy gets the kill we needed. Let's go. 82. Oh, for the love of... What are these numbers? 56 we can't hit. Ghost is rolling on 9%. So can't really get upset at him for that. Forty percent, that's not good enough. GB. GB gets the hit. GB gets another kill. Nice. GB is keeping us alive. 62. We don't get it. That's not good. We save Wolfang, though. Yes, we get it. It's forbidden to hit a spider, just saying. Apparently so. Apparently you don't hit spiders. Spiders hit you. As we miss another 73. Hello? Hello? Can we break Tina out of there? Stefan with the double break freeze. Thank you, Stefan. Going the defensive route saved us there. Hake gets one of his hits. 
And Tina gets both of hers. Okay, it's over. We win. Okay, a couple of scary moments, but we got through. Sprint and Starface can't impale. He can't even sprint rally, which is what we wanted. Also, that's your leg, Mao. I'm glad I'm glad you know that that's your foot. Gunshot. Nice. She's cleaning the beans, exactly. At least she's not cleaning my beans. Cats have such rough tongues. Zoro's is the worst. Hers is not bad. When she licks you, it's not bad. When Zoro licks you, you're literally getting sandpapered to death. His tongue is like razors. So, and the thing is, he loves to lick you. That's the problem. Why would she lick my beans? Um, well, she wouldn't. Zoro probably would. She only licks my fingers sometimes. She's not the biggest licker in terms of, like, appreciation and happy cat. Red flag because of licking feet. <laughs> hey, some people simp in different ways, Tina. That's all it is. We don't kink shame here, although we still do. <laughs> but Zoro likes licking your hair and your forehead. So I will get a very red forehead after Zoro just licks too much. Because, you know, cats lick their own hair, so he obviously thinks my hair is good hair to lick. So, he just does that. He's weird. We totally kink shame? Yeah, exactly. Exactly. We will kink shame to the end of time. And feet are not really good. So we definitely kink those. And shame those. Uh, good damage across the board. Uh, and a little bit of loot. Spiders aren't really good loot. But we get paid, so you know what? That's nice. Do you guys sell for horrible? 14. Man, eh, not so good. Oh, nets. Almost forgot the nets. Da -na 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 -na. And I can buy your meds. Because I'm a little desperate. Do I buy an antidote? You know what? Maybe. Repair your armor? What armor? You don't have any armor, Tina. Look, you got no armor. It's zero. You're fine. Do I need more bandages? I bought one just in case, but I don't need more bandages. It just would be nice if I had more bandages. Let's give an antidote to Wolfang. Stefan gets a net. Korax gets a net. I don't remember to give that Vala staff back to him. Uh, Starphase gets a net. Who gets the poison then? Maybe Tina gets a poison. Hmm. Maybe. A girl I see her dog always tries to look under my arm hair and it's gross creeps me out. Ugh. That is a bit weird. Dogs liking arm hair. And, and like, sweat. Yeah, dogs like smelly things. So they're just weird for it sometimes. Like, dogs eat poop. Dogs are weird. So, yeah. Yeah, I wouldn't I wouldn't be too offended if I were you. But it is still weird. Lost your staff for a net, you want the poison, says Korax. <laughs> You're not the poison type, my man. Not this time. Kratos, we won't definitely kink shame that. <laughs> you kink shame the dog. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. We kink shame him for sure. Uh do we have enough to make nightmares? How much are they paying? Four and a half. I probably shouldn't, and I don't think I will. A day north for 400. Let's do that. Wait, that's a bit more than a day. Oh, that's further than I was expecting. Well, I don't have a choice now. Also, why do I still have the Arena Fight Ambition if they hate me? Are they even slightly liking me now? Oh yeah, they are. They're slowly liking me. If you show attention, he thinks I'm playing a game with him. Yeah, dogs are like that. They don't understand signals. They don't understand negative reinforcement. They only understand positive reinforcement. Dogs, dogs are kind of thick. 
in the head that way. Just a little bit. And cats are just stupid sometimes as well. Like, cats aren't perfect. They be very silly. Yeah, and this one be desperate for attention. <sighs> but you know, they have their good times. Cats are greater than dogs? Yeah, they are. They are. Dogs are still alright, but they, they kind of stupid. <laughs> It's as simple as looking in his direction. Yeah, yeah, dogs. They just, as long as you look at a dog, they're like, oh my goodness, he looked at me. It made my day. I had the best day ever. My human looked at me. And it's like, if you look at a cat, the cat's like, what? Then just does whatever. Cats couldn't care less. Except Ember is my... I've, I've got weird cats. This one's PTSD. I've got schizophrenia over there. And then I've got emotional attachment over there. So I've got, I've got multiple mental disorder cats, um, and my schizophrenia one, uh, she, she loves attention. Like, you look at her, or you walk past her room, and she'll meow, and then just be, like, super happy that you meowed back at her. Like, she's just happy you acknowledge her or anything. She's, she's just super easygoing. And what I'm walking, eating separation anxiety? That's, yeah. Yeah, that's Zoro. Zoro separation anxiety. He is attachment issues. He's got, yeah, all the shebang. All the good stuff there. Sell all the crap I don't need. Anything else? Probably a couple of these I don't need. Don't need those, don't need the orc items anymore. I'm pretty much over the orc items. Am I over the unhold spike? Yeah, it's a bit heavy. And if I have the miner, he's gonna have problems. Yeah, that's good enough. Also, three cats are all different. I won't go near, one go near me. One's another slot, one leave the other one's hit and miss. Yeah, cats are quite the personality. Dogs are pretty similar. Cats are pretty different. At least that's the way I see it. From my experience, dogs are pretty similar and cats are pretty different. Cats can either be like super hyper, super hypo, super cuddly, super distant, super scared. They can be like, I own my human, or my human owns me, or I love food, or I hate food, or... Like, cats can be, like, so many different ways. Especially the ones that I have. Um, but from my experience, from all the dogs I've met from other people, and the ones that I have in my own life... They're just super happy with just being next to a human. That's it. Dogs are just simple. You give them a pat, you give them a walk, that's all that dogs need to be happy. Cats are just happy if you're not near them. That's usually it. There's only a few kinds of dogs, yeah, at least from my experience. From my experience, that is what I've seen. Oh, you guys get mushrooms today. Nice. Enjoy. We always love the shrooms, chat. Uh, big game hunts. Escort caravan. Please be a good caravan. Yes, I'll take it. We need more caravans, more training montages. And then Tina's armor will be repaired. There you go. Cats are like humans, pretty varied. Yep. And have weird uh, mental disorders and also weird personalities. Just like humans. Hmm. Very weird. There's guard dogs, they need to leave them alone. And then there's the lap dogs. Yep. Both dogs have separation anxiety in different ways. Yeah, I, I know of somebody who had dogs that couldn't handle thunderstorms. They needed to be force-fed uh, pills to sedate them in thunderstorms. They're little shaky, little, little, little craps, as I say, little dogs. And they're just panicky little things that just couldn't handle anything. Um, those, I don't like little dogs. I don't know. Small dogs just have so much, so many problems. 
they either bark too much or they shake like they're just literally Parkinson's disease just of attention of, of hyper whatever. I don't know. Oh, I don't understand them. I had more dogs than cats, but had a Manx who had the absolute best very social. Loved the dogs. Always wanted to be in the mix. Oh, oh, as in like a cat that loved the dogs, Bjorn? That's nice. Do we take the gems? Mm, no, I need to train. I need to train, chat. I can't, I can't. If I take the gems, I can't train. Gotta pump the, pump the irons, you know. Get the muscles going. Oh, and we get attacked. Okay, great. All small dogs I've seen were most aggressive dogs I've ever met. Yeah, they, it's called small dog syndrome for a reason. They're psychos. They're just, they're just absolute psychos. They think they're just ten times taller than they are. Don't understand it. Also, new prediction, this should be an easy fight. Go for it, chat. Both of your dogs are rescue collies. They want to be with you all the time, but one will go everywhere. One wants to see you in the house. Ah, understandable. That's still, that's pretty similar, but yeah, understandable. Yeah, my, my cats are rescue cats, and uh, one of them, like, Asha, was in a pretty difficult You better difficult not be doing home. a spin when I specifically said not to, chat. I swear I'll turn this stream around. Yeah, Asha, Asha was brought up in a difficult home, so she has PTSD. Um, but Zoro, he wasn't brought up in a difficult home, as far as I know. Um, but he just has separation anxiety, because he's grown to be like that. That's just how he's developed. He just can't handle it if you leave the house. Like, if my wife goes to work, or if I head out to hockey or something, it's like... Or even if we both... Is it, even if just one of us leaves the house, like, I'm still in the house. Or she's still in the house. As soon as someone leaves, he's at the front door like, it's the end of the freaking world. He's crying. He's got his little toy. He's got his freaking emotional support stuffed animal that he drags around the house. Whines to hell. Even though my wife's sitting right there, and he's like, Oh, it's the end of the world! Daddy's gone. He's never coming back for the milk. It's like, dude, I've gone to hockey so many freaking times. Not even funny. <laughs> I've played a lot of hockey. I'll be back. He, he even knows I bring my bag like he gets used to like what I'm bringing with me. He sees me grab my hockey bag and he's like, oh, no, dad's leaving. Or he sees me grab the keys. Here's the keys jingle. He's like, oh, no, dad's leaving. And it's like, yeah, but I'm coming back, dude. Oh. It's, this, it's yeah, where's my human going? Exactly. He should know by now. <laughs> it's crazy. I think the brig rolled up the wrong camp. Yeah, they did. And sword goes, thanks for the spin. Maybe they rolled up with a little bit extra. Mode. On. I'm going to play some seven days. Don't get me killed. Oh, good luck, Tina. Oh, it's a yellow. No, he's back. No. Why? Why is he back? Sword coast. What did you do? We got rid of him. We can't escape the freaking trees. And there's so many freaking quests on this map that want us to fight trees. I don't want to fight the trees. But you know what? In this fight, I might have a better chance of beating him. I might. Check the Balwood chat. That's what I'm making. You're breeding monsters. Yeah, you're breeding freaking monstrous trees as well. Freaking heck, man. You're breeding it. Why are you breeding an R socks? And why did you give it Divine Dragon? Legend and Lucky. I'm so confused. What, uh, wait, does Arsox boost your damage? It turns into Robin Quill? Oh, because you're doing the cycle of breeding. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah, yeah, so it's the next one over. That's not bad. But none of that is Vanguard. I thought you were hunting for Vanguard. I mean, that's still a pretty good Arsox, though. But I hope you get Vanguard soon. Hmm. Don't worry, you'll get it. Yeah, you'll get it. You'll get it. Freaking madman, exactly. Stupid freaking trees. It's going to get confident, too, because we're going to kill stupid people near him. Oh, I don't know how trees are confident, chat, but maybe it's all the tree huggers and elves that make them confident. We always have to blame the elves. 60%, 69. Oh, it's also a night fight. GB, go for the split. And he misses both, or does he just miss one and it counts as both? Nah, the piercing shot's not great. Wouldn't you like to know how to treat him confident? Yeah, I would like to know. Or maybe I wouldn't. Maybe it's forbidden knowledge. Maybe there's a reason I shouldn't know. 
Okay, sing. Sit it out. No, that's not gonna work. Wingate with uh, 37 does not work. Gobbo does not get the dog. Dormammu is blind! He can't see two tiles! No! <laughs> Welcome to a lack of vision at night. Uh, usually, not the biggest problem. But it is most certainly a problem when you can't see. Okay, Tina, get up here. I need to beat that tree on high ground. If I don't, we're screwed. Uh, Benny, Mandy, let's go for the hit. Okay, good gunshot at night. We'd love to get a couple of hits there. Mm -hmm. Blood nourishes the roots, yeah. Full of that good old iron, as they say. Got any axes? Oh yeah, I got one. And I need to make sure Sing doesn't get wrecked. So Sing, if you stay at good health with your 53 defense, you're still gonna lose to the tree. But let's uh let's let's try and keep you alive. Right, let's put Stefan over here. Tina's gonna dodge until the fast adaptation takes over. So we need Tina to stay at maximum health. Can't hit with Diagrin. The tree goes for the back line. Thank you, Mr. Tree. Gigantic gunshot by Mandy. We love to see it. It's a pirate looking for his socks. R socks. <laughs> yes, the R socks. Or he's just stuck halfway through a question. He's just wondering, are socks good for your feet? <laughs> Stick your two feet in front of them, they are socks. Yeah, exactly. They are socks. But I think he's halfway through a question. That's all it is. These pals, they're just a bit slow. They didn't go to pal school. They didn't go to pal university. <laughs> GB, you finally hit one of your shots. Good job. Uh, let's go up here for a 48, and it does not succeed. Dormammu can see! <gasps> the height gives him vision! Okay, that saves you. And then gold hand. Ah, uh, the trees, the trees. Do I put you here to stop the archers? Yeah, fine. Fair enough. There's a miss again. There's another miss. Sing needs to wait it out. Wolfang loses his shield, which is horrible, but now he does good damage, so... Not the biggest end of the world. Why does that thug have five armor? That is weird. And I missed an 82 on a five armor dude. And now the tree's confident. Dude, how can you even see him? Stupid tree. Mandy is ripping it up. Huge. Big hit. Uh oh. Tree, don't come towards me. Okay, Chives is getting wrecked a little bit. He'll be fine. Tree goes north. Okay, he's going for the donkeys now. He's not going for the archers because I'm killing the archers. Understandable. But still not really the best outcome. GB! Beautiful shots, man. Well done. Okay, Mr. 74. Miss double 56s. That's bad. We do hit the 62, though. Gobble gets the 52. I don't like him on the high ground. I'm going to have to ignore him for a bit. Okay, can't do anything with Shrives. He's a bit exhausted. Good hit by Stefan. Good kill by Cake. If he goes around the back, I'm going to be okay with this. Okay. Weird dodge, but okay. Come on, Mr. Tree. Don't sit on a high ground and get me down the back there. 
It's what we need right now. Star phase, this is risky. And you missed the 81, dude. Really? Fudge. Oh, you dodged the 62? Okay, okay. I will take a tip for a tap. That's fine. That's a good trade. Oh, he goes to low ground. No, oh, but I don't have a high ground next to him. Fudge. So I gotta bait him? I think I have to bait him to a next to a high ground. That's gonna be too hard to do. He's got 10 action points. He could just run up to a high ground next to me. You know what? I gotta take him as he is. I don't have a choice. I gotta go down to meet him. Fudge. Okay, understandable. Understandable, have a nice day. Good shots by GV. Let's go get him. Sing, you're gonna have to go over here. Dormammu misses. How many spins do you guys have to gamble on? I've had it up to here with the gambling. Really, Sword Coast? We already got the tree. What more do you want? Oh, it was almost a free kill. It's a stinking greeny. Oh, that wolf rider is going to chew these people apart. Have fun with that, buddy. Have fun. Okay. Uh, we need to get all the pole arms closer. Well, fine. Good kill. I was worried you weren't going to hit that. May 30% doesn't work, as expected. Wingate with a 34. We'll take it. Cake? I don't know, man. I don't know. But Tina, you gotta go over here. Oh, he left. Understandable. Understandable. So it's just us versus him, practically. Starface misses another 82, buddy. Would appreciate if you didn't. Now, Tina, are you able to survive the tree? Dear God. Oh, no. I don't know. I might have to spim him. We'll have to see. I really don't like this situation. I will do my best. But I don't like it. I need to bring everybody up. Everybody's got to go. Except you two. You two need to get this guy killed. Five damage is kind of nice. It's not great, but it's kind of nice. Fudge, oh, stupid tree. And Tina can't, like, shield wall infinitely. Because she's got the fortify. Wait, doesn't have Tina have rebound? Yeah, so wait. Why did I start at 2 fatigue? Went over 90% fatigued. Ah, she must have been at like 17 fatigue. And that doesn't count as 90%. 18 does. She was at the perfect fatigue to not be able to strike twice. Oh, that's annoying. That's really annoying. If she gets to 17, she's screwed. That's the magic number that doesn't work. It's horrible. You know you want to spim? Yeah, I know. I know I want to. But it's so painful. I don't want to spawn in more problems. Okay, do we have debilitate on Mandy? Yep. Debilitate doesn't work if you don't hit. But 
Which is another problem for debilitate. Okay, good job, build hand. Good kill. Chibi, you want to debilitate this stupid tree? 5% GB? With 81 range skill? It's a 5%? Oh boy. What a time to be alive. And what a time to be alive that 21 times 2 damage is not enough. Oh god, we gotta throw some sand. This is not good. Oh, yep, and Sing is going to get ruined. Fudge. Okay, let's get out of here. Six damage. Cake, you're going to get wrecked in here if you're not careful. Okay, Tina's back to full. Oh, the Caravan Hands are going to bait for us. That's huge. That's actually huge. Thanks, Caravan Hands. We love you. Don't mind you dying for us. Hey, got to destroy that shield. Uh, Digrant, you are tanky. Let's get you over here. Starface gets over here. I'm ignoring the Goblin. He is nothing but... You dumbass caravan hand, why would you go there? Well, at least Tiger can take a hit. At least he can take a hit. I wanted them to bait this way. Maybe it still will. Maybe it's still gonna bait. Okay, Dormammu, we need to go around the back, apparently, because everything's getting stuck. GB has no ammunition. And it's still at 5%. Fudge. Yeah, let's get a bit closer. Thorax, 40%. Doesn't do anything except takes damage on the shield. Chives, you might have to stay here for the goblin. Redamage. Wingate hits the shield. This shield better freaking die soon. Yeah, he goes for the Digrin. Luckily, Digrin dodges, though. He's huge. Digrin being insanely huge and can't break the shield. Out of fatigue. Yeah. That's a problem. Digrin, you want to taunt and shield wall? Let's hope that works. Chat, we can try it. Taunt and shoot wall does usually work. Uh, Lunatics, can I get you in here? That would be nice. And then I need one more person to surround. I could maybe get Gold Hand in there. Oh god, we have a lot of work to do. GB, get over here. Wolfang, you sit up here. Every time I miss, in terms of, like, not doing damage, it does one damage to the shield. Which is nice. Except his shield's not broken yet. It's not even looking cracked. And I've barely done not even 50 damage to him. Oh, now the shield's looking cracked. Double 77s don't work. Digerin is double dodging, that's huge! Okay, four damage is nice. Okay, Mandy, you have debilitate, so let's do this. I guess an overwhelm's still okay. Why did I attack with Diagrin? I'm an idiot. I should have just gone for the taunt. Oh, I didn't hit the goblin on a 72! Fudge! Okay, GB, I need you here. 13%. Overwhelm at least is something. Gold hand. 91. Throw some sand. Anything. Anything at this point helps. Uh, let's get Dormammu down here. Break his shield. 
Oh my god, it's not broken yet! Oh, it's so hard to break this dude's shield. This is t this is all my entire team against this one dude. Okay, Ghost is dead, that's fine. Tina did get wrecked a little bit, but it's fine. Mandy, with the Overwhelm. Nice. Ooh, Goblin got stunned. Sucks to be you, buddy. Alright, let's taunt him. And then just figure it out. It's okay, your ghost is maybe gonna survive. Ooh, good hit by Wolfang. Dormammu can't see. But he's taunted. Right? He's taunted. So high ground, we do some damage. GB gets the debilitate. Nice on a 20%. Chat, we are slowly killing him. You better not be doing a spin when I specifically said not to, chat. I swear I'll turn this stream around. And by slowly killing him, I, I, I mean we want to kill him, chat. We don't need more things. My team is preoccupied, and whatever you spawn in... Thank God he's preoccupied too. Okay. He's gonna cheer us on, chat. We appreciate him. Thank you for the spin. Wait, didn't I taunt him? He was taunted for God's sakes! Dormammu's gotta be dead. He struck down. Stupid freaking shrap! I taunted you! Well, because he's got resilient, I don't think the taunt's gonna work very well. Um, that was bad. Emphasis on very slowly, yep. Yeah. Emphasis on the slowly. And the slower I kill him, the more chat spins, so I need to get out of this fight. Double 47s is not enough. Thanks, game. Finally! Took us for freaking ever! GB does 3 and 4 damage, that's bad. 73! Dear God, let this goblin die! 66. Oh my goodness, he's dying. He's finally dying. Digrin dodges. Thank God the taunt worked this time. Okay, now we just do damage. Oh, whoops, I hit lunatics. Sorry, lunatics, that was an accident. Oh my goodness, this goblin is not dying. So that's a friendly fire on the bingo. Okay, hit him. He's at half health. Big slapper. GB, keep it up. This goblin is dodging so many freaking coin flips. Tina, good hits. Don't you dare bring your shield back, you stupid tree. Yes! Yes! He doesn't have a freaking shield! Die! Huge! Thank you, the goblin, for finally dying. Come on. Yes! He's dead! Sheesh, I hate those trees, man. I hate them with a freaking passion. Trees and champion trees. That needed that needed literally like 10, 15 bros to deal with. Easy fight turns into not easy fight. Yep, that's for sure. That's for sure. Now, now this guy needs to die before you guys spin again. And then we'll be set. Oof. Hell on planet Earth. Stinking frickin' trees. Okay, Sing maybe don't go up just in case. It'll be fine. We're technically invisible, he can't see us. Who's close? Wolfang. Oh, 
34 is tricky, understandably. Same with 55. Yeah, it's too hard to hit. Double 40s, for sure, buckaroo, for sure. No. Yes. No. Yes. Someone kill him. No, he's close. And Tina misses the 84. It's fine. Starface got him. Whew. Okay, Dormammu almost loses his heart to a tree. Don't we all? We all have our hearts given to the trees, chat. Me, myself, I cut off half my heart and gave it to a tree. But, you know, at least Dormammu still has most of his heart. And, uh... We got some wood. That's it. That's all we got from a champion tree. Hooray. All that hell for not much. But nobody technically died, so we're happy. Who did you give your heart to? Snow Wife asks. Yeah, exactly, exactly. She would be very confused to find out. Oh... And yes, bingo is close today. It is. So is our deaths. Tina, level up. Let's go. Shall we go for a lovely muscularity? Or, you know what's even better? Born with a board. I gotta do it. Tina is tanking amazingly. But at the same time... Really need a little bit less damage going through whenever it does go through. Your ghost died, not nobody. I mean, he has no body. <laughs> um, so technically, no body died. Don't worry, chat. I'm here all day. Uh, and we didn't do too badly. <laughs> okay, what are we going to get from adaptive shield? No, spear. No, no, I don't want spear. I want shield. Shield group. Yes. Thank you. Shield perks. Thank you, Chives. Plus three, plus four, and uh, plus... No rebound. Fudge. Three, four, and probably fatigue, then. Nice. Skill issue on the bad joke. Hey, it was a good joke. You just have bad taste. Alright? Alright? It was a great joke. And I will not be told otherwise. I am hilarious. And uh, I need more health. Thank you. There you go, gold hand. Level 11. Happy days. Dormammu, what are we sitting on? One hammer duelist, which we could probably get the hammer perk right now, which means we can switch to the reach hammer, and that feels better. Quick chat clap. Yeah, yeah, clap, 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 clap. There you go. There we go, chat. This is easy. You guys love my jokes. They're great. I see no other um, responses in chat, so it must be positive. Yes. Yes. Drunk on meds or bingo. <laughs> hey, I'm doing fine, okay? I'm not the one that's drunk. I'm the one that's happy. There's a difference. Maybe. Maybe. Uh, okay, so the team's looking good. That's nice. Level ups. And I would like some more caravans. Nothing to do with the wood at the moment. But we'll see what can happen later. Good. Cross holes. Give me a caravan. That's a defense settlement. Four star. Screw that. That would kill the party. Return item, secure cemetery, or escort envoy. Where is the envoy going? To Hoenau. Thousand bucks. Dude, it would cost me a thousand bucks to go there and back and wait for your stupid envoy. No. Now, envoys are usually good, except my team is just way too expensive. And yeah, no, screw this. This would be literally hell. No. 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 Just just a whole lot of no. I'm gonna go find some... Stone keep. Stone keep. Let's go back up to wide stat. They're good at us. Is Korax expensive? Uh, you're 39 bucks. You're not too bad. 
You'll get some levels and then you'll start being more expensive. But you can't really compete with Mandy at the moment. Mandy's almost three digits. But at least Wingate Chives and Stefan are really cheap. And same with, I guess, Lunatic, Stormammu, and Cake. Hmm. You're a cheap idiot. You're a mid-ranged. Mid-ranged. Valas are not cheap. They're 39 bucks a day. They're mid-ranged. I'd say anybody that's close to like 50 bucks a day is pretty much mid-range. Anybody that's closer to $100 a day is high-ranged. And anyone 20 bucks and under are cheap. Packed with the witches, defense settlement, ending the nightmare. Man, you offer some weird quests, dudes. I don't know. I could maybe do the Alp quest. How much money is it? 2.3. Defense settlement is horrible. Packed with the witches, three stars, probably very deadly. And I don't like big game hunts because it's just a waste of time. So let's do some Alps. Could be bad. When you have something that's 93, 39 is pretty cheap. I mean, it's 50%. 50% isn't that much cheaper. You're half the man in terms of cost. You're kind of cheap. Which is why I call it mid-range. Kind of. Also, did I fix injuries? Wait a minute, wait a minute. Did I forget to fix injuries? Of course I did. Wouldn't be the snowman if I didn't forget. There's an alp in a hole. Kill it. Thanks for 74 bucks. Appreciate it. Stay awake, people. It is alp season. And yes, I could make everybody nude, but I'm too lazy to do it. It's more fun not doing it. See what chaos ensues. Oh, and we're in the swamp. Bodge, I should have probably moved. But it is only 11 enemies. So it couldn't be too bad. Predictions up. Um, then again, yeah, Swamp is really bad to fight Alps in. Well, let's hope it works out. And in the meantime... Oh, are you heading off now? I guess she's heading off. Oh, prediction time. Oh, I didn't give a shield to um our lovely, lovely Wolfang. Forgot to return that to him. My bad. But in the meantime, I think my tea's cooled down. Yes, it has cooled down. Very nice. It's a good time to drink the tea. Gotta mix it all. It's gotta be nice and strong. Because if your tea's not strong, you're just drinking very slightly flavored water. And that's weird. Very nice and strong. What's the cobweb on my mug? It's called a net. Thank you very much. And this is a hockey puck mug. It is a great, great, amazing mug. It's even got the texture of a hockey puck on the side of it. It's perfect. The only problem is, it's a mug designed for soup. So the lip of the mug is gigantic and it's very hard, very hard to drink out of. And I always hit my face when I'm hitting this. And I can't drink out of the front of it because it's got an even bigger lip. It's 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 a very hard mug to drink out of. <laughs> but it looks cool. So that's the point. It's not meant to have function. It's called fashion chat. If fashion was meant to work, they wouldn't call it fashion. They'd call it function. Mm. But it's good. Do I follow the NHL? Yes. Lazily. I lazily follow the NHL. 
You better not be doing a spin when I specifically said not to, chat. I swear I'll turn this stream around. How do you know it's not a normal cup and I'm short? <laughs> That's true. It could be just the visual perception that you guys don't see. Like, look, I have really big hands, really small head. Look, my, my hand's bigger than my head. It's insane. It's a weird perception. <laughs> um, but yeah, for NHL, I follow the Canadians, the Montreal Canadians. They aren't super amazing. We know that. But they've been my team since forever, so I stick with them. Uh, that is a red. Thank you for opening up the map. Ooh, uh, there's no dire wolves. So it's literally 11 Alps. Okay. And then... It's a donkey. It's a bit lost for a donkey. Oh, I'll give you something else as well. Am I from Quebec? No. No. I am not. Why the Canadians? Well, it's very simple. Um, I was born in Ontario. Obviously, you'd think Maple Leafs. Um, but here's the thing that I was plagued with. Ever since I was a young age, I had a younger brother. And I've been plagued with a younger brother. And he loved the Maple Leafs. And as an older brother, you cannot. This is legal. This is a legal problem. You cannot like what your younger brother likes. That is against the law. So in order to not like what he liked, I had to choose a different team. And there's no such thing as a team in Ottawa. Nobody knows about it. There's no such thing. And the next best team was the Canadians. So I went to the Canadians. So there we go. As younger brother, this is true from the other side. Yep, it is. <laughs> you just insist that he likes the other team. Yeah, but I could only bully my younger brother so much. I couldn't force everything upon him. I tried. I tried, but he couldn't do everything. My mind control powers were not um, updated to the highest ability back then. Yeah. But nowadays, <laughs> nowadays I have the power. They should really make another team in Ottawa, to be honest, poor guys. Yeah, they should. But this is the capital city. Wouldn't you think they'd put a team in the capital city? It just would make sense. It would. But uh, maybe maybe in the next expansion. Because they got Vegas a team. Like, sheesh, they even got Seattle a team? Damn, they, they're doing a lot of expansion stuff, but... Really would be nice to see something in uh, the capital city, of all things. Yeah. Unfortunate. <laughs> Should hear his side of the story next time he comes to the stream. I don't think he remembers that story. But yeah, we probably should listen to him. See what he thinks. Uh, Chimes, we need to slowly migrate a bit this way because we don't want to be near the water too much. Yeah, let's just do that. Tina gets the free shield wall at the start, which is funny because she doesn't get shield wall. That's physically impossible, Legends. You can't shield wall with a shield that doesn't have shield wall. Sneaky flippin' legends. Anyways. Mandy, you got a gunshot here? Oh, and there she blows. She's dead. That is a dead elp. Thank you very much. Let's go over here. Let's get star phase ready as well, because he's very good at killing elps. GB, though. Eight damage. You are not good at killing Alps, GB. Don't do it. Gold hand still can't sprint. Watch, that's annoying. Okay, Sing, can you can you be a deer? Never mind. We scratch that. I feel like being a Habs fan is less painful than being a Leafs fan, no matter how bad the Habs are. Yep. Especially since I can rub it in his face that we beat him in uh, the, the COVID wars. The Canadians went to the finals in 2019. Uh, 2020 for the uh, NHL Cup when it was Canada versus US. And then we screwed up when we fought freaking Tampa. We dominated. We played so freaking good. And then just gave it all away. 
That was our year. That was our year completely. We had such a chance. Oh, I was devastated. But I was still happy we went to the finals. We played really well. To get there, at least. To get there. Okay, Mandy, you outspeed the Alps. What are you going to do with that? 53%. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. Uh, Singh does not have a lot of health, so Singh should not be bullied too much. That would be a good choice. Pretty sure you're as well before Y2K. I mean, that is true. Uh, Montreal had a lot more years way back when. But I still think it was a really good year for the team. We had such a good such a good lineup. Oh, Hedge Knight coming out with swinging. Nice kill, man. OK. Remember, so all sport teams are frauds. Yeah, they are. They are. But we still have fun with them regardless. Even my sports team is a fraud. We don't make any money. Yeah, we, we scam everybody when they come to our games. Because they root for the other team and they they are incorrect with their assumptions. Because the other team doesn't win. <laughs> okay, wake him up. Thank you very much. Uh, 42. Nope, that didn't work. Well, I tried. Speaking of other teams, we are playing on Sunday. That's going to be good. Back at it. I am rusty. And unfit. So I've got a game drop in tomorrow that's going to warm me up, hopefully. Very hopefully. Oh, that's a weird place for you to go, buddy. May I introduce you to a lovely sword? Uh, Gobbo, I'm getting annoyed by these guys teleporting around. Can you throw a nut on one? Thanks, dude. Oh, Stefan. Look at the dude under the net. Oh, look, he's dead. Anyways. Hmm. You're a Tampa fan at the risk of sounding like a bandwagoner? Mm-hmm. Tampa native born and raised. Price was the wall that COVID playoff run, but the bolts were just at the top of the window. Yeah, and we just had a bad playoffs run at that, that final set. We just gave away so much, man. We could have had it. But the team was just playing very badly in that last set. But up until the finals. Up until the finals. The, the the Canadians are playing so good. The chance to bring back from Toronto, like, everything. It was beautiful to watch. The best to watch in years to come. But, uh, yeah, you guys just took us out in the last bit. But yes, if anyone says they're a Tampa follower, you definitely question whether they're a bandwagoner. Legitimately. Because my wife did that. She started getting into hockey around that time. And she's like, oh, I want to be involved in the sport that you enjoy. Kind of. Slightly involved. And I was like, okay. And she goes, okay, so what are the teams? And I was like, here's the lineup. And she goes, okay, so who's winning at the moment? And I was like, well, Tampa keeps winning the normal seasons usually. They keep getting near the top. She's like, oh, I'll go for them. And I'm like, thanks, dear. Thanks. <laughs> It's a hard divorce signal right there. Yeah, she she definitely went for the one choice. <laughs> but hey, over time, she's now migrated to my team. She's eventually kind of rescinded Tampa, kind of. And now she enjoys going for the Canadians a bit. Hmm. Like the tape tape goalie throw? Yeah, except no, Price didn't throw it for us, as far as I remember. It was the players. It was a player throw, not not a, not a goalie throw, in terms of the playoff season. So we can't we can't blame Price too much. He is out practically indefinitely though. That's unfortunate to hear, but he's got to take care of himself. He can't live with those injuries forever, on the ice. Oh, the double sleep! <laughs> Tina and Rue, um, get a room. Don't just sleep out in the marsh together. It's not a very good place to fall asleep. Just saying. I'm not saying from experience. I'm just saying. What do you think of Slaff? What's Slaff? She committed the hard carnison of being a bandwagon? Yeah, she did. 
I don't know why she would do such a thing. I'm totally not sarcastic. To me, saying this. you guys did a really good spin for sure. Oh, Sword Coast, you're back. I thought you were breeding. Go back to breeding. Stop spinning. Slavkovsky? Who's Slavkovsky? Did I miss out on somebody in the Canadians? Oh, you're off Slavkovsky. He must be new. He is a new kid. I haven't seen him play yet. Drafted first overall 2022. Nice. No, I didn't see him play. I'm used to um, Brennan Gallagher and a few others, but we lost a few players from last year and I haven't been able to keep up with it. So I haven't seen anything in this new year. But I don't know why I haven't seen him play. Number 20. Interesting. What's his stats at the moment? Forty-nine games played, seven goals, thirteen assists, twenty points, minus sixteen. Oh, that just happens. That happens. In his career of eighty-eight games, he's got eleven goals, nineteen assists, and thirty points. But in his last, in this season, he's playing better than last season. Oh, he didn't play. He only played like. 39 games last season. Maybe that's why I didn't see him as much. He seems all right. We always love Caulfield and Suzuki and Gallagher and all those. Oh, did you guys spin a flippin' monster sword coast? Ah, oh, screw you, sword coast. Why the frickin' heck could you spun a stinkin' white direwolf? You big fan of the halves? Yeah, the team's changed quite a lot since the depths of the standings. Yeah. I don't know. I, I, I don't like it when coaches decide to just completely revamp teams. Um, it just means they're in like a complete development year and it takes them like a year or two to get used to it. As you said, you're breeding monsters. Yeah, you're breeding monsters and they're horrible, man. Stop it. I don't appreciate it. I'm saying it out loud, okay? No appreciende. Okay, Sing, you need to hide. Desperately. Uh, I need to hit this. Thank you, Wolfang! Okay, Diagran is getting bullied. That is also very bad. I need to get some help down here. Sing, you need to run away. Thank you. Okay, I didn't wake him up. <laughs> what? Wait, how did he shield wall whilst he's asleep? Excuse me, muscle memory, what? The dude shield walled whilst he was asleep. I, I don't get it. But, okay, dude. Uh, it's a new meta. Chad, if you fall asleep, just automatically shield wall out of just, you know, mental capabilities. It makes sense. Don't question it. Mr. 56, fair enough. That's kind of bad, though. Good gunshot by Mandy. Uh, I need to kill this dude. No, fudge. He's using his shield as a blanket? Yeah, that's one way to do it. Trust the blanket. Always. Big hit by Starface. Thank you very much, Starface. Okay, Diagrin, Diagrin, please survive, buddy. You are nimble, so you shouldn't be taking things like sevens. But that's just my opinion, apparently. Oh, the double sleep. Can you guys resist a sleep for once? It can't be that hard. Nine? Sheesh, seven again. He's gonna die. Good kill, good kill. For the love of God, Digrin, how much? You have 61 resolve and you can't resist a single freaking sleep. And then Sing is getting wrecked. This is, this is turning out to be a problem. OK, 
Okay, at least he's asleep this time, not putting his shield up. Okay, sing. Thank you. Okay, the white wolf is gonna go after the donkey. Fair enough. Mandy misses. 30, but it doesn't kill. He's on four health. Fudge. No. That's bad. Wake him up. GB, you can't hit the Darwolf from here, can you? Oh, he did. Good job, GB. You did very minimal damage, but that's okay. Oh, and Sing is dying. That Sing's on one health. Stupid freaking Alps, man. I hate Alps, and I hate Alps. Yeah, there's a White Wolf. Stupid freaking Alps. It's not good. Tina, you're going to have to deal with this white wolf, I think. But then no one's going to be able to deal with this Saru. Okay, let's just, just keep doing that. Hey, he woke up. Jerk. Um, what can I do with Wolfang? They want Digrin. Oh my god, he's still at a turn. Fudge. Digrin, run away. White Wolf goes after Cake. Oh, that's bad. Mandy, would be nice if you hit something. Would be a little bit nice. Goldhan, can you kill this dude for me? Actually, no. No, because they're going to teleport. Nice. Wingate, what do you have, buddy? Nothing. You got javelins, at least. Okay, that's fine. Cake is pretty delicious. I mean, you're not wrong. You're not entirely wrong. Fudge, Dormama can't see things! It's freaking blind! Thirty-seven percent, my ass. Uh, Corax has a net. Okay, I need to kill this one. Axe in nine turns. Fudge! I need to wait. Tries with the seventy. Nicely done. Stefan with the sixty-six. Nicely done. Cake, do we want to go... Well, you have 33 defense. Chives has how much? 38. Yeah, let's shield wall this. Tina's in a 1v1 and technically is going to win. Diagrant, we run away. Star phase, we... Don't successfully rally the troops. Good double kill by Goldhand. And the Alps are fleeing. Let's freaking go. Cake with the shield wall worked. Oh god, he just got wrecked. Mandy with the sprint, switch hands, and can't do anything. Uh, Diagrant, you stay out here. Uh, Lunatics, that is very bad. OK, 
Okay, that's fine. 53, good job, Gobbo. GB, is he de debilitated? He still is. Nice! Okay, Dormama, go over here. Can we do anything else? Still can't sprint. That's not what we can do right now. Hey, hey, I saw that. You thought you could get away with a sneaky spin, didn't you? Oh, no. Oh, no, I did a stupid. Oh, no. I did a very stupid... The Alp has five turns? He didn't end his turn, he waited? Oh, we're dead. Please give me a free kill. Please give me a free kill. Neob, come on, man, come on. Yes! Neob, please kill this one. Please. I appreciate it. You gonna kill the donkey? You are... Actually, it's a spawn-in, you can't kill it. It's a spawn-in. You're not allowed to kill the caravan, and you're not allowed to kill the white direwolf. You have to kill an alp. It's either the one that's fleeing over here, that's full health, the one that's dying in front of uh, lunatics, or this one. The far right. That forces the teleport over here. Maybe that saves us. Maybe. I'm gonna flip and hope so. Okay, you need to shield wall again, buddy. Good job, Tina. Okay, he's fleeing. He's fleeing! <gasps> it's fine! We survived! We survived! Do, do, do. And Cake is gonna die because he just keeps getting hit. Great. And Mandy misses a 73. Which is great. <gasps> but Starface can rally. I used to complain about my veteran difficulty playthrough, but now I'm thankful I don't have a wheel to spin. Yep. I'm pretty sure you're uh, very happy you don't have to deal with that. Yeah. I mean, as much as the free to kill comes around every now and again, it's nice. It's just, you know, still difficult. <laughs> Thank you, GB, for the debilitate. It helps. Dormammu can't seek crap. So we can't do anything with him. Gobbo still doesn't have a net. Stefan used his net. So who else has a net? Oh, Starface does. I might need to use Starface's net. Okay, good job, Ghosty. Okay, they're fleeing, that's fine. Lucky out of spin, says War Sword Coast. Yeah, I am. And I will take that. Although, I think my backline is just going to get wrecked now. But he's going to footwork. So maybe I move Tina Chan here. <gasps> that scares the White Wolf! That's huge! That's actually huge. The Overwhelm! And Cake still dies because Overwhelm doesn't do crap! Oh, he's struck down. It's fine. And then he goes after Dormammu. Of course he does. Of course he does! Fudge! That's... Really? Really? You go over here. You don't even over... You don't... You don't footwork over here to these two? You don't break through my line? You literally go after Dormammu? Yeah, sure, man. Sure. Why not? That's the worst freaking place you could have gone. I've got no way of hitting you. There's two freaking reds here. Watch. I can't. I need to throw a net on him at least. Uh, I guess I put Stefan here. 
Oh, of course you get over there. Of course you do, you stupid knight. Tina, get him. Starface, get him. Oh, 51. Fodge. Double 60s doesn't hit? Oh, that hurts. It hurts a lot. Okay, go. Oh, no, now he's got stuck in wind. GB misses. Starface misses. Everybody's missing. Why is everybody missing? Dormammu, you better have a freaking shield. You do not. Of course he doesn't. He's dead. Does Wingate have a shield? Yeah, he does. Okay, good. Can I shield bash? Oh, I can! It's not enough, though. I don't do enough damage. Oh, wait! The knight decided to do something nice to me. Oh, yeah, there's a double kill. Struck down chives. Killed Dormammu. Yep. Double 62s doesn't work. Yep, nothing's working. Stupid freaking direwolves, man. Oh, I knew someone was going to die. I'm killing the donkey because of this. I'm, I'm, I'm having revenge on my donkey. Your mom has bargained for the last time. For the last time, chat. And he breaks free. Of course he breaks free. Of course he breaks free. And of course he's rolling on 50s and he doesn't miss. I can't hit my 50s, but you can hit your 50s, you stupid dire wolf. Hodge! Dude! Just freaking die! I have to deal with this stupid shield rolling dude as well. Yep, there we go. Lunatics is dead. No, he's struck down. Okay, he's not dead. But he's really freaking close to dying. This this stupid Darwell's gonna run amok. He's already confident. Wolfang, you are the only hope, but you can't kill him. He's also got last freaking stand! And you have 16 defense, you're dead. You're so freaking dead. <laughs> that one freaking maneuver costed me the entire fight. If he just didn't footwork back there to get to Dormammu, we could have had him surrounded and ruined. I hate enemies that get footwork. They don't need that kind of mobility. Finally got rid of the big dude, but it's too little too late. Do I bait him in? Doesn't it makes him move one more tile? Fine, I bait him in with one more tile of movement. Or I count him as fleeing. But if he flees, you guys get an undead. But he's on the Alps team, so it counts as fleeing. I could give you guys an undead in the next fight, because I can't spawn it in once he flees. That saves a life. I don't get the loot, but at the end of the day, there's no way I can get rid of him whilst he gets rid of multiples of my bros. I gotta let him leave. I gotta let him leave. And Dormammu's the only real costly... I mean, obviously these injuries are bad. We could have lost four bros, but thank god resilience saves... This time, so Resilient does not always save me. And we do get an Accuracy Sigil from one of the Alps, which is really nice. 5% melee skill, 9% range skill. Might give that to GB. 
if he gets a famed bow. Um, but yeah, one loss. Pretty bad. Could have been worse. But chat, remind me, I gotta give you guys a undead in the next fight. Sheesh. Oh, of course it had to be a white wolf of all things. Of course it did. Uh, I do have famed weapons. I'd rather put this on a famed weapon than a normal weapon. Something like the cleaver. Uh, but I don't think it's a famed weapon I've fallen in love with other than the striker. GB doesn't have a famed. 9% would be really nice. If I get a famed bow, I'll put this on it. were you guys allowed to spin? Yeah. Thanks for the spin. Uh, let's get Gobbo his dodge. See if that actually makes a slight difference. A little bit of extra HP. Any other levels? No. So let's uh, let's do that. See, so we got a heal. We need a heal. We desperately need a heal. It's the times like these that I appreciate the chat healing. Uh, that is stats. That is that's the wrong green. But Korax, I'm pretty sure you're not complaining about getting some stats. Fifty nine. Hit the wrong button. Of course, I hit the wrong button. Or is it too late getting a streak to continue? Congratulations, everyone. Keep that streak going. Debug mode on. 62. There we go. Debug mode on. There we go. Now, we're still doing another fight, at least. At least one more fight for today. And hopefully finding a famed bow. That would be really nice. Uh, I need to move off the stupid, stupid swamp. And fix up some healing. Sheesh. That was a horrible fight. But we somehow survive. Somehow survive. I think that would be a... What did, what happened? Still gets killed like a uh, Kevin Contraband? No, none of those options. We'll just prop that down to a skill issue. Sheesh. Is DNA session and brain was starting afterwards for us to That's alright, good man. Hopefully you had a fun time. Health points repaired. We're almost out of tools. We are out of tools. Yeah, they shredded us a little bit too much there. No new quests and expensive tools. I'll have to buy them. Don't have much of a choice. There we go. Hi, Meow. You've been desperate for paths today, haven't you? Very desperate. Fighting the big boss. Already had a blast. That's good to hear, man. Well, yeah. Hi. Okay, well, I'll need my hand back. Thank you, now. Okay, uh, up to Ho and How we go. We're trying to go up to the big city to see if we get some quests. Clingy girlfriend spotted? Yeah, that's, that's basically this cat. She is the clingy girlfriend. She wants me all to herself. She side-eyes my wife and chooses me over her. It's funny. She used to cuddle me in bed. She now changes her bed into this room because she's been a bit unwell. So she's still... She still has health problems, but she's a lot better since the surgery. Um, but she doesn't sleep with us too much anymore. But the funny thing is, when she used to sleep with me, she would give my wife the side eye and be like, how dare you cuddle my snowman? And she would be like, so jealous. This my wife would chairman out this one. This one would be jealous. My wife would be sad because the cat would give her the side eye and steal me away from her. It'd be hilarious. But yeah. Both seem to be having health problems. Uh yeah, my wife, we came back from the hospital yesterday. This one, this one always has problems because she's getting old. But her surgery is over. So she's a lot better since the surgery, but she still has little issues. Yes, you do, don't you? You're just getting old. Yeah, you've got old people problems. Yes, you do. But hey, Kiko, welcome to the stream, man. What's cooking? Not too much, other than the fact one of our bros is cooking under the ground. Other than that, we're doing okay. I might look for a new recruit, though, chat. It wouldn't be a bad idea. No, that miner sucks. That guy sucks. No. Do we try Witch Hunter magic build? Yeah, not with those stats. Maybe we get a Witch Hunter for somewhere else, and that would be nice. Um, nothing from the... Fletcher. Fletchers suck. Worst place to shop. 
Is the cat a Manx? No, this is a Russian blue mix. So, she's mostly Russian blue, but she's got a couple of white patches. Where she's not supposed to. But she's very pretty. She's a very pretty kitty cat. Sister cat had to go and get checked out by a vet. Got her stomach shaves. It's so gross. Oh, yeah. They look so weird shaved, man. If it's, like, just a part of a, the cat. Like, she had her back side shaved, so she had, like, this just indent in her for so long. Yeah, you did. And your hair had to take three months to grow back. Takes forever, but now she looks normal again. Which is wonderful news. But for three months, she looks so weird. Just missing, like, parts of her arm and... <laughs> it makes them look like they're wearing pantaloons or something. It's just hilarious. Cats always look funny when they're shaved. Doesn't matter what cat it is. Unless it's a sphinx, because then they have no hair anyways. Uh, caravan, yes please. Two days to the east, I would love to do that. I don't want to do any of your haunted wood stuff. Uh, hunter. No, I didn't like that hunter that much. I might as well get rid of him. That's a fancy looking cripple. Uh, is there anything we want from cripples, chat? Uh, unless fashionable and stuff. We've already done that build. We don't like that one as much. No. Hedge Knight's way too expensive. A Butcher Tank could be useful. Kind of looking for a Witch Hunter, though. Because that would be interesting. Uh, Wildman would be unarmed. No. No, I don't want any of those. Okay, I'm not super desperate right now. Check the Fletcher. They only have a 20 arrows. Five grand, though. They have the sling I need. And to be honest, you can't get famed slings in this game. At least this mod. So Wingate getting the buff on it's not bad. But yeah, Sphinxes are wrinkly and weird. They're very weird. Uh, we can sell the peat bricks for a pretty penny. Hmm. I might be able to find a northern sling on sale in a marketplace somewhere. I'm not desperate to get it right now, though. That's the thing. Like, I see it there in the shop. But I'm not desperate. This, though, the 20 huge quiver of arrows, that is hard to find. That is not a common find. And yet there are two of them here. 20 bolts is also really hard to find as well. And should be more expensive, because that is worth a lot. Um, GB, do I get you 20 arrows? You've been running out lately. I'll do it. I'll do it. He needs it. They're huge. They're lovely. It's worth 4,000 buckaroos. GB better be proud. And, uh... Keeping his shield in the back pocket's nice as well. Probably give him a ranged defense shield. Slightly better shields on the bros that need it. There we go. Backup shields. Okay, um, I guess we just go for the caravan now. There's not much else I'm really hunting for. We need to get some XP and some training montages happening. Gotta get those levels up. Uh, did we have an injury to fix? No. We have the permanent injuries we want to fix. But that's as far as it's going to go there. Yeah. They charge you ten times as much for the larger air holders. Economy is clearly balanced. Yeah, it's based. <laughs> well, I'm glad I got the extra arrows. Really? Working on holds. Oh, and I have to give chat the undead spawn. I remembered, chat. I remembered. Fudge. Alright, well, it's prediction time. And we did lose one to two last time, so congratulations on the non-believers. It's the hairy snowman? Yeah, it's the hairy snowman. As much as we enjoy our normal snowmen, these are the originals. They're the OGs. And that is a treasure hunter. Good. That's better than a white dire wolf. I'll tell you that. So, GB, you're going to be instrumental in this fight. Arrows are good against unholds. So let's hope it works. 
Yeah, let's hope so. Sword Coast ran out of spins? Good. Good. That's enough spins for me, my man. That's plenty of spins you don't need. I don't like that high ground. Uh, let's fight for this high ground. Sing has repaired. That is good news. So let's bait him into rushing Sing. Your turn is done. Wingate with a good crossbow. Gobbo. Wolfang. Looking pretty good. Let's put cake on the edge. A spin? What? Since when were you guys allowed to spin? Well, if Sword can't spin, someone else can. Mm, is that undead again? Yep, just barely undead. Great. Okay, okay, great. It's fine. It's just a basic undead. Isn't that right, Mal? He's just a baby undead. He's just a baby zombie. Nothing to worry about. Baby zombies can't hurt you, chat. Now, Tina, would you be so kind as to shield wall for free in there, even though you legally can't shield wall, and deal with three unholds whilst I deal with the rest of them? Thank you. We love you, Tina. Okay, now we go up here for a slapper. Risky for star phase. I know, I know. Oh, but I could scare him. Let's just do it. Let's just do it. Let's get rid of him. Let's just punish this dude as quickly as possible. 59, we missed. I don't like that he's on the high ground, but we could live with it. Uh, do we hit Sing? How about we just throw some axes? That's nicer. It does proc... Oh, it didn't proc the, um... Fearsome, sadly. 7%! Now that is how you call a delay of round. Thank you very much. Sing with the 77. Are you actually kidding me? No freaking way you missed a 77, man. 95 gold hand, what are you doing? 95 GB, that's back-to-back -back 95s. Are you actually kidding me? Zombies can't hurt you, tell Phyllis of that. Yeah, baby zombies. Hey, they're not that bad. They're bad, but they're not that bad. I can't believe I just double missed 95s. And he hits double 26-21? Dude, we live in a simulation. There's no freaking way. There's no way. Treasure Hunter on a 60, that's somewhat okay. Tribes, you get in there, buddy. Tina, you can't do much, so go for the hits. Okay, Sing is first and can't do anything with it. Great! Gotta love that. Digrin, you are pretty good at this, so go for a hit. Mandy with the Overwhelm, nice. 56, somebody kill him. Somebody, anybody. Ghost misses. And steals Korax's spot, you stupid freaking ghost! Why? You stole my spot! Mm. Okay, how can I shoot this stupid dude? I can't. Hey, good job, GB. Cake is losing to a zombie. Okay, he gets thrown. Diagrin gets punched. 34, we miss. Thank God, Wolfang hits. Thank God. Okay, we hit him by a 41 again. That's not good. But thank you for the lovely headshot. Already fearsome proc. We love to see it. Uh, Cake is losing to the zombie. Chives, go save him. Fudge, that's annoying. Tina, amazing spot to be. Greatest spot to be right now. Right behind the unholds. 
Uh, Korax, do you have to 1v1 the zombie? Probably. Digrin. Go here. Double axes. Love it. He's fleeing! The fearsome Brox! Let's freaking go! Huge! You can barely see it, but he got the fearsome Brox off. That's what matters. Okay, now the ghost does something good. Took your time, buddy. Okay, GB already procs another fear tracker. Let's go. Uh, Gold Hand, scare him. Gold Hand misses a second 95. That is two rolls Gold Hand has done in this entire combat. And he's missed both of them. Do you feel happy, buddy? Do you feel happy about yourself? Rolling for perfection? Oh, that's a bad throw. Ooh, that hurt. Mr. 69. Sing, could you please? Thank you. It didn't do very much, but it did something. I need this fearsome Brock. Somebody hit him. Double 82s? Are you kidding me? Range attack, chucking a bro at a different bro. Yeah. Yeah, we need those. We need more of those. Okay, that didn't work. Just need him to flee. That's all that's all I'm asking. Okay, Mandy, we're trusting you. Dang it. Fearsome proc didn't get it. It's a reference to Fey Run. Referencing Baldur's Gate, Tales of the Sword Coast, back from 2000. Yeah, 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 it's referencing Sword Coast. The Sword Coast. That makes sense. I assumed, but I didn't know for sure. Uh, can I get this crossbow bolt, Wingate? Oh, that would have been nice. Would have been real nice. GB, you want to try and do it? It's not enough. Somebody's going to get punched. Decap. Decap. Yes. Okay, we didn't need to fear him. He's dead. Well done, boys. The job well done. Okay, thanks for the double freaking 29%, dude. Hey, Goldhand can hit something. What a surprise. Nobody believed in him. Let's go save top flank because they're somehow struggling with a single zombie. Just another 95. All right. Dagger with a slap. Uh, Mandy needs the gun again. Actually, Mandy can go into melee. Because this dude's fleeing. I never put Mandy in melee, but I may as well this time. Okay, good. Good! The treasure hunter missed. It's actually kind of huge. Missed an 80%. Would like to hit those. Just from personal preference. Same with the 86s, Sing. Sheesh. We are not getting good numbers today. I mean, we're getting good numbers. We're not hitting good numbers, and you're hitting all your 20s and 30s, dude. <laughs> oh my, what is going on? It's another 80% miss. Sheesh. Okay, good hit on the way out. Good hit. Great hit by Starface. Stand on the corpse. Don't let that jerk come back. Mandy with the good hits. Okay, we just need one guy to die and we're done. That's it. <gasps> I should stand on the corpse. Whoops. I forgot about the corpse. Good kill by GB. Okay, stand on the corpse. There we go. Nice, there goes a bit of a fear proc. It's not a fear proc, but it's good enough. 
Ooh, uh, not a throw, not a throw. No, he comes back anyways. Jerk. Standing on the corpse didn't help. Man, you can take a hit. Let's go for that Overwhelm. And the Fearsome proc. I don't like putting Mandy in melee, but at the same time, it's not the worst thing. Also, the Ghost is going to take a hit. Thanks, Ghost. <gasps> Maybe we can bait him with GB. GB, you can go debilitate. Nice. Nice. One more hit. Wingate. Oh, he hadn't a chance to reload. Wolfang with the decap. He gets it. Let's go. Never risked. Never lost. Never punished. Beautiful. And we get three bones out of it. Oh, that's sick. That means we can make the glorious attachment of bones. We'll do that after our training camp, though. Or we're getting attacked again. Okay, well, prediction over, prediction reset. No one died. Thank you, GB. Thank you for all How that many help. How times have I told you, chat? These spins are getting too scary. I won't survive. But now... It's a brand new fight. This shouldn't be a hard fight, but depending on what Legion likes to spin, uh, it really depends. And it depends on the green skin. Now, this is a very weird scripted fight. It's this one has two become leaders. vestigial. Useless. Yeah, useless is the right word. But does the green skin become useless? Oh, yeah, possibly. That's a that's just a skirmisher. Not too bad. Thank you, Ralph. Yeah, I don't feel bad about this fight, even though it's two leaders. See, Caravan sometimes has scripted fights that forcibly attack you. Uh, oh, Lunatics is out of armor. That's bad. Hmm. And this feels like such a fight. And I can't complain. Because we're probably going to rip them a new one. Probably. They've got no archer, that means they have to fall towards us. So I'm just going to wait for them. Just waiting, just waiting. May as well start up and say hi to them, though. Uh, gunshot, I could barely reach here. Is that worth a shot? Yeah, it's worth a shot. Fifty-five didn't work, that's fine. Oh! The AI likes to know when you finished your turn, so it can abuse you. Thanks, AI. And I missed a 41. Okay, I'm gonna go abuse you now, AI. Ow! Okay, I see how it is. You're gonna play dirty. So you can play at that game, buddy. Yeah, now you're fleeing. Who's the who's the real failure now? Yeah, yeah, there goes your hand. Yeah, how do you feel about that? Jerk. Now he's dead. So you think rushing my line as a pole arm is smart? Yeah. Yeah, sure you do. Okay, they're trying to kill the goblin. I will try and shoot the monk. Or do we shoot the... Let's yeah, just shoot the raider. That's fine. Shooting the monk would be really good, but he's hard to get to. Hard to get to on that angle. Okay, Wingate with the 10%. Proves me wrong. I'm not complaining. Hmm, you mock shot, stabbed, and killed that man all for doing his job. Yep. And uh, I'm glad you noticed. <laughs> How can I live with myself? Well, I can live with myself better than him. <laughs> I don't think he can live with himself. He's dead on the floor. <laughs> I think that's the difference, Obi-Wan. <laughs> I have the ability to live with myself. <laughs> he does not. 
<laughs> and whose fault is that? Hey, hey, now who's pointing the finger? Oh, 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 now who's pointing the finger? I see how it is. You kill a man and somebody starts pointing fingers. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see how it is. Oh, hello back there. Oh, you've returned, have you? Yes, and you're desperate for some pets. Is that what it is? Hello. Are you happy? Yes, you are very happy now. Big purrs. Yes. Okay, so. Good kill by Mandy. We can set up a debilitate for next turn. And... I can't do anything with star phase yet. I'd like to set up top flank, though. Oh, and you've sprawled out, Mount. Good for you. Gold hand. Yep, there we go. That's what I wanted. Uh, GB with the snipe. Beautiful snipe, though. Oh, no! Top flank! Oh, no! I'm a little bit swarmed at the moment. Hmm. Fifteen percent doesn't work. Top flank is gonna struggle. Forty-six does not work. Starface, don't die, buddy. You have a stupid ox next to you. I'm sure he's just a temporary problem. Um, Tina, maybe you could. There we go. Thank you, Tina. Huge play. Huge. Okay, everyone else is kind of sorted. Kind of. I'm a monster and I'm calling people stupid. Hey, 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 hey. Am I wrong is the real question you must be asking. You're fine with murder but mocking me. <laughs> now we see where your allegiances lie. How could you be fine with murder and not be fine with mockery? You know, murder leads to mockery, okay? It is just a complete... A to B step. You should know this. It happens every time. Every single time. And uh, I can't help it. I can't help but just go with the flow of it. Life goes on and on and on. And so do the insults. <laughs> all of you have all been saying that. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. Okay, 2547. Why is that a 25? Fine, we go for the 47 and adrenaline. Let's hope that works. Go for the double hit. 13? No. Maybe. Maybe not. Maybe not. Uh Britt Churchill, thanks for the follow, man. Welcome to the stream. Glad you're enjoying. Uh do I go for the 67? I do successfully. To break this stupid shield wall someday. Nice 70 from Tina. The dude, stop fleeing, dude. Somebody's gonna hit you eventually. Korax breaks the shield wall with a 37. Let's go. Huge hit. And Sing, this has gotta be it, right? Really? 34? Really? You were rolling on 50s? Oh, because he shield walled. Stupid 34. Okay, let's taunt the dude because he's annoying. 52, that's fine. Ooh, 30%. Not so fine, but we'll live with it. I accidentally shot my bros, and uh, accidentally, but it's fine. Did I debilitate my own bros? Okay, I didn't. Good. I didn't do that. I'm glad I didn't make that mistake. Uh, but now we can beat up Haunt the Ox because he's by himself and he's really upset. Oof, he's really upset. GB Prox has nine lives. Uh, the other Ox, because it's the Ox Brothers at the moment. The other Ox is the only one left. Hey, dude. Uh, sorry about your brother. But uh, had to be done. You know, part of the job and all that. 
He'll be fine with it. And even if not, he won't live long enough to be fine with it anyways. Hey, Lutex gets the kill on the way out. That's very nice. No survivors, chat. No survivors. Okay, let's keep cycling around. And let's chase this dude down. Mm-hmm. Okay, the ghost is trying his best. Oh, I probably should have thrown some sand at him. That would have been nice. But eventually he'll crack, or his shield will crack. One of those will happen first. We're rolling on sevens. Sheesh, that's kind of bad. He's not even... He's not even Lone Wolf. Yikes. Tina's rolling on 50, 58s. She was rolling on 70s before the shield wall. Which is kind of nice. 15s and 40s. Do I go for the gunshot? Uh, it hurts my own allies. But it's the last gunshot of the game. Could have been worse. And I also shouldn't have debilitated my own bros. Probably shouldn't have, but you it's fine. Be doing a spin when I specifically said not to, chat. Ah, fudge. I swear I'll turn this stream around. That's why I wanted to kill him quick. Chat, why are you spinning at this time? The free kill. Oh, wait. He's the only dude left. Okay, you wanted to speed up the fight. Who am I to question you, chat? Sakael, I appreciate it. He's literally the only dude left. That saves me some time. Appreciate it. And that means maybe a chance of getting his loot? Eh, not really. Oh well. Oh well, we get a little bit of something. Not much. Completely rigged, but I appreciate it regardless. Um, let's swap that out for that. Should be fine. That was an easy predict to make. Yeah, it was not a hard fight. Definitely was not a hard one. Oh, fudge. I had dev tools still on. I need to turn this off. I need to get rid of it. Debug mode off. There we go. Dev tools are off. We save. Nicely done on the prediction. It was only nine dudes attacking us, and it was two leaders. And leaders aren't too difficult. They're annoying. But at this stage of the game, we can handle them. It's just that dude takes forever to kill because he keeps shield walling with a good shield with good stats, with good dodge. It's just with the whole works. Uh, we go Sling Mastery or Quick. Probably Sling Mastery is a good choice. Gives me more reason to go buy a good sling. Stefan, shall we? Let's go for Pickaxe Mastery before we forget. Uh, and pickaxes are hammers, so we go for the hammer mastery into maybe like Killing Frenzy and Berserk and stuff. We'll, we'll sort that out later. But one is not a great roll, but everything else is pretty good, so we'll take it. Let's go for HP roll, and that is all the levels for now. The training camp continues. Let's not get attacked again. Oh, but we are going a bit of a distance. And we're not healing, so I need to stop the training camp. Put two injuries on. Damn, guild hand needs that smashed hand fixed. And then we go back to training. Okay, and then we should be fine. What's the closest build to a stealth archer you could make? Um, Not in Legends, but I made an amazing stealth archer in Magic Mod. Oh, there's war upon us. Is it the... It's a holy war. Great. We hate the south anyways. Bunch of jerks. Um, yeah, in the magic mod you can make a goblin archer and they're flipping stealthy as heck. Because they can hide in bushes. Uh, but when it comes to legend stealth archer. Ooh, metal joint covers. Nice. That's actually a really difficult item to get unless you get some really good stock. 
Um, stealth archer, stealth archer. I mean, you can use blend in. And that's kind of a stealth archer. You can play the Assassin Origin and play pretty stealthy. Um, there's a jumping from bush to bush, you can do that as well. But I'd say there's no real like stealth archer in the game. But blend in would be one of your major choices for stealth archering or stealthing in general. Because uh, it reduces the chance an enemy attacks you. It's not like great, but it helps a little bit. And also using bushes to your advantage. So there's no real like build per se that makes you a stealth archer. It's more like map map usage. And if you have fine bushes or not. Um having bros in front with shields kind of protects your archers. Yeah. I mean you can make assassins with the assassin runs that go invisible. So then you can kind of really make a stealth archer. That's that's like literally stealth. But once again, that requires bushes. A lot of things really require bushes. Yeah. Yeah, this game isn't built on its stealth. It did get updated, though, a little while ago, and they fixed the stealth mechanics. And I appreciate them for that, because that's the gigantic. The stealth mechanics are actually good now. They're really good. And I think a game with bad stealth mechanics really hurts your creativity. So, the fact that they got updated is really nice. But not much capitalizes on that these days. It's more of just positioning and stuff. Yeah. A little bit more in other mods, I think. Uh, Chives, good job on the three. Good job on the four and... Yeah, I think you need fatigue. Just a little bitty bit, right? Because balance is based off of what now? At least 70 initiative. Ooh, wait. Mm, wait a minute. Let's grab balance now to see how we're looking. Plus six. Plus ten. Plus nine. Okay, so balance is a bit rough. Also, a maimed foot ruining your initiative is pretty bad too. But we do have a plus five, a plus three, and a plus four health. Let's hope that helps a little bit. Hmm. You're not super desperate for fatigue. But the initiative might help a little bit with the keeping up the balance. Uh, GB level 11! Nicely done. Let's get you some health, because you are a little bit low on the health. And let's get you nimble to be safe. Because we don't trust your survivability at times. There you go. And you're sitting on a 47. That's pretty good. Lunatics! We would like... Probably helpful now. Ah, you know what? Screw it. Let's go Relentless first. Helpful and Bags and Belts can be his last thing that we get for him. It'll be fine. Oh, and he needs his stats. That's true. Uh, four. Oh, did you hear a noise, Mal? Oh, no. Noises. Uh, that's a four, that's a four, and that's a three health. I'm very tempted by that three attack. I think that three attack will make a bigger difference in the long run. 66 attack, we'll take it. Even though he's a tank, it doesn't hurt to have a couple points in attack. Wolfang, shall we go for that tackle right now? Yep. You can do it with a shield out. I called it! I was pretty sure it could be done. And I'm okay with it. How much How much fatigue is it? 23! Oy, 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 oy. You need more fatigue, but you didn't roll a 4. Let's go HP first. And hope you roll some fatigue later on. That'll be nice. Uh, Korax! Can't get you Threads of Fate just yet. We can get you Inscription Mastery, though. That's kind of nice.
And is that all the levels? No, we missed Cake. Uh, Cake is going Spear Mastery, so let's give that to him. He'll eventually want a Spear like Tina. But right now, Spear Mastery is benefited on Glaives, because they are technically Spears. So I'm kind of okay with him just holding on to that. Also, I'm super keen on these metal joint covers. I think 2 for 35, 6 for 30. Hmm, 35 is better. Even though this does give 30, 30 extra durability. But Tina's balanced at the literal 20 fatigue, so I can't go any heavier. I'll have to give this to someone else. Okay, nicely done. Great. Great work. We'll probably be finishing up soon, chat. So I think what we can do... Uh, it's none of those. Unless this envoy is really close. 4.4k for Crumhorn? How far is Crumhorn? Fudge! It's across the map! No, I don't think I can do that. No, get more bros? Yes, I was trying to buy another bro before we finished up today. That is true. So thank you for reminding me. I didn't want to forget. Also, screw it. I'll keep that food till it dies. Buy you guys a little bit of bread. Sell some of these. Sell one of those. How many spins do you guys have to gamble on? I've had it up to here with the gambling. I'm pretty sure there's a little bit more gambling going to be happening. Let's get rid of the undead helmets. I hate them. They're so inefficient. Uh, malicious speed. Actually, I'll keep that sickle. It's not a good idea to keep the sickle, but I will keep it. God, they suck. Uh, I need a famed sickle. We need to save up some money. Get some famed items. Uh, pickaxe we actually need. I can't lose the pickaxe. Gotta remind myself I'm doing unorthodox builds. And we need to try and remember to keep those items. Uh, I don't need the military. Oh, actually, wait, maybe I do need the military pick. Oh, no, he's dead, isn't he? Fudge. There goes my one-handed duelist. Guess I don't need that military pick anymore. Because he's dead. Yep. Yep, a Rooney's. Hundred bucks goes to me. Sucks to be that. Okay, well, let's clean up everything else. Could probably shred those for tools, but I may as well just buy some tools. They're pretty cheap. Uh, yeah. yeah. Poor Dorm, no matter how much he comes back to the game, he just wants him dead. Yep. That's his second character, too. He's completely dead. By the way, did you hear the noise? Did you go see what the noise was? Was it another cat outside? Was it the end of the world? Oh, it was the end of the world, wasn't it? Oh. Look at you. Hey, at least you're safe with me. Yeah, look how happy you are. And flop. Okay, let's cuddle you up. You'll never be let go. And then let's, uh... Probably sell the Rusty Warblade. It kind of sucks. Don't need those. Really don't need the pitchfork at this stage. I don't know why I'm holding on to it. Usual snowman goblin noises. Loot goblin noises. Sell those. I don't need them. I have too many of those as well. Okay, that's a little bit better. Uh, I probably need to buy these meds because they're super cheap. And... New bro? Not many options. Very bad options. Shield Expert Tanky Caravan Hand. Uh, I need DPS. I don't need tanks. I've got decent tanks. I need DPS. Okay. So, let's ditch the Envoy, because it's too far away. Let's quickly run it back to Gerheim and Bramingborg. Now, the yellows, I was meant to be picking on them for a very long time. But for some reason, we had a ceasefire. Oh, Sing's got a spin. I forgot about that. Yes, I do need to do spin. Thank you very much for the spin. Um, but yeah, we had a ceasefire with the yellows, just because I got lazy and stopped attacking them. So now they don't hate me anymore. So... 
I, I guess they're friendly. Oh, it's a yellow. Sing! Big congratulations on the yellow. What would you like to see? You currently have need for a weapon and a helmet, maybe. Or a perk point. Wouldn't say no to that. Hmm. Power did update, they changed keybinds. Fudge! I have to go change my keybinds back. Bunch of jerks. 18 gigabyte package. Sheesh. Sing says weapon. Okay, let's hope we get you the weapon you need. Let's hope. No, it's the one headed hammer for the dude that died. Dormammu, we miss you. We miss you already. And then two handed cleaver with minus three. Ooh, that's nice. That could be given to Wolfang. He already has a minus three cleaver. But this one's better. Seven. Nine. Hmm. Don't know if you can change the keybinds. Uh, I can show you where the keybinds are. You can change keybinds. I did that before because I hate the keybinds that are originally in, in Pal World. I keep fat fingering Q and stuff and throwing out balls that I don't need to throw out. Not with this update. Okay, I'll have a look at it. Okay, Sing says my choice. Um, it's a minus two one in a hammer. Okay, you know what's going to make me decide? Fudge. I kind of want the hammer. Because I want to do that one-handed hammer build. I don't want to miss out. But I need to find a good bro that can use the one-handed hammer. I know the cleaver can be used. It doesn't have bonus damage on it, which is sad. The hammer does have bonus damage. Oh wait, that's not a that's not an that's not an axe, it's a hammer. So I would need to find a blacksmith. When is the Alright, when's the last time I've ever seen a blacksmith in this game? They're so rare, if not even around anymore. Blacksmith. Maybe an apprentice could have blacksmith hammers. Fudge. I think I have to go cleaver. I think I have to go cleaver because the chance of me finding a blacksmith is just really hard. And eventually I had my um, minus three hammer, maybe. Maybe that's what I'd be holding out for. Before I decide what, I do want to go up here. The castle. I did check new bros. I did. You missed out, Obi-Wan. I was checking the new bros. Um, Northern Silver Lance. Ooh, 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 that's nice as well. Okay, let me... Okay, what's what's the what's the stuff we could buy here? Return item, coin delivery, escort caravan. Caravan! Are we going south five days to Yulin Mark? Ooh, that's really good. That's huge caravan. Okay, let's go to the castle first. Come back for the caravan. Come on, castle. Come on. Come on. Give me a good bro. Before nightfall, it hit night. Why do I have no movement speed? Darn slow bros. Playing Pokemon all over again. Okay. There we go. Check the bros. So. Do you have... You've got Gravesman. Okay, this dude is built for the famed shovel. We do not have a famed shovel. Apprentice. Mm, no. Mason, do you have... No. He's got no good stats either. But it was nice to see if he did have what I was looking for. Gravesman, that means you're shoveling. Now, if only we got a famed shovel, chat. We would be fine right about now. You know what? Call me in crazy. Call me crazy. But I think masons should have blacksmith hammers. Or ironmongers. Maybe I'm... Maybe I'm just thinking both should have it. 
Both should have it. Because if miners have pickaxe mastery and gravesmen, grave robbers and grave diggers have shovel master guaranteed, then masons and uh, blacksmiths and what else is the other one that I just said? Ironmongers should have blacksmith hammers guaranteed. They just should. But then again, that's my hot take of the day. Brawler gets kicking and nine lives and dear God, he's got good stats. Uh, he doesn't have hammer. Didn't he have it? No, 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 he didn't have it. He just had normal hammer mastery. See, the thing is, hammer mastery is different to, to what I'm looking for. I'm looking for the stats, the the um, the specific weapon mastery on tier one and tier three. So it's called blacksmith hammers and it's called um, something else. There's, this, there's another one that's called. There's two perks I'm looking for. Yeah, I don't think he had it. Save scum Alps and they became direwolves. Ha, ah, that's cool. That's cool. But he has adaptive? Oh, adaptive could work. I don't know if adaptive works, though. We could science it. Science show! If we can... No, no. If we can adaptive it, that'd be sick, Neob. I need to try it. I need to try it. Then I don't have to worry about other characters having it or not having it. I just dismissed him. I hit the wrong button. I was too happy. You have faith in the Force? Hopefully the Force is with us. I am one with the Force and the Force is with me. We hire him. We cheat and level him up. Debug mode on. True believer. Because we believe. He's balanced because we believe. He's perfect because we believe. He doesn't have hammer mastery. Fudge. Um, unarmed mastery. We believe. Now. We give him the good hammer. And he will learn blacksmith group. Ha ha! It can be adaptive. Boy, he doesn't have hammer mastery. <laughs> he just doesn't have hammer mastery. It sucks. I mean, he does get the blacksmith techniques, which is insanely good. And it's down to 11 fatigue. Normally, he's what? Normally, it's 12 fatigue. I can get it down to 11 because of perfect fit. But with 11 times 2, you can't do rebound. So, we don't have to hunt for blacksmith techniques. And blacksmith heavy hammer. We just need to hunt for adaptive. That's insanely good now. That's all I have to hunt for. And hammer mastery, because he doesn't get hammer mastery for free. So, this dude sucks. But he's got such good attack. Wait, did he actually turn out with good attack? 64. Holy freaking crap, he's good. But I can't handle it. If he doesn't have a rebound, he's going to fatigue out. He's going to stam out. And then also destroy armor is really nice. But it's just the stamina problem. Nothing fixes it. Take him and just do unarmed. I could, I could, but I want to go with this hammer that we just got. Instead of the cleaver, and I want to find a reason to use it instead. And he could have been the reason. Could have been. Is this with multiple people with hammer mastery? Yeah, but they weren't good stats. And did they have what I was looking for, which is adaptive and hammer mastery? This dude has adaptive. Uh, he has hammer mastery. Does he have adaptive? He does not. Okay. So do we test out you? Hammer Mastery. No Adaptive. Hammer Mastery. No Adaptive. Hammer Mastery. No Adaptive. I'm sensing a trend. Okay, you're useless. You weren't going to need it anyways. Um, hmm, Hammer Mastery, no Adaptive. So, yeah, I find the trend to be problematic. Try an Inventor, Inventor could work, they would seem to probably have both of those. They just don't usually have good stats. Hmm, 
he only has a one. No, he's useless. Squire is expensive. Hammer Mastery? Adaptive! Yeah, but he only has the one attack. I might get the Squire as a last resort. Because he probably has decent starting stats and he has a Paranoia. So maybe, maybe we could go with the Squire, but I'll use him as a last resort. Okay, you're useless. I was spending so much money trying all these guys out. Ooh! No Hammer Mastery. Fodge! And no Adaptive. Dang, Beast Slayers are good, though. He's good, too. No Hammer Mastery. No Adaptive. Man, we've gone through so many bros. Okay, I think we have to go with the Squire. As much as I hate to say it, we gotta go with the Squire. He also has... Student. Gifted. Uh, he's got Fast Adaptation. So he's got a lot of things. Except he costs, like, so freaking much. Hate Squires for that reason. But for the first time in forever, I'm willingly at hiring a Squire. And dear God, he rolled well. His, oh, his health is so bad, though. But, but, he rolled well. So Sing, after all that deliberation, we're going with the hammer. Thank you kindly. And our brand new one-headed hammer, does he have Duelist? He does have Duelist. Okay, I didn't even check. Thank God he's got Duelist. He's got Adaptive. Where is it? There's Adaptive. Adaptive Duelist Hammer Mastery. That means he's going to go like 100% am armor... Re oh my god. Chat. He's going to have 100% armor ignore. We're obviously going to be going fearsome with this build. Uh, do we go recover or rebound? We probably go medium. Steel. Resilient. That's 10 perks. Recover or rebound? The Viper seeks to claim its quarry at last. Mm, the quarry will be mined out with this hammer. Definitely. What makes rebound so good? Rebound's insane, man. How many spins do you guys have to gamble on? I've had it up to here with the gambling. I think Rebound's one of the strongest perks you can ever have in Legends. One of the strongest. Absolutely. Uh, one of, near, near the top of my list. Five fatigue per turn when over 90% fatigued. It means you get 50, 20 fatigue per turn. It makes you so fatigue neutral on so many builds. It solves so many build problems in the game. It makes one-handed weapons good. It makes two-handed weapons even better. It makes uh, some ranged builds even better. And it's usually not used on ranged builds, though. But it's mostly used on melee builds. It makes tanks literally godlike, because you can shield wall every turn. That, like, like rebound is literally top tier. I, it'd be, I'm hard-pressed to find a perk that's better than rebound in the game. If it ever gets nerfed, it's going to crush Legends. It literally will crush Legends. So I don't ever want to see it nerfed. It's just such a good perk. Rebound, uh, with neutral neutral builds being so important in this game, fatigue neutral because of how long fights can go on, how dangerous enemies can be, um, infinite shield walls being so important against things like white, white wolves and stuff, yeah. It only works that builds that tease the fatigue cap though, right? Yeah, but you'd be surprised to know how many builds that is. You'd be very surprised to know how many builds that is. That's a lot. That's like at least over half of the builds of the game. There's only a couple of builds in the game that really need a ton of fatigue that need to recover. So basically, rebound solves 75%, in my opinion, 75% of fatigue problems for most builds, and recover solves the other 25%. Um, and then maybe the secret 1% Get solved with uh, Battle Flow. Nerf Rebound got it. Abyss, if you dare touch that man. 
You nerf my freaking nets. You nerf so much. Why do you only come in here at this time and listen to me when I'm talking about stuff like this, Abyss? Don't you even think about it. God. The nerve of that guy. The nerve. Rebound solves like 75% of builds. Recover is 25% and the secret 5% is uh, battle flow. Yeah, that's, that's how the game works. That's how Legends has worked for a very long time. Oh, oh wait, no, 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 sorry, I'm wrong. I'm wrong, Mind of Her Body is like 10%. You can do a lot with Mind of Her Body. But Rebound works with Mind of Her Body as well to make it even better. Yeah, I totally forgot Mind of Her Body. I haven't done any of those builds in ages. Because I've done a lot of those builds in the past, and we're doing experiments, and I don't need to do Mind of Her Body experiments anymore. I've already done enough of those experiments in the past. But yeah, so... Uh, as much as everybody says Mind of Her Body is great, it is. It is, but I still think Rebound's better. You put one perk point into it, you don't have to invest very much. Would you add Rebound Mind Over Body to Ended Sword Build? Yeah, that's on my video. My video on the Mind Over Body to Ended Sword Build includes Rebound for one of its options, and did not includes... excludes the Rebound for the other option. Yeah, it works. Okay, so let's get the name in here. And let's spin, and let's see what we get. But yeah, I've got multiple build videos um, that explain those sorts of things. And definitely, definitely have rebound on them. For good reasoning. Okay. And it's name spin time! Who is going to be our lovely... No. No! <laughs> no freaking way! He just freaking died! Dormammu, I've come to bargain! Why are you back? Why are you back with the exact same build after like 25 people at least are in this name list? How? How is it possible? It's not possible! It's not freaking possible! Dear God, we're stuck in a time loop with the time stone. It's freaking destiny. The only thing that's not the same is his first bro was not a one-handed hammer build. It was the woodcutter axe. His second build was the one-handed hammer, and now his third build's the one-handed hammer. It's not. It's destiny spoken. We want to see this build happen. We need to see this build happen. Because the game will not allow us otherwise. Sheesh. He just can't stop. He can't be stopped, chat. It's that simple. It's that freaking simple. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. Okay, so what, what am I missing on him? Um, I need to stop one other perk. I've got too many perks. I need to get down to nine. Uh, I think Gifted's very important for his defense. Uh, I think I dodge Fearsome. He's already going through armor so easily, Fearsome seems like a waste. Yeah, I think I have to dodge Fearsome. Three times is not the charm for him. Hey, maybe it is. Maybe. If he dies again, then... I don't know how he's going to come in as a fourth. No idea. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, we save that. Nicely done. Uh, there's a level up I missed. And then there's a spin I need to do as well. So let's spin, do the level up. So Cake, let's get you... Oh, the stats. I forgot to give him stats. God, Cake, you need to start rolling better. Random events. We'll take those. Happily take those. Thank you very much, Obi-Wan, for the random events. And we'll see what we get. You want to buy my giant skull and bones for a thousand bucks? Go away. You're a lunatic. I want to keep those. And apparently our lovely Spartan just doesn't want to eat, which is good. Sing gets into a brawl with everybody else. Good job. And then I'll give you one more, because we didn't do much with the first three. And ooh! 
It's a heavy stone throwing competition, and Goldhand and Sing get a permanent max fatigue each. We are simple creatures throwing stones. We are. Except, I might argue that throwing little stones across water is a lot more fun than throwing big stones for weight competitions. I don't know. Call me crazy. But uh, skipping stones across the water is a lot more fun than that. Hmm. Okay, so that's pretty much the builds that we need to worry about. Dormammu number three, the paranoid. He is paranoid. Give him a cool hat. I think that was his old hat. <laughs> just gets to keep it. There we go. He looks great. Probably don't want to give him the super heavy armor, though. And, uh, yeah. He better survive this time. He better. But that's pretty much it for today, chat. We do have to finish up. I gotta go eat. And I'm still slightly recovering from, you know, exhaustion and all that. But I'm doing okay. I'll look after the wife, see if she's doing alright. She's probably okay. I haven't heard her in a couple of hours or so. But she's probably just been asleep, and I probably woke her up by yelling. I'll figure it out and tell you if I survived the um, the journey. <laughs> we'll find that out together, chat, tomorrow. Um, but yeah, we've got lovely Battle Brothers and some Pal World. Well, Pal World tomorrow, then some Battle Brothers, and then we've got some tape to tape. But I've got hockey, so it's going to be a delayed tape to tape. So that should be lots of fun. Uh, I love the team and how far it's going. We're finalizing some builds here. We're not using evasion as often as we could, but it's good for assassinating like necros and ghosts, which I should be using more often for that. Uh, I don't think I'm loving the axe too much. I might have to switch this out for the great axe because of the current fatigue issues, because rebound adrenaline seems to be a bit tricky to handle with the fatigue. We'll see how that goes. But for most other situations, uh, the builds are doing well. And I'm liking them. I'm thinking the dodge medium seems to be fun. Diagrin finds it very hard to die. Can't wait for the Spear Wall to come online. Can't wait for the Sickle to come online. We got, we're waiting for a couple of weapons, a couple of levels. Uh, and it's still weird that Gul'dan can't sprint. I don't know what's up with that. Really don't know. But uh, for the most part, most of the builds are doing okay. Some are a little bit disappointing, like the piercing shot on a bow. But I like it. I like it. We're having a lot of fun. Sarkos blew up the base again. Okay, well, you take care of the base. And for everyone else, have a good rest. I'll send you out with the raid to get you extra snowballs and look after the community. I'm glad you guys had fun today. And uh, next week, hopefully we power through some of the late game in this game. And uh, yeah, get some success. Let's push these builds to their limit. There we go, typed it correctly. No worries. Look after yourselves, have a great day, and um, I'm off to lunch. I get to eat some yummies. See us. <laughs>